Monica! Yeah! Hey ho, hey ha, ho ha! Mary, Mary! Mary, you haven't missed it. I'm still going. Pow! Good morning, jewelry makers. How are you today? Hey? It's Friday. It's Friday. Michael, thank you very much for your support there. He's got all the moves. Ow! Do you know what I'd like you to perfect? Maybe, I mean, I'm not going to put the pressure on you now, but maybe a spin, like a Michael Jackson spin, like Michael Wolf used to do there. Oh, ow! Digga, 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 ding, ding, digga, ding, ding, digga, ding, ding. Ha! Right. There we go. Annie, are you okay? Uh, so we're gonna, we've, we've got an amazing show today. Michael's on cameras. King is on floor. Good morning, my love. Oh, she's got all the stuff. She's got all the stuff. We have got the queen of jewellery making. The one, the only, Linda Bramwell. <laughs> With her box. With my box. With your box. My box. Um, I apologise, I'm not quite sorted. Oh. <laughs> We've got production manager Ali directing the show today. Hello. Hi, gang. Hi. And here is Neri Nunu hitting that desk. He is ready for today's show, aren't you, love? We've got an amazing show. It's going to be absolutely brilliant. It is Oyster Day. Oyster! Oyster Day live on Jewelry Maker. Now, we are going to go to the Wall of Fame in a second, just to let you know. But basically, we've got everything from spiny oyster turquoise today, which I love it. 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 This absolute beauty. First time I've ever, I've ever bought strands to air. Um, I have never, I personally have never bought strands to air before. It makes me so happy that we're able to bring this to you today. Uh, very, very, very exciting uh, that we've got these strands, particularly those lovely rounds. I can't wait. It's going to be amazing. We've got Dave Troth with us from uh, 10 to 11, I think, bringing us gorgeous pearls, brand new strands of pearls, which are going to be absolutely amazing. Linda's got all of the shells today. If there is a world shell shortage, it's because Linda Brumwell has them all. Oh, you are going to be shell-shocked today. You're absolutely right. So that's going to be very exciting. Her nine o'clock kits are all about gorgeous pearls, like pearls and pearls and pearls and gorgeous jewelry that she's made as well. So we'll talk to Linda when she's all kind of set up and ready. Um, but let's go to the Wall of Fame to see some of your incredible pieces on this Friday, the 12th of August. <laughs> Right, okay, so the Wall of Fame is a chance for you to showcase your incredible pieces of jewellery that you make with Jewellery Maker items. Take a photo of them, email it to studio at jewellerymaker.com. Every week, every Wednesday, we pick a winner and a runner-up who win £100 or £50 credited to their Jewellery Maker account. Let's start off this morning with lovely Nikki, 250. <gasps> this is my kind of feed bidding. Uh, hi, this is my entry to the Wall of Fame. I was asked to make a cowboy boot and cowboy hat. They're for a lady who goes line dancing. All components are from JM. Good luck to my fellow offers. I love that. That is super cool. Don't be my heart, make me heart. Lorraine Smith, you're number 251. Oh, yeah, there we go. Gorgeous, gorgeous jewellery there. Uh, this entry is shades of blue shell pearl uh, with silver plated findings, all components from JM. Stay cool, everyone, says Lorraine. I know, hasn't it been? Unbearably hot. Uh, Fran Porter, you're number 252. Morning, all. I've attached what I think uh, Alison challenged uh, the white onyx by. Oh, I see. I see. Uh, wrapped by an oh, Ouroboros. Oh, gosh. I, I, there are lots of words in here. I have no idea what they mean. Uh, which could be classed as a dragon. Okay. I like that. 
You can see the back to see how I've attached the beast to the by, right? I'm not skilled enough and don't have the talent to add the legs on the dragon this, uh, this tiny, but I was able to take, uh, to add a tail using a Viking knit. My eyes are some tiny diopsides from my gem, so I hope you like it. Keep the faith. That's gorgeous. You've done such a lovely job. I love those eyes and his little snout. That's gorgeous. Well done, Fran. Now we've got a lovely entry here from uh, Mary Inglesis uh, Gaza. Wow, that's a name and a half. Wow, oh my word, look at that beautiful necklace and earring set. That's gorgeous. Dear JM, it's been so long since I've sent an entry to the Wall of Fame. My friend and I are having an exhibit uh, slash stall at the Musical Museum in Brentford on the first weekend of September as part of the annual Creative Mile event. This year's theme is colour. So I had to quickly make some new pieces for today as we were taking them over to the event's Instagram account. I see, after rummaging through my stash, I decided to feature Amatrine as if it's uh, by colour nature. Uh, I made a wire work leaf pendant using gold coloured silver plated wire inspired by the Amatrine ovals. I finished the necklace uh, with gold plated finings and some matching statement earrings with the same gemstones. More power. Uh, to all, uh, more power to all, and best of luck to the other Wall of Fame entries. Thank you, Mary. That's absolutely gorgeous. Love what you've made there. Sarah Beswick. Hello, my lovely. Good morning. You're number 254. Uh, please find a tattoo entry to the Wall of Fame rose quartz and eight OC beads in a necklace, bracelet, and earring set. All from JM. Apart from the angel wings, which are from my stash. I hope you like them. Good luck to all. That's from Sarah. That's gorgeous. Well done, stunning. Kim! Oh, you know when we've got Kim Hopkins, we have Alan as well. So we've got Kim Hopkins here. Please find attached my, my tree to the Wall of Fame. It's a wire work pendant I made with gold, a plated base metal wire, and a square cabbage and labradorite stone. Photo doesn't do the stone justice. All components are from JM. Good luck to everyone entering. Great shows this week. Uh, got uh, some lovely deals. Stay safe, everyone. That's from Kim. Thank you, my darling. And here's Alan. Alan Hopkins. Please find attach my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I got this 925 silver tab set bracelet at an unbelievable Jeff price and have set tanzanite, fire opal, selenite and Burmese spinel. I love them. Got four more to set uh, with all components from JM. Good luck to everyone. Great demos and deals this week. Thank you. Stay safe. Woo! There you go. Fantastic. So you're really talented. It's amazing. Coming up. It's coming up, it's there. We've got silk alike. Oh, silk alike in white and in black as well. It's light silk, but on longer reels and it's vegan friendly. It's amazing, absolutely gorgeous stuff. And it's uh, actually stronger than your silk as well, which is brilliant. So that's gonna be coming your way in this hour. That's your early bird special. Great for things like your pearl knotting, which is wonderful. Okay, shall we get going? We've got loads and loads and loads of incredible things. Woo! Yeah. Let's start off this morning with some natural spinel. Oh, yeah, because that's how we roll here on uh, Jewelry Maker. Uh, get involved with us in three different ways, either by calling us on our free phone number, which is 0800 644 or by getting involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com, or by downloading our app and uh, watching us on the go. It's entirely up to you. Loving these gorgeous colours you're going to be getting here. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. We're at $49.99. Is that where he launched, Neary? That's where this incredible strand launched. Totally 100% natural Mahenge Spinel. Loving these gorgeous, uh, uh, beautiful purples. Such a rarity as well. Here we go. Already taking that price point down. Already people interested. We're going to be very, very busy today. $29.99. Went very well at that price. And then we dropped it to this price. Here we go, everyone. So from 49.99 to 29.99 to 19.99. Oh yes, absolutely incredible. Now that's more affordable than what we took this. Uh, well, than what we bought this for. Can I show you what I would uh, what I would use this as? Spaces, spaces. Ha! Ah! Spacer, 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 spacer. Spacer, 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 spacer. Fourteen ninety nine. That's your deal today. Well done, Kim in Bristol. Fantastic. Well done to you. Fant I literally just spat all over the desk. I'm sorry about that. 
Well, I said the S in Bristol. I'm sorry about that. Silk Alike is on pre-order if you want to add it onto your order. Great for doing things like your pearl knotting. It's incredibly uh, priced already, everyone. Oh, yeah, you're going to need things to set your pearls with today. You're going to need it. It's all on pre-order. Well done. $14.99 for you today. There's a silk alike. $7.99 on pre-order. Just get it. Go, go, go. Open your order because you know you're going to be buying today. You know you're going to be opening your order relatively soon. Well done. $14.99. Gorgeous. Lavender amethyst. Big, chunky, beautiful rounds. Look at the size of those. Huge natural lavender amethyst. There they are, 250 carats in total. <whistles> yes, with jadeite. Oh, with this beautiful strand of aquamarine cubes, maybe. Oh, my word. Put them with the gorgeous pearls. Ollie's had a haircut. Let's have a look, Ollie. Let's have a look, Ollie. We'll have a look at the hair in a minute. 250 carats of your lavender amethyst. Here we go, everyone. <laughs> 19.99. Oh, yeah, that's gorgeous. Beautiful summery uh, colours in here. But you know what? We don't want to do that today. We want to go all the way down under a tenner. Yes, well done, Helen. Gorgeous. 9.99. There you go, everyone. What a treat. What a deal. There you go. Go, 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 go. Well done. Maker and County Durham, well done to you as well. Set this price point down again. Christine Jane, well done to you. Fantastic. Go, go, go. Rhea in Somerset. Oh my word, there's so many people coming through to get this. At eight pounds and 99 pence. Well done. So many wonderful um, uh, um, uh, delicate tones coming out of here. And in Greater London, through now. This is great to see. Well done. Taking that price point down again. They're absolutely flying at $7.99 now. Jane in Merseyside. Sydney in Essex, well done to you as well. Texas, let us know what you're doing today. Let us know what you're up to today. Hopefully you're inside and staying cool. Because I tell you what, it is boiling out there. It, uh, yeah, I'm glad to be inside with the, uh, with the air con on. Oh, my word. It was hot yesterday. Chris in Norfolk, well done to you. Fantastic to see you today. Well done to everyone joining us this morning. This is great to see. Well done. Rhea's now through and checking her basket out. That's great to see. Well done. Five opportunities remaining at $7.99 for huge 10 mil rounds of your lavender amethyst. This is absolutely brilliant. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, Ollie, are you pleased with the haircut? Can we have a, can we have a quick, a quick look? Oh. Oh, very, very sharp. Very, very nice. Oh, yes, to keep it short on the sides because of the greys, the white hairs are coming through. Are you all set up over there, lovely, uh, lovely Linda? <laughs> she needs to switch on. There we go. There we go. Just turn herself on. There you go. She's surrounded by so many so many lovely pieces of jewellery. London blue topaz, topside drilled, faceted pairs. There they all are, everyone. Oh. $39.99. Oh. Nikki. Hi, Carol. Linda King and Michael, Ollie and Neary. Today is my birthday. Carol, would you please sing happy birthday to me? Here we are, happy birthday, but a puppy daddy died, oh daddy, but a papa happy birthday, da 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 happy birthday, oh yeah, and a pepper, da 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 Okay, one verse is enough. <laughs> oh, King, I love you. We're all there, we're all there today. We're all there for you today, Nikki. Oh, happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, darling. Julie in Hertfordshire. Julie in Hertfordshire. Two in your baskets there. Well done. How do you get around the whole copyright thing? Just don't say the words. Just go, hee da hee da hee da hee da hee da da hee da And, uh, and yeah, yeah. And, uh, yeah, just uh, do like a, a northern club singer version. Here we go. Morning, all. I'm glad that oysters are, the, are dual purpose. I tried eating them. I'd rather make beautiful jewellery with the byproduct of pearl. Yeah, do you know what, Liz? 
I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of eating them. Do you know when they bring, you, you, you see people ordering them at restaurants, you go, what is wrong with you? And they come out and they've got all like, and they bring it out and they put all the like, the, normally on ice, aren't they? And then they bring the Tabasco out and the stuff that you put on, basically trying to mask the flavor of them. Have you ever tried an oyster, Michael? Yeah, not for me. Not for you. Uh, Linda, do you like an oyster? I do actually. Oh, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Meant to be an aphrodisiac, I do actually. Aren't they? The only thing about oysters, you mustn't drink spirits, I think it is, when you're eating oysters. Really? Yeah, there's a reaction, uh, sort of a toxic really? reaction. Perhaps. Oh, well, I didn't know that. Here you are. I think it's, I think really? it's spirits yeah. as opposed to the wine. grape. Yeah. Wine is fine. So just check. Emerald. It's a 40 centimetre strand. Goodness me, that's a big one. 19.99, not your deal today. This is clearance this hour, by the way, as you can probably tell. We've got the Silk Light coming up. It's available on pre-order at 7.99 in black and in white. It's gonna absolutely fight. It already is going, by the way, on pre-order, which is great to see. Taking this all the way down, my lovelies. Here we go. Can you put that message on the thick? I find it very difficult to read, sorry. I'm like this. Julie on the other way, it's my birthday. What? No. No, it's Nikki's birthday today. It can't be your birthday as well, Julie. It's my birthday tomorrow. Had hotel booked for mini break, but caught COVID this morning. I'm negative. Oh, this morning? Oh, yes. Of course, you did have COVID earlier on this week, Julie. And you happened to literally isolate in the garden. That's great. I'm so glad you're, uh, you're negative. Well done. Fantastic. Have a wonderful time, Julie. Are you going with your lovely husband? I hope so. 12.99. Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. It's a go, go, go. Let's do a clear. Yes, don't forget your sticky bead, Matty, if you're going away on holiday. So you can make your jewellery. $9.99. for your emerald faceted two and a half mil rounds. There you go, everyone. Susan, Heather, Iris, Maker, Susan, Ruby. Oh, so many lovely people coming through today. Ruby, you've got three in your basket, my darling. It's 9 99 I'm not surprised that's gorgeous. Only two opportunities remaining. That is it. We're going to move on, everyone. We're moving on. We're moving on. We're moving on. We're moving on. Oh. 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 Guess what? <clears throat> On pre-order right now, you've got your Silk-alike. Silk-alike, 30 have gone already on pre-order. How can I get things on pre-order? So things on pre-order are things like your um, early bed special. We might put kits, we might do, you know, whatever on early bed. Uh, sorry, as, as a uh, pre-order. So go to our website, jewelrymaker.com. Click on uh, watch live, go to pre-order. Okay, or buy ahead. Is it buy ahead or pre-order? I can't remember what the time. Oh, pre-order. There we go. Pre-order. Scroll down. You've got your uh, black and white silk-alike threads. It's absolutely amazing stuff. Use it for all your um, kind of pearl knotting, your silk knotting. It's even stronger than silk. It's slightly waxed and you get it in black and white. Really super long strands uh, that you're going to be getting here, which is amazing. And it's available on pre-order. It's on seven. It's at $7.99 on pre-order. That is not your price today. Well done, Ella, Hoy, Christine, Maker coming through to get the gorgeous um, emerald still. Tanzanite, look at this powerful color you're gonna be getting here. I always think, you can always tell how good a strand of Tanzanite is, is by how powerful that color is on the back of the hand. It always, boom, it's got that incredible pop of color, absolutely superb. It's got that kind of graded quality that you're gonna be getting here. Five chances remaining, that's it, that's all. We've got 79.99, not your deal today, one off price. Here we go, everyone. <laughs> oh, hang on. Maria's already through. She's got two in her basket. Well done, my lovelies. Go, 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 go. One left. Oh, Ria, Susan. Ah, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Ah, come. Oh, yes, this strand is gorgeous. Look at this. Look at these beauties. You little ripper. Last chance saloon. No, I'm not going to get the cowboy hat out again. No, I'm not going to get that back out. I love these. Aquamarine faceted cubes. Don't you love that shape? 
It's like a soft cube, isn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful quality. I love it. Loving those. Oh. Loving those gorgeous, soft, gentle blues. They are gorgeous, aren't they? Absolutely beautiful. We're at 29 pounds and 99 pence. Don't tempt uh, Wayno. He was very, very excited when we had him on the show the other day. He's even more excited about our next, our next show though, aren't you, uh, Wayno? Very excited about our uh, out of this world where there might be laser guns. Ah, yeah. Well done. Eight chances remaining. Aquamarine faceted cubes. There they are. Well done. Twenty-four ninety-nine clearance price all the way down. Rhea's already through. Well done, Karen. Well done to you. Just love that kind of round, kind of cubic shape you're going to be getting. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Well done. Nineteen pounds and twenty-seven pence. Well done. You're checking out today, which is great to see. Absolutely superb. Well done, everybody. Oh, eight hundred. Six triple four, six triple five. Make it well unto you as well, Maria in Surrey and in Bedfordshire. Well done to you. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Uh, two opportunities. That's it. That's it. Once it's gone, it's gone. Amazing. Don't forget, you all get your thirty-day money-back guarantee as well, which is absolutely fantastic. Well done. Gorgeous. Silk alike is on pre-order. Here it is. You get it in black. We can get it in white. It's on pre-order at the minute uh, for seven ninety-nine. That's not going to be a price point today. By the way, just so you know, stronger than your silk threads, which is great to know. Uh, and you get more of it. So you're not going to have to kind of add in or you're not limited by the kind of the length of the necklace that you're going to be able to make. It's just absolutely brilliant stuff. It's coming up uh, as your early bird special. And it's vegan friendly as well. Right. It won't stretch. It won't stain. It's resistant to fraying. And it's resistant to shredding. See, all I'm thinking of now is Shredder in Teenage Mutant Hero Turtles. Shredder with his thing. He had a hand shredder thing, didn't he? Didn't he shred things? I don't know. What was the name of the woman? Was it April? In the, in the buttercup kind of yellow tracksuit, leisure suit thing. She was a reporter. I used to love Teenage Mutant. Oh, amazing. Teenage Mutant. Ninja Turtles, amazing. Heroes in a half shell, turtle power. $79.99 for your natural blue Madagascan sapphire. Well, it is oyster day, Linda. Mm -hmm. Talking about shells, aren't we today? Absolutely. So I think we should be talking about uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. No, maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. That is a beautiful strength of colour you're going to be getting there. That's so strikingly navy blue, isn't it? It's absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous quality. I love that graduation in size as well. Beautiful graduation in size. It's such, you know, for natural sapphire, that is surprisingly good, actually. Surprisingly good. It's got none of that kind of, um, none of that kind of uh, greyness, which sometimes your natural sapphire has. This is all completely beautiful in that solid, lovely green. Pat, well done to you, Pat. Maria in Surrey, well done to you as well. Gorgeous. £19.21. £19.21. pence. Well done. There we go, everyone. Well done. Okay, so with the UK, it's only dedicated to jewelry making channel. Linda and myself have been here since pretty much the beginning, haven't we, love? We have, the beginning of time. <laughs> do you remember those first kits? Oh, I do. My first kit was amethyst. Was it? Amethyst kit, yeah. Very you cool. lucky ducky. Yeah, I was actually on the first show with Steve Bennett. Oh. Canada, so that's why it was amethyst and pearls. Bless him. Yeah. Bless him. No, you know what? Uh, it is, it is, it, 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 it's amazing, really. We've been going for 12 years, still here. Uh, we've got loads and loads and loads of incredible things coming up today. Six opportunities left. Come on, Catherine in Lan Oh! He's taking the price down again. Catherine in Lanarkshire, well done to you. There's more people with us in their baskets. How can we be taking this lower than 1921 for natural Madagascan sapphire? That's absolutely incredible. Go, 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 go. Well done. Sharon's through. Well done to you as well. Absolutely amazing. 
Oh my word, 0800 644 655. Great deals for you today. And it's your order. How many jewelry makers out there never even thought they'd ever be able to use genuine gemstones, let alone natural blue sapphire from Madagascar? For £17.45, oh my word, what an amazing, that's a proper clearance deal. You know it, I know it, that's a proper clearance deal. Caroline in Northamptonshire, well done to you as well. Stella in Devon, fantastic. Well done, everyone. Gold, silver, rose gold, it's going to go with all of them so beautifully. Well done. Check out my lovelies at £17.45. Well done to you. Gorgeous, 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 well done. Amazing. The blue one in the middle. I got it. The blue one in the middle. The blue one in the middle. Oh, dear me. Oh, my gosh. Dear me, these are gorgeous. Oh, wow. Wow. Now, Linda, what would you do with these? Because these have got that lovely kind of... Kind of, uh, uh, kind of really lovely fat drop quality to them. I can see these kind of set this way up in 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 rings or studs maybe for earrings. I mean, what what, yeah, what do that, you I mean, that's be? an absolutely superb cut, isn't it? Isn't or, it? Certainly for um, say a fine sterling silver chain. Oh yes, it's just the one on the end, a uh, sort of shoulder dusting earring. Um, as you say, um, set into a ring, it would be absolutely beautiful just, just look at the clarity on that Jane. i know isn't it incredible the clarity the color yeah as, as as linda says the cut is absolutely superb how is that 21 pounds 99 pence also do you know what with things like your macrame bracelets where you want your gems sometimes to sit kind of proud this is wonderful so because of course you get the um your beading uh your threading material kind of going underneath that is a stunning selection of sky blue topaz, that is amazing. Under what, under 20 did you? Oh my word, well done. 17 pounds and 99 pence, amazing. Well done, more makers coming through. Sky blue topaz, isn't it the best? It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Well done, everybody. Imagine, go, 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 go. Imagine that, that strand on a bubble um, bracelet yes. or uh, necklace, or even like the, the bubble waterfall earrings with some gorgeous metallic pearls. Do you know what? That's such a lovely idea. They really lend themselves to that, don't they? They want to move all those facets, giving you that wonderful luster. It's uh, red wine that's to be avoided with oysters. Oh. Spirits are fine, says in-house designer Anne. Oh. Well, I'll bow to your knowledge, Anne. Yeah, absolutely. I think we should uh, put Linda and Anne in a room. Linda can drink wine and eat oysters, and Anne can drink just a bottle of tequila and, uh, and, and eat oysters, and we'll just see what happens. See what happens, yeah. <laughs> good idea. I'm up for that test. I would pay good money to see that. Trust in-house designer Anne to know mm. that. She does love her pearls. Oh, my word. A mind-boggling price on this, says Neary. Really? Mind-boggling. Fair warning. Fair warning. 48.99. This better be good, Neary. Three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh, oh that's my goodness. No, that is brilliant. Sorry. <laughs> Three, two, one, beep up poof. Beep up poof. Abracadabra. Fish and chips. Susan, Catherine, Marie, Rathison, Heather, Denise, Caroline. Hey, piff, up, puff. Well done. Seven ninety. It's a good job they go. I didn't know what you were trying to get me to do. Heather's got to. I did. I did. I don't. I didn't really. Couldn't really work out what you were trying to get me to do, Neary. Sorry. Oh, did you say give me a countdown? Oh, sorry. Three, two, one. Alakazam. <laughs> Oh, my word. So watching um, Harry Potter the other day with my children, Harry Potter 6, this is now, with, well, with the one where Thingy dies. Snape. Yes, one of the big, you know, one of the big characters. And uh, you kill them with a, a spell, which is um, a vanacadabra. And it just sounds like abracadabra, doesn't it? Anyway. So that's the most rubbish thing I've ever... I'm just boring. So, 1990, especially if you don't like Harry Potter. 1999, burgundy dyed diamond freshwater culture. Oh, these are love. I like that colour, don't you, um, Linda? Yeah, they're absolutely gorgeous. Um, Autumnal. 
Yeah, very. And But alongside that gorgeous, those aquamarine cubes. Yes, Those most definitely. Yeah. Do you know what? I was in M&S yesterday. I went in to buy some, um, what was that about? Tomatoes I was in there to buy. I literally had a couple of seconds. Oh, and they're lovely citrus smelling bin bags. Because, you know, bin, but bins just stink at the minute, don't they? It's absolutely disgusting. So they do one, they do bin bags that smell nice. Where's this going, Carol? And, and I walked past, I walked past a, a display of jeggings. Okay. And they were all in these lovely autumnal colours. Right, okay. There you go. Okay, then. I bought it back. Okay. I bought it back. I bought it back, don't worry. Silk alike coming up. We launched this during the birthday celebrations. We've finally been able to get it back in stock, which is brilliant. You've got it in white. We've also got it in black. Stronger than silk, less prone to fraying, less prone to um, shredding. It's amazing. You get loads more of it on the spool, which is wonderful. And uh, it's on pre-order at the minute on our website at $7.99. It's not going to be $7.99. It's going lower than that, which is absolutely brilliant. So that's going to be coming up as your early bird special in black, in white, two separate opportunities. Get it on pre-order on our website. Just go to our website, jewelrymaker.com, click on um, watch live, then click on pre-order and you'll see it there for $7.99. We'll look after you with the price. Fire Opal. Oh, do you know what? There is a distinct lack of Fire Opal on our channel at the minute and it bothers me because this is the stone of now. I don't know about you, um, uh, I was seeing some lovely photos people have put on uh, Facebook and, you know, social media recently of, you know, because we've been having these beautiful, you know, uh, bright sunny days, which, you know, to some extent have been nice, but then, you know, I can't wait for it to rain next week. Anybody else feel a bit like that? Mm -hmm. But the sunsets have been spectacular and they really genuinely have been. And it's these kind of colours, this kind of end of summer going into autumn. This kind of strand is absolutely perfect. Mexican fire opal, all the way from, um, I, 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 uh, this is genuine natural Mexican um, uh, fire opal, Mexico's national gemstone from the ridge of an extinct volcano. You don't tend to get lots of colour play with fire opal, but you can get it. Um, some of these slightly kind of more jelly ones at the end of the strand here are going to be giving you a little bit of, uh, look at that. Oh, loads of people there. Ruby's just bought three. Maria, well done to you. Christine in Devon. Rhea in Somerset, well done. It's abs... Oh, look at... Yeah, yeah, look, look. There's your colour play. In the reds. Oh, my word, that's absolutely stunning. Well done, everyone. Rhea's got two. You've not only got gorgeous play of colour in some of these, you've got the most amazing clarity. This with amber. Oh, I hope you get to play some amber soon. You know, it, we haven't got a lot of it in stock and it's, it, it's just so nice to be able to bring this to you at this time of year. It's just, it's just, oh, it's just gorgeous. Jane in Merseyside, well done to you, my darling. More people coming through. And of course, it's October's birthstone as well. They're beautiful, aren't they? Some really lovely kind of gemmy ones in there. Some which are more opaque, more translucent. Susan in Norfolk, well done to you. Oh, lovely east coast of Norfolk. How, uh, sorry, east coast of the UK. How beautiful is that? Gorgeous, well done. Rachel in North Yorkshire. Yeah, there's most definitely your kind of pepper asher tones in here. Some of these are, if I show you some of these ones up here, look, yeah, the kind of pinky orangey tones that you get there are absolutely delightful, aren't they? There's your, there's your money reds. There's your play of colour. Gorgeous. That's what Toby Cavill calls them, money reds, because they're the most valuable colours, uh, secondary colours that you get in your opal. Absolutely beautiful. These remind me very much, uh, this quality of those gorgeous, those kind of legendary earrings that you made, Linda, those gorgeous waterfall earrings you made out of fire opal, which yeah. uh, years ago we're talking about. I this mean, is that kind of quality. Um, it's just, it's one of those gemstones that I'll never forget because of the definition that, again, Steve Bennett gave it. Um, yes. it's born of fire. Yes, absolutely. From the ridge of an extinct volcano, you can't get much more connected to fire than that. You're absolutely right. Uh, well done. There's bidders through from all over the country getting involved. Nicolette in Surrey, well done to you. Under £20. Absolutely beautiful. Well done. And I think with as well, can I just show you it with some of the spiny oyster turquoise we've got coming up? Oh, yeah. In the 11. Look at that. I love these stones together. Look, doesn't that look nice? Mm. Spiny oyster turquoise. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I've never done it in strands. Can't wait to bring this to you. That with the fire opal, absolutely superb. Superb. Uh, so that's very exciting. Well done. Let's move on, everyone. More people there. Silver tassel, charmy, 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 charmy. Ah. Yeah, these will be great for the, um, no, great for the nine o'clock hits. Pearl kits, get it right, Neary. 
I don't know where the other tweezers are, actually, but anyway. Here we go. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, sterling silver. Charm tassel connected with Kibixiconia. So there's your Kibixiconia. You've got that lovely little cross section there to be able to put all your threads, your cords, your silk alike in. Yeah. Gorgeous. There it is with the beautiful um, uh, Kibixiconia in, uh, kind of encrusted surface there. It looks absolutely beautiful, doesn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. Loads of people coming through. It goes so well with the nine o'clock kits. Uh, which is coming up in about 25 minutes' time. Let, um, M Michael, I wonder, will we be able to just have a very quick look at the jewellery? Just the jewellery closest to uh, me on the end of the desk. This, this, this would work beautifully with those kits, wouldn't it, um, Linda? Absolutely, because we've got some seed pearls in it. Yes, ex precisely. Yeah. Oh, yes. Brilliant. Look at that jewellery. That's old school jewellery. That's just gorgeous. I love it. That, drop, that long drop in the centre was dropping from that tussel top. Yes. It would add even more to it, wouldn't it? It really would. It it's really superb would. if you buy two and, and use them as earring toppers. Oh, imagine that. That can make such a difference to your jewellery, can't it? Nineteen ninety nine. Maria and Surrey's already through for two of these, actually. I don't know if you're going to be making earrings or, you know, whether it's for a couple of different um, necklaces, maybe. It's actually small enough um, if you wanted to use it uh, as a little charm on a bracelet with like a little, just with um, cord tassel coming out the bottom of it. It's entirely up to you. But what a beautiful finish. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, solid sterling silver quality. And of course, a great great thing about that is it's precious metal but it's solid there's a lot in there I'll give it a quick way obviously it's not going to give you a, a completely does it give us the gram weight uh Neary have we got the gram weight there oh there we go brilliant two grams of 925 sterling silver which is absolutely brilliant Angela Catherine well done to you my lovely Amanda's got four in her basket well done to you go 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 loads of your cubiciconia there and with everything we've got coming up today you know, using it with your big individual pearls or using it with the gorgeous nine o'clock kits that we've got coming up. Absolutely superb. £12.99. Angela in Surrey, Angela in South Yorkshire, Maker in Renfrewshire. Well done to you, my lovelies. Loads of people joining us today. Well done, everybody. Also, I'd like to get your, I'd like to get your messages today. Send us a text. Little, little hacks of keeping cool. Little hacks. How do you keep cool? Let us know. Let us know. How do you keep cool? Let us know. Oh, mate. Oh, that just sounds lovely, Neary. Just only in his boxer shorts, sitting in front of a fan. <laughs> now, there's an image for you. Um, Amatrine top side drill drops. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Here we go, everyone. Amatrine topside drilled faceted drops. Beautiful. There you go, everyone. A mix of your amethyst and your citrine together. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. $24.99. Here we go, everyone. Oh, yeah, Amatrine over the last couple of weeks has been so, so, so popular. Uh, we bought it to you in a couple of, uh, well, a couple of different shows with Toby Cavill. It was absolutely brilliant. Twelve ninety nine for you today. Yeah, it's got some of the most amazing qualities going through this um, gorgeous Amatrine. And much like that gorgeous Wall of Fame jewellery, it it, it's just got that incredible kind of really high-end quality to it. Well done. Suffolk's coming through. Eight eighty seven. No way. That's amazing. <gasps> Sharon and Catherine, well done. Put your fluoride bracelets in the fridge. Okay, I must hold the cold. A jade, I mean, you know, jade, put that in the fridge and then, uh, yeah. Um, also, uh, you could do your, um, you could do your um, uh, grapes in the freezer. They're nice. They're nice in drinks, actually. Grapes, frozen grapes. Very, very nice. Maria, Iris, Pama, Pamela. Well done to you. Sharon's coming through. Well done to you. Ways of keeping cool. Let us know. 887 is your deal today. Well done. Iris in Tyne and Weir's now uh, joining us this morning. Well done. Thank you very much. Hello. Freeze a bottle of water and stand it in front of the fan. Yes, I've heard this. It's meant to be amazing. You don't, you don't think it works, um, Ollie? No. Oh, yeah, okay. Morning all. I throw open the back door. <laughs> Sorry. I throw open the back door and the windows <laughs> at 6 a.m. and then close them all at 9 a.m. Trapping the cold air really works. 
Yeah, so I open, I open all the windows in the morning and then about 10 o'clock I tend to close the windows and then close all the blinds and the curtains. So literally we have a house of darkness until about 7 o'clock at night. Right, what are we doing? Rounds. Michael, any little tips of keeping cool? Well, ice cubes in your pockets. Ice cubes in your pockets. Ice cubes down your pants. There we go, everyone. There we go. That's how you keep cool. What about you, uh, Linda? How do you keep cool? I just don't. Oh, you just don't? I just yeah. boil. Yeah. Boil my brains. I get hot and bothered, don't you? Oh, yeah, hot guess... and bothered. Yeah, when I get hot and bothered, I get very irritable. Me well. too. Yeah. Very irritable. <sighs> Blimey. Keep that air con today, gang. Twenty nine ninety nine. Well done, twenty nine ninety nine for you today. Well done, eight mil rounds. Look at the look at the citrine and the amethyst. Oh, they're beautiful. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Well done. Loving the clarity of these. Hey, these will go with the beautiful uh, lavender amethyst we did first thing this morning. I know. Wouldn't they just moments away from our early bird special as well, which is great to see. Fantastic. Damp cloth on the feet. Freezer block in water. No electric fans as it's uncomfortable when the fan is turned off. Electricity use. I know, Fran, I know. That's one, one of those things, isn't it? Heather, well done to you. Maker. Oh, gorgeous. Well done. Are we going to do the early bird special? Okay, so on pre-order at the minute, if you go to our website, you go to jewelrymaker.com, click on watch live, scroll down, go to, uh, click on pre-order. Go uh, and have a look because we've got black and white silk alike on our website available for pre-order. Now, it's, it, it, it's on the website. It's $7.99 at the minute. That's not going to be your price point today. We're going to be going lower than that. So please do, <laughs> please do get it. it uh, loads and loads and loads have already gone on pre-order. The black and the white, have, uh, similar, po uh, similar popularity, actually, which is great to know. Uh, but do add it onto your order uh, and we will look after you with the price point on that. Well done, everyone who's still coming through for the Amatrine as well. That's great to see. Well done. Are we going to do it? Oh, gosh. OK. Early bird special. So, um... If you are familiar with, if you're familiar with the incredible Pearls by the Yard, or if you're familiar with the gorgeous pieces that Coco Chanel would wear, the gorgeous pearl ropes that Coco Chanel would wear, they'd be unbelievably long, or if you're familiar with the kind of jewelry that Wallace Simpson would wear, you know, and I'm not necessarily talking about the kind of the panther kind of Cartier pieces, but the big long ropes of pearls. Those kinds of pieces are absolutely wonderful. They're the kinds of uh, designs that in, you know, you wear something like that over, you know, as we head towards autumn and winter, you've got a lovely big roll neck on and you put a pearl rope over it and it just breaks up the jumperness. It makes it just, it just kind of, it just makes the outfit Similarly, in the summer, you can kind of wear them slightly shorter as necklaces. You can double them over, triple them over, wear them as bracelets. But of course, you can only do that when you have got your pearls threaded onto a threading material that is A, going to give you that kind of look of natural silk and that, uh, the, the way that natural silk works when you when you drape a, 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 a strand of pearls, it kind of falls, it, it, it tessellates beautifully. But of course, we don't really sell cards of silk that are going to be able to give you that meters and meters and meters and meters of pearls uh, in, in jewelry in one go, especially if you want to knot it. So what do you do? So what do you do? Well, um, you can use uh, other threading materials, which are slightly thicker. Well that's, well, that's fine, like our beading thread, absolutely amazing. But you're not going to get the drape. You're not going to get the swag. So if I just show you, I've got a, a, a strand of pearls here. You can see it's quite stiff, quite rigid like that. It's got quite a rigidity, yeah? Um, and if you put this on the desk, it just kind of, it goes, it, it, just, it just falls flat like that. There's no drape. Silk and this incredible material here is supple enough to give you the look of your silk jewellery and you get many, 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 many metres of it on this spool. 
This is a real kind of revelation, isn't it, um, uh, Linda? Because it, it will give you the look, the feel of your really high-end pearl jewellery, won't it? This yeah, because, kind of I mean, effectively, a pearl is one of... Well, it is the most gentle of gems, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, so, consequently, if you... If you move on from that, I often find that the gemstones inspire the design. Yes. So that would inspire a gentle flowing type of design. Um, but the, the thing that strikes me about silk-alike is um, the strength of it and the fact that, as, as you quite rightly say, it uh, resists fraying. Mm. Um, and at the end of the day, silk being a natural fibre itself yes. will fray. You get that kind of almost halo, don't you, yeah, when and you it, cut and it? And it will also sort of, not rot, but it will sort of dissolve in sunlight. Absolutely, yeah, so yeah. It will. Um, this won't. It's incredibly strong because it's made of three fibres and not two. Um, and and also, also, with your with your pearl with your pearl necklaces, when you knot them onto silk, it's wonderful. But really, if you wear them a lot, you're going to need to re knot that pearl necklace every I don't know three to five years, depending yeah, on how often you wear it, because it will stretch. That's the general advice. If yeah. If you have a um, a knotted pearl piece of jewellery, then to get it checked every three to five years and yeah. get it re-knotted. Because a lot of wear and tear takes place. You know, you wouldn't think that it was possible, but trust me, it is. Absolutely. I remember my mum's put on it just going all over the kitchen floor one day. Oh, my um, word. And that was her mother's, and it was threaded on silk. Yes, yes. Um, and also, this resists discoloration. Yes, exactly, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes with your pearls, they... Um, um, uh, sometimes with your pearls, uh, they, you know, if you, especially if you wear moisturiser or if you wear perfume, it can discolour the silk, whereas this, as, as, as Linda says, it, it, it will resist it. Now, we've given you a, a clock to graphics because this is going to absolutely fly. On pre-order, by the way, this has flown on pre-order. It's incredible. This is amazing. So let's have a little... Let, I've got a little slide here. Just about silk alike, just so you know what, what it is and why we're bringing it to you. So it's the best quality American-made beading cord available. Synthetic fibres are stronger as they're made of three strands of long fibre, not just two. It won't stretch or stain and resist fraying and shredding. And ideal for stringing pearls and beads. Um, th this is all wonderful. Plus the fact you're getting, like on the cards of silk that we've got coming up next, which are wonderful, they genuinely are, you get a few metres, you know, two or three metres. This... 60 meters, 60 meters. If you wanted to, I mean, this is entirely up to you, but if you wanted to, you could literally make a 60 meter pearl, you know, a strand of pearl, it, it, it's entirely up to you. Also, when you cut this, you will be able to use it like a needle because it's got that kind of, can you see, it's got that, it, 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 it's got that smoother kind of almost, almost slightly waxed finish to it. And that's wonderful. With your silk, as soon as you cut it, as, as, as we were discussing earlier on, it becomes, um, it starts to fray. You can't help it. It just kind of gives you a little kind of tuft. So to get that through a pearl is almost impossible, which is why you need the cards with the silk, uh, with the needle ready loaded onto it. Whereas this is going to be so much simpler to be able to use because, of course, it's, um, it's, it's man-made. Also, it is vegan friendly. So with your silk, obviously, it's made by a silk worm. And, you know, it, you know, that is, you know it's a natural fibre that's absolutely incredible. But if you want something which is completely 100% vegan friendly to use with your shell pearls or with whatever gemstones you like then this is the one to go for. The fact that you get 60 meters, the fact that it will act like a silk, it looks like a silk, but it's got all the benefits of being, you know, of, of acting and looking like a silk, but it's not going to stretch like a silk will. It's not going to stain like a silk can. Um, and it's resistant to fraying and shredding, which sometimes happen with silks. Now, you don't even need to uh, use a needle with this, like I've said. It's absolutely amazing stuff because it's man-made as well. If you do have those loose ends and you want to ball them up afterwards by applying a, um, you know, a naked flame, then you absolutely can do as well. Whereas with your silk, it's just going to burn it, which is going to look awful. So we've got 250 available. Over 50 have already gone. I mean, we've got with about 100 in baskets. So we're going to do a one-minute clock, one price, and that's it. We've got it in white as well, which is wonderful, but black... Use it with your darker gemstones. 
Use it with your peacock pearls. Use it with your Tahitian pearls. It's absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. The material is amazing. But the main draw for me as well is the fact that it is 60 meters on the spool, which is incredible. It's not a, a, a little card. No, the cards that we bring you are absolutely wonderful. And we've got some of those coming up in our first kits at nine o'clock. But if you want to make those meters and meters and meters and meters and meters of pearls, Neri, can you find me a little image there of maybe Coco Chanel, you know, in a meter of, pearl, you know, meters of pearls, pearls by the yard, you know, those incredible long line necklaces that she used to wear. And it was, and it was, uh, and, and, you know, that kind of jewelry is only possible and, and, you know, in a knotted form, if you use a really lovely, long, strong threading material. And unfortunately, a lot of natural silk, you know, it's not gonna, it's not gonna, it's not gonna um, uh, always cut the mustard. Okay, price point today, amazing. There's so many people there. This is wonderful to see. We started off at 7.99. We're gonna give you, we're gonna take the price point down. Here's your deal today, it's amazing. This is for 60 meters in total, 6.99. Go, 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 go. Absolutely fantastic. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. It's absolutely brilliant. It's a game changer. It's a game changer. And if like many people out there, you know, you're going to be making uh, wedding jewellery or you're going to be restringing pearls, that's absolutely fantastic to use your genuine natural silk. It's absolutely wonderful. But if you want to make pieces like this, if you want to make pieces like this, which are long ropes, 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 you might, you might find that using your silk is going to be unaffordable, but also you might not be able to get those long line necklaces uh, by using a silk, you know, you have to add into it or just kind of add in in a really clever way. This is just fantastic at $6.99. Well done, everybody. It's absolutely fantastic. Well done to everyone. 0800 644 655. We've got so much coming up in the next hour. We've got the most incredible kits coming up. Um, and you're going to absolutely love them. It's wonderful to be able to bring this to you today. Um, uh, just superb. Well done. 0800 644 Jewelry like that is just, is just astonishing, isn't it, Linda? And, and, and being able to know that you incredible. can make it using these 60 meter spools is just amazing, isn't it? I mean, from a jewelry maker's point of view, and I'm approaching this from possibly a, a beginner's pearl knotting. Ah, oh, yes. Good call. Is, um, the pearl knotting, because this is a very slightly waxed um, silk-alike look. Yes, yes, yes. Um, when you knot pearls on your silk, you know, it is a technique that you do have to practice. Of course. Many ways of doing it, but you have to practice to actually find the one for you. Yes. Um, but this is going to be so much easier to get that technique yes. um, nailed, as it were. Mm. Um, because there's going to be some, when that knot is in situ, there's going to be a little bit of friction there that will hold it. It yeah. won't slip. So that's, that's another pro, mm. really, for this from a jewelry maker's point of view. Mm -hmm. And also looking at that slide then with all those rows of pearls. Um, to create that type of necklace and for it to flow beautifully like on those images it's so much better to just thread pearl after pearl after exactly pearl. yeah no clasp yeah because that actually interrupts that flow yeah yeah um and then just make it as long as you want from nose to feet really and then just drape it around the neckline accordingly um and you get a much softer um drape that's it. It's the swag. It's the drape, isn't it? The way that it falls. The way that it falls in your hand as well. It pulls. It's beautiful. Uh, these spools are good for Japanese style knotting pearls. Oh, interesting. But I, I, I like, I like your I like your kind of point that you made there, Linda. About about yeah. If you're a beginner, if you've never had a go at pearl knotting before, this is brilliant because there's 60 meters to have a go with here. It's absolutely fantastic. And of course, you know, knotting with your with your natural silk, fantastic. But of course. You know, after a time, it will stretch. It will give a little bit. So if you're not that, if not that bothered about using a natural silk, I mean, natural silk is amazing. And we bring you natural silk like this. This is wonderful. We bring you two meters on these spools, which is wonderful. This is a two meter spool of your natural silk. It's great to have the choice. We've got this coming up in our in our in our um, nine o'clock kit. This this kit, by the way, you've got two, four, six, eight, ten meters of natural silk, which is coming up in the nine o'clock kit. That's, I mean, that's absolutely amazing. But you are going to be getting <laughs> 11 strands of pearls. 
So because you're going to get leather surrounds, you know, it just warrants that kind of, you know, you need a lot of silk. So the, this kit coming up in the nine o'clock hour, it's got this amazing connector with it as well with Cabixiconia. So that's coming up in the nine. Can't wait to bring that. But you might want to get the white one. Now, this one is going to fly. So we've literally got, of the black silk-alike left, I think we've got about 50 chances left. We did start with a massive quantity, loads of multi bidders. The white one, yeah, well, that is just going to go. That is just going to go. Okay. You've got here the most amazing material, the most amazing um, uh, opportunity. Oh, my word. I literally have a screen full of names here. It's absolutely amazing. And you know, if you've always been into classic pearl knotting with your silk, give it a go. See what's going to happen. It literally such a low price point. You may as well just try it out. Try before, you know, you know, try before you make that kind of complete and utter decision. You know, just get a couple of these. See how you get on with it. Um, but when you are um, uh, doing your pearl knotting, it's just so wonderful to know that, you, you know, you know, you're not working with a two meter card. You're working with 60 meters in total. It's absolutely incredible. Well done, everybody. Let's get this price point. And there's so many people coming through to get this well done. And it's in this beautiful, pure white. Um, can we also, uh, Neri, just show that lovely slide again that you had of the silk alike and all the kind of, here we go. So it's vegan friendly because it's man-made. So it's not made from um, uh, natural silk. Best quality American made beading cord available. Synthetic fibers are stronger as they are made of three strands of long fiber, not just two. Will not stretch, uh, which is wonderful. That's one of the uh, big benefits here as well. I think, you know, with your, with your silk, it's absolutely wonderful. But over time, it will stretch. Won't stain and resist. Um, and it tends to be resistant to fraying and shredding and ideal for stringing pearls and beads. It's amazing stuff. Have a go with it with seed beading. See if it works for seed beading. It might do. It might not be as good as your kind of your, you know, your, um, uh, what do you call it? Your uh, wildfire. Thank you. Um, but just have a go. Six ninety nine for you today. Well done. People buying threes, twos, threes, fours. If you got this when we launched it back in uh, May, do message us and tell us, you know, what are your thoughts on it? Have you enjoyed using it? What have you used it for? Is it just for pearl knotting or have you used it for other things? Do let us know. Message us because I know that we did launch it during our birthday celebrations and it absolutely flew. So do message us and let us know how, you know, how, you know, where it's been placed in your, in your jewellery making hobby. Six pounds and 99 pence. Absolutely flying. Don't bother putting it in your basket. Just check out. Um, I carefully melt the end of the silk with a beadsmith thread zapper to make it like a needle. Makes it easy to put your uh, end through a tight hole. Yeah, do you know what? That's a brilliant. There you go. So she carefully melts the end of the silk alike. There you go. To make like a needly kind of thing. And it's much easier to get your end through a tight hole. You heard it here first from Michael. There you go. I've used this in the past. Great stuff. Very versatile, says Ms. Janet. Thank you for that, my lovely. Gorgeous. Great. You know, have a go. See what happens. But, you know, the fact that you've got the fact that you've got that 60 meters as well is amazing. And of course, the fact that it's vegan friendly as well. Well done, everyone. Sheila, Sandra, Pamela. Oh, there's just millions of you coming through. Well done, everyone. It's six pounds and 99 pence. Absolutely gorgeous. And if you're doing lots of wedding commissions, this is going to be absolutely perfect. Also, wedding jewellery isn't known for being affordable. You know, it is, it is something which, you know, you know, a bride can spend, you know, hundreds of pounds on, really, can't they? If you wanted to give them a quote for using, you know, you, you know I can make you, of course, I can make you a pearl knotted uh, necklace. And yes, I can use natural silk. And here's the price of natural silk. Or we can use silk alike. And this is the price. So, you know, it, it's kind of, yeah, you get that. Yeah, and also I've just sort of thought that yeah. with that with that sort of um, that nod to bridal jewellery, not the bride might want that lovely gentle pearl knotted uh, piece of jewellery. Yeah. But you know, guests, mother of the groom, mother of the bride might go for something more statement. Yeah. So consequently, this will work on your statement jewellery as well because statement jewellery. Um, how should I explain that? I'm talking about big gemstones. Yes. Big stones. Yes. Uh, big sort of rectangular stones, big, um, well, just a big size of any shape. Yeah. And um, that in itself needs to have a gentleness accorded to it as well. For it to, you know, when you twist as well, um, you want to twist your pearls. Or yes. You want to, yes. Um, this is going to be soft enough for your statement jewellery. But more than that, it's going to take the weight 
of the statement jewelry without the stretching. I get, okay, yeah, you're right. And 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 do you know what? Yeah, for your statement pieces, this is gonna be superb, as Linda says. I've just literally got four loads of it together. And you know, it it's 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 created a really nice kind of you know, a much, much thicker cord. And of course you can do that because there's 60 meters here. It's um so it's uh it's a size two, which means it's 0 0.035. Can't be 0 0.35, can it? That sounds a bit too thick. I think, I think it is about 0. Point, if you imagine 0. 0.4 wire, it looks about... Yeah, th yeah, okay, yeah, so 0. 0.35 of a millimetre uh, in thickness. There you go. Well done, everyone. Okay, oh my word, look at the time. Right, coming up next, we've got this incredible 11 strand pearl kit. Woo, yeah! And a load of incredible uh, 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 inspiration from... The lovely Linda Brumwell. Do not go anywhere. Keep coming through for that. There's still genuine chances for the white and the black silk alike. We'll see you in a sec. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Join us for the Tales of Jade. This is a gemstone that has been revered for well over 4,000 years. It has been uncovered in archeological sites dating back to the Neolithic era. Every single dynasty that has ruled over China has valued this stone above gold and us mere mortals are never meant to own it. After visiting Myanmar in 2018 and hearing about the stories from that part of the world, from that side of the border, we wanted to bring to an event where we uncover the true tales of Jadeite, steeped in folklore and mystery. This event is where you collectors will get to experience all the different varieties, all the different colors, Essentially, every jadeite we have ever acquired, that we have ever procured from the Far East, will be available for a limited time only and for the best and incredible deals. This is your chance to get your jadeite happily ever after. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Make sure you join us this Saturday on Jewelry Maker for Rumble in the Jungle. And we've got everything you would expect to see. So amazing deals on amber. We've got incredible animal charms, animal themed kits. We've got seed beads. We've even got a sterling silver elephant wearing a peridot. See you then on Saturday. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
We're back. Oh, look. We're this is your happy place, isn't it? We're surrounded it? by oyster product. Aren't we? Aren't we? Well, it's oyster day, Linda. Mm -hmm. It makes complete sense. Oh, will you look at these pearls? So many pearls. We're going to be starting with this enormous kit with the most incredible 15 strands in. But we've also got this kit coming up. I just, I do you know what? I love seed pearls. I mm. absolutely adore them. Don't you, Linda? Absolutely. They're at such a premium as well because mm. um, they, they just are a larger pearl. is far more, I, wouldn't, I don't want to say the word common. A larger pearl is... Easier. You see more of them. Yeah, yeah. I guess so. Yeah. Yeah, you do. Then the seed. Then the, the the seed pearls just fly out to the bridal market in all of the fashion show, um, industries. You're so right. They're, they're they're beautiful. This necklace here. Um, I uh, oh gosh, I I absolutely love this necklace, Linda. Of what you've done is is, is just is just absolutely beautiful. Um, so that incredible necklace made with uh, the beautiful kit with the beautiful um, uh, seed pearls. We've got so much coming up. We're going to start off with this enormous kit. And I think for anybody who was kind of uh, uh, watching the last uh, deal that we did, which of course was all of the silk alike, uh, I, 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 it, it's not 11 strands that you're going to be getting in this kit. It's actually 15 strands that you're getting in this kit. It is unbelievable. Leaveable. Now, we'll look at the pearls in a second, look at the quality of the pearls in a second, but first of all, I just want to show you this. I want to show you the natural silk that you're going to be getting. This is wonderful stuff. Now, this has got all the, um, uh, whatchamacallit, the needle ready loaded onto the natural silk to make it so much easier for you to do your pearl knotting, which is absolutely great. So you've got your beautiful colors here. Um, this wonderful kind of almost like a biscuit colour that you're going to be getting there. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? Um, it is. It uh, really works with pearls, that does. It just gives that little bite of colour that you can actually notice the knot. Yes. And let's face it, that is really in integral. I can't, uh, what's the word? I don't know. Well, let's just say it's really important. If you're knotting a pearl, that is a design, isn't it? Oh, for sure, design yes. Design choice. So, you, you know, it's nice if you can actually see that knot. Yes, it's an integral part of integral. the design, isn't it? That's it. Yes. That's it. It isn't. Uh, it, it, it absolutely is. And these gorgeous kind of camel colours as well, as we head towards autumn, are going to be absolutely perfect. Um, so, you know, this is a really, really lovely silk to go for. Now, the connector you're going to be getting uh, here is just stupidly good. I'm just going to show you the edge of this connector first. Just have a little look at that. So you've got the most incredible connector with all of these gorgeous kind of um, holes going around them, which are all anchor points. You can anchor your silk, your cord, whatever, your studdings, your findings from um, any one of these holes. And then when you turn it over and you look at the quality you are going to be getting here, it is absolutely superb. This is all um, encrusted with Cubic Zirconia. It's got the most beautiful floral design in the center. Or I suppose you could almost say it's a lotus flower design, but it's definitely a floral design with a big Cubic Zirconia in the center. Then all the rest are all gem set as well, which is gorgeous. That's all 925 sterling silver. And then you get the pearls. So I'll give you a couple of strands of these, Linda, so you get to have a good look at them. So you weren't actually sent this kit, but no, they are incredibly sized, beautifully shaped. And sometimes, you know, I, you know, it, it's, I, I looked at, I looked at Linda as a bit of a pearl expert, really, because I remember when you went to uh, the Far East, oh, years ago to do some buying for us. And I know that you were offered some pearls and I remember you kind of coming back and saying, look, some of the pearls that you see out there are just, are just rubbish. And, you know, they're kind of like, they've got no luster, they've got no nacre. These feel uh, that's, really good, that don't they? That is actually the, the word. It's, um, when you, you're talking earlier about keeping cool, when you feel a pearl, it's cold. Yeah, absolutely. And, um, it will remain cold. It's look at uh, that. rather than looking whenever you are buying pearls um, or wearing pearls, don't just look at the gem but feel the gem. It's a very tactile Absolutely. gem, very tactile, and it's the most divine feeling when you put pearls in your hand and you just move them around gently. Pearls, pearls love 
to be worn. They love being oh. next to your skin. They love the natural oils in your skin. They're beautiful. They're relatively easy to care for. Just be really, just be really gentle with them. And obviously when you wear your pearls, just make sure that, you know, they're the last thing you put on, the first thing you take off. So kind of always put your perfume on uh, before you put your pearls on and because uh, they are stunning. You are getting here a total of 15 strands. 15 strands of genuine freshwater cultured pearls. All of your natural silk. OK, and you've got your incredible connector with sterling silver as well. This is all absolutely superb. This was bought to you on our birth uh, as part of our birthday celebrations, as part of our birthday celebrations. And we've literally only got a couple of chances left. If this wasn't a birthday kit, this would have been the price. Two hundred and ninety nine pounds for 15 strands of pearls, 10 meters of natural silk. And you've got your connector as well. I don't know about you. I think that's absolutely amazing. Absolutely incredible. By the way, they are absolutely flying out the door. We've got 25 chances left. That is it. Once again, Marion, Ruby. Uh, we've got Janice, Maker in County Durham. Jenny, Maker, Maker in London. Jennifer, Valentina, Kerry, Maker. Do you know what you can make with those? Everything. Look at this. Look at this slide. Look at these incredible pieces you can make with this. All of that. I, do you know what? That is the kind of jewelry that you look at and you go, one day, one day I'll be able to afford exactly. the kit where I can make well, that. Exactly. One uh, day. Yeah, one day there will be that occasion. Um, Today's the day. Absolutely. But, you know, that's right. You know, that one day is a little while a while away. So just do it today. Oh, absolutely. do it today. Morning, guys. These would go with my jade uh, pieces superbly. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely gorgeous. Pearls and jade go wonderfully together. Jack's well done to you in Shropshire coming through. County Durham, Jenny in Cheshire, Maker. Uh, loads of people through. £299, amazing, on uh, four split pays of £74.75. We are going to be giving you a lower price point today for the final 20 opportunities. That is it. Once they're gone, they're gone. If this wasn't a birthday kit, this would be your price point at £299. But because we did bring it to you as part of our birthday celebrations, we're going to be giving you an even lower price more makers coming through this is good to see gail and kafili well into you wait till you see this it's amazing 199 pounds it's incredible wow for a 15 strand pearl kit the pearls by the way are immense they are the most incredible kind of 9 10 mil genuine freshwater culture pearls 15 strands of them and you've got your 10 meters of natural silk and of course you've got your incredible sterling silver connector as well yours today for 199 pounds valentina you've got two in your basket so's jennifer so's uh, maker you've got three in your basket actually so check out as soon as you can 16 opportunities remaining they are they they have the potential to sell out within the next couple of seconds jenny you need to check out my lovely Jennifer, well done to you, Penny in Buckinghamshire. Now this is good to see. Fifteen opportunities in the building. That is it. I can't believe that. That is absolutely amazing. What does that work out to per strand? If we, uh, Neary, what's one hundred ninety nine ninety nine divided by fifteen? Thirteen pounds thirty three per strand, and everything else is free. Wow. Wow. I mean, I mean there's there's everything about this. Kit that is exquisite. Wow. Everything you could put that word exquisite before. I mean, yep. the color of those pearls are, it's just absolutely exquisite. That lovely yeah. winter white, that's everything that you expect from a pearl. Absolutely. And, and these, and also, um, you know, seed pearls are wonderful and we love seed pearls. And we'll talk about seed pearls in a minute and their value and why they're so wonderful, why they're so highly sought after. But pearls which are like this kind of size, and, and they are, I mean, then I wouldn't say they're completely round, but they are really lovely shapes. They're not nuggets or weird kind of shapes that are kind of like, you know, people don't necessarily, you know, want. These have got that really attractive size and shape to them. Um, Olivia, Maker, Pauline, uh, more in baskets. Justin, well done to you. Lynn, well done to you. Penny, well done to you. 199.99. Six opportunities remaining. There's more than enough in baskets to check that, uh, for this completely to sell out. Uh, twice over. Well done to you. 0800 644 Well done. Go, 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 go. What a stunning opportunity for you today. Well done. Five chances remaining. Oh, my word. That is that could just go within the next couple of seconds. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, as, as an absolute um, pearl lover, lover is the fact that if I received this kit, then um, I'd be really excited because <laughs> I could just do absolutely 
anything, any design or designs. Yeah. So you can have a multitude of different pieces of jewellery or you could put it all together in that huge rope. And um, but that's the exciting part because I must admit when I'm using pearls, I'm never looking at the pearls I'm using. I'm looking at the pearls I've got left. Yes, yes. Thinking, oh, you know, because so much inspiration comes with uh, with pearl jewellery, and I mean certainly with that amount of pearls, it's there's a lot of inspiration in that kit. Absolutely, there 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 really genuinely is, and you know what, it really doesn't. It it, it gives you so many options. Um, the, the pearls we've just bought you, they're all kind of pretty much the same size, same shape, and it's going to give you really lovely, consistent jewellery. The next kit we're going to be doing starts to bring in different sizes and shapes of pearls. Now, these are this is a wonderful kit. It's a nine-strand pearl kit where you're going to be getting what look like pretty much perfect rounds in a few different sizes. Oh, my word. Got these gorgeous kind of... Um, uh, seed pearls, love that shape. Oh, they're just gorgeous. Rice pearls, there's some more of your near rounds as well, which is gorgeous. More uh, of your kind of larger size, this time potato pearls, larger potato pearls, larger rice pearls. Look at this one. That's a beautiful that strand. Isn't yeah. that lovely? But this one here is just, is just ridiculous. Look at the size of this strand. Oh, my word. I mean, that's a standalone necklace on it, isn't it? Totally. You just restrand it. Absolutely. You also get with this kit natural silk. You get um, eight metres of natural silk in purple, like a lovely kind of bluey, kind of, uh, uh, kind of lighter lavender kind of colour. You get it in that lovely pink, and then you get it in a beautiful kind of uh, cream as well. You've then got a load of spacer beads all in 925 sterling silver. They're there, just there. Beautiful spacer beads in sterling silver. And you get three of your lotus flower sterling silver uh, beads as well. So, uh, yeah, I, I, and you might be looking at these, I say, right, the seed pearls are for this and the bigger pearls are for that and the, these are the, that. Using them all together, oh, my word, you've just got to go for it. You've just got to go for it. They look wonderful all together um, and there's it gives you a jewelry quite a modern twist doesn't it i think when you start to use different shapes and sizes of pearls all together in one piece doesn't it linda yeah most definitely i mean pearls up until probably the last three four years and i think that's the influence that jewelry makers had mm. um have been seen as perhaps for the older lady yes but now okay, because yeah. like i think we've pushed the fact that there's any and every design piece of jewellery you can use your pearls for. Absolutely. It's bringing it to a much younger audience now. Isn't it? And this much younger audience is really, really enjoying pearls. And, and there's so many websites that if you go on there, you see really lovely, beautiful, modern pieces of jewellery using different sizes like, um, um, oh, what's that uh, website called? Um, Misoma's really beautiful. They've got lots of really high-end kind of uh, modern pearl pieces with so many beautiful designs utilising different pearls. I love this necklace here that um, uh, Linda's made today. And using it with different sizes, different shapes, you can see what you can see what's achieved there. These beautiful little clusters, clusters of clusters. I just love that. This is a really interesting take on the bubble star necklace because you're just uh, just uh, just random um, uh, little clusters all together, but all on one piece. And it's and it just oh, it gives so much movement, so much. Well, I think beauty. it's the fact that you gorgeous. You can use pearls in a formal design. Yes. But you can also use pearls in a very boho. Oh, absolutely. Design. Absolutely, and that's what's so wonderful about using genuine freshwater culture pearls like this in your jewellery. £189.99 on three split payments of 63.33. Bear in mind you're going to be getting all of these different shapes, sizes, qualities, influences. We are no way near our price point today. We're going to give you an, a, a superb deal today. Nine strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls. Look at how different they all are. Look at how unique each strand is, whether it's a seed pearl and you're comparing it to the large potato pearl or the rice pearl and you're comparing it to the um, kind of side roll potato pearl. They're, they're all so different. They're just wonderful. Um, okay. We're going to give you as low a price as possible today. Don't forget that with this kit, of course, you get all your seed beads. Sorry, not your seed beads, your spacer beads. 
you've got your seed beads, you've got your, sorry, your, I beg your pardon, your stunning silver spacer beads, and of course, you've got the gorgeous uh, lotus flower beads as well, which are gorgeous, and of course, all of your cards of silk as well. This is such a fantastic kit. Well done to everyone coming through to get this. Your price point coming in. Rio, Karen in Hampshire, Maker in Lancashire. Well done to you as well. All the way down. We've got one final price for you. And I tell you something, we're not taking five or ten pounds off. We are going to absolutely smash that price point down for you today. Uh, you know, putting a kit together with any strands of pearls, you know, with two strands of pearls, let alone nine. Uh, you know, that's it. We've literally only got, how many left? Fifteen, did you say? Maker in London, well done to you. 15 opportunities available, but that's it. Once it's gone, it's gone. It's literally going to sell out in seconds, this is, because today it's not 189.99. It's 129.99. Oh, wow. Brilliant. I mean, also, brilliant. Um, you know, it doesn't have to be jewellery, obviously, because um, if we're talking about um, the bridal part of yes. it, you know, all your hair accessories. Oh, um, yes, your hair vines, things yeah, like that. As soon as you mention bridal jewellery or as soon as you think about selling bridal jewellery, yes. uh, keep it simple, but always make sure that you've got loads of pearls there. Because oh pearls yes. tend to bring an audience to your Absolutely. Store. Everybody seems to be drawn to pearls. Absolutely. SJ Maker and Meath, uh, Lynn, Ria Maker in the Channel Islands and in-house designer Anne. Thank you, my lovely. Shirley, Sharon, Karen, Maker, SJ, well done to you. In-house designer Anne, you know, buys, buys our um, uh, pearls and, 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 you know, sells them at craft fairs, but also goes to places like um, uh, the big game fairs over at Ragley Hall and, you know, other places like that, you know, country um, uh, kind of country pursuit fairs and you know because this is kind of the audience that you know love absolutely, absolutely. You know, that love pearls yeah. and pearl, it's got, they used to be called the pearls and twin set brigade hadn't yes they? yes and let's face it brigade. that look is just timeless it really it? is yeah, when you think of like Grace Kelly or, um, uh, yeah, yeah, when you think of all of those beautiful, graceful, uh, elegant women, um, you know, and, and, and you think of these. Do you think it'll make us elegant and graceful, Linda? We could certainly give it a go. I'll give anything a go if, if, give it a go. if that's the end project. I think we need a lot more than uh, love. But it is, it is, it, it anyway. does well, give you, anyway. it does make you look a, um, what was it that? There was a, an it makes author. you stand a certain way, doesn't it? Um, yes, and also it gives you a, an elegance, doesn't it? Yes, an air of elegance. It really yeah. does. Yeah. And, I mean, there has been, through history, there has been so many um, women of stature. Yes. You know, historically from Elizabeth I in the 1500s all the way through to the modern day, where pearls are still... So important yep. in fashion. They're a status symbol, aren't they? Mm -hmm. um, and they still are to this day. But of course, you can make really contemporary pieces. Now, this kit here, we're going to make into a star buy. This is the big one. And oh my word, the jewellery that Linda has made never fails. Absolutely gorgeous star buy kit. Do you know something? Seed pearls are, are here at Jewelry Maker, uh, not the norm. We don't tend to bring them to wear very often. And I suppose the reason is, is because it's far more difficult to culture a strand of seed pearls than it is a larger strand of pearls. And the reason being quite simple, really, the, the, the pearl spends less time in the oyster. There's more you know, the pearl needs pearl, more... It? Yeah. Sorry, say again. It needs more hands-on, doesn't it? Precisely. It needs to be tended to more. You know, it, it, it's, it, if a pearl is in the oyster for, I don't know, uh, 18 months, two years, then you don't leave it on its own, but, 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 but it can kind of just get on with it. Whereas if pearls are... If you want seed pearls, they need a lot of attention. They need to be tended to. The turnaround is much, much greater, much quicker. So they're much more expensive to produce. However... If you go to, if you look on Pinterest, if you look on Instagram, or, if, or, or, or indeed if you've um, uh, 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 got married or been to a wedding recently, you'll notice pearls are everywhere. Whether it's sewn onto shoes or onto a bag or onto people's, or onto the bride's veil, mm -hmm. you know, they're gorgeous or used almost as like almost a gypsophilia kind of addition to uh, dried flower or, 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 or fresh flower arrangements. Um, seed pearls for me are superb and you've got, really effectively two strands of seed pearls here. 
these two um, smaller strands here are just gorgeous. This is the reason why I personally would come through and get this kit. I love seed pearls. It allows you to create such lovely intricate pieces. And as Linda was saying just a few moments ago, those hair pieces, those kind of hair vines, those slides, things for bridesmaids, flower girls, you know, you can make those more delicate little pieces. Oh, yeah, and talking again, let's, you know, because pearls do shriek wedding, don't they? Yes, they, shriek they wedding really wedding for the bridal do. party and for the wedding guests, really. You know, yes, of course, women yeah. would turn to pearls. And I mean, my niece got married a couple of weeks ago and, and even the little uh, flower girls, mm. um, I made them little pearl bracelets and that, and they love them and, and they, are, they will be wearing them um sweet you know for parties and things like of that. course and you're introducing these this beautiful gem to um to children and that's when that's when they learn and that's when they soak up and that's to be honest i think childhood should be made of memories oh and it's so nice wow. isn't it that when you're older to think oh i had a a pearl bracelet when i was seven you know um it's interesting, isn't it? These are the kind of things which, which you would never have thought, never have expected, you know, a child, a flower girl to be able to wear genuine pearls. It, you know, it's, it's got to be fake. It's got to be synthetic because pearls are so expensive, aren't they? Exactly. Not on Jewelry Maker. Oh, my word. We're at 119.99. We are nowhere near the price point. Nowhere near. Can I just say, you love your pearls. You love something a bit different. You love the texture that these give you. And that's, you know, one of the things Linda just said to me when we were, when we were just showing you the Star Vice thing is that, you know, she loves the texture of these, the way the light moves across them because they're not perfectly round. They're not perfectly smooth. But that's the beauty of them. Just put this kit in your basket. You get your silk with it in this beautiful kind of daffodil colour. And you also get a beautiful oval sterling silver clasp, uh, toggle clasp as well, which is absolutely beautiful. You get four strands of the most beautiful pearls. This is a bargain, an absolute bargain. Have a look at this. Now, it's $79.99. That's £20 a strand, and the rest of the kit is free. Hi, ladies. My mum has made a full suite for her 25th wedding anniversary next year. Now, that's a wonderful, that's a wonderful thing to do, Lauren. And I have to say, being able to do that is something which very few people are able to do, A, because maybe they don't have the know-how, but B, because they think, well, I can't, there's no way I can afford to do that. That pearls are hundreds and hundreds of pounds. Well, I'll do it at $79.99 for four strands of pearls. Loads in baskets, lots of people there. And whether you want to use these as individual strands, whether you want to get them all, um, whether you want to um, uh, kind of get all these pearls together and get that gorgeous texture uh, together, whether you want to kind of um, uh, use them all in one piece, uh, like this incredible necklace that Linda's made here. Uh, we are going to give you an even more fantastic price point. So already Shirley, Rhea, Lynn, Pat, Eva, Zoe, Angela, Maker, Ayrshire, and, and you've got three in your basket. Well done, sweetie. Check out as soon as you can. Just put it in your basket because we are going to take this down. We're going to do the unthinkable. We're going to break a barrier. Not $69.99, not even $59.99. 99. Shirley in Hertfordshire, well done. Thank you for joining us today. Get involved as soon as you can. All the way down. The opportunities, the potential, the scope for design is huge here at £49.99. Can you believe it? It's an incredible deal, isn't it? Well done, Elisa. Sorry, Elsa. Well done to you, my lovely. And Gwen, well done to you, my lovely. Fantastic. At $49.99. There's loads more of you joining. Oh, this is so good to see. Well done, everybody. You could go super modern like, um, uh, um, uh, like Linda's done with these incredible pieces. Um, uh, really, really beautiful uh, modern necklace here with that lovely asymmetric uh, pearl setting on the chain there. It's absolutely gorgeous. Or you can go dead classic and just make little, look, little stretchy bracelets just using the seed pearls. So simple. Little stretchies. So simple. So easy. So many have gone, but we've still got chances left. Guess what? Oh, gosh. We are about to give you the deal of deals. There is a reason why this kit is a star buy, and it's because at $49.99, although that's absolutely brilliant... We are nowhere near done. 
Justin, well done to you. There's more people there. Almost all of you are checking out your baskets. This is so good to see. Well done, maker in London now. Absolutely phenomenal. Here we go, everybody. Price point coming in in five, four, three, two, one. Angela, you've got two there. Check out my lovely, well done. Okay, here we go. Neary Nunu giving you every single penny off. Here we go, everyone. You're going to love this. £39.99. pence. Oh, my word. Now you can make jewellery for flower girls. Now you can make jewellery uh, which, which, which is, which is going to last a lifetime. And it is so inexpensive. And it's all down to our buying power, the way that we buy pearls, how long we've been buying pearls for, what we command. You know, we, we will not take any old rubbish. We want the absolute finest quality pearls. And we work so hard to to achieve that, don't we, Linda? Absolutely. And the, really, um, from the quality of these pearls here, what you can do as jewellery makers is make a set of uh, jewellery, whether it's necklaces, bracelets, earrings, rings, whatever, you can make that and possibly if you had to buy it or wanted to buy it mm. from a jewellery store, you wouldn't be able to afford it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. You see, and that's it, isn't it? it, it it's making, it's giving you access, not just to beautiful pearls, but making them affordable. It is achievable. It is affordable. Now, I, 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 there is that disclaimer, isn't there? Please don't think that this is the price point that these should retail for or would be valued at. What we're able to do here on Jewelry Maker is something, you know, something very, very special for absolutely everybody. And huge congratulations to everyone coming through. You're doing absolutely brilliantly. Well done, everyone. We've got um, something which we're going to be putting on pre-order and we'll play it after Linda's demo it's uh well it's 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 basically it's basically this it's a ladybird pendant with freshwater pearl so this is it made up uh on a chain you are going to be getting the components so you can make this ladybird pendant it's absolutely beautiful it's on pre-order right now you're going to be getting the pearl and you're going to be getting the ladybird sterling silver uh bale on top of that which is gorgeous uh it's at 19.99 on pre-order oh my word it's amazing. Get it now on pre-order. We're going to play it after the demo. Right. Now, what would you like to show us, lovely Linda? Well, that sort of statement drop necklace. This one? There. I love yeah. this. This is very um, Linda Brumwell. This piece here. No, the one next to it. Oh, this one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. sorry. Uh, Jimmy was right. Sorry, the, Jimmy. Um, he knows a statement necklace when he sees one. Yes. I've been wanting to make a design like that for a long time, but I've never have. had enough product to do yes, it. Yes, that's really. it. Yeah. And I do like to see a statement piece, but that, within that statement, seeing the same gem. Yeah. Uh, okay, you could argue it's not a gem, it's an organic, but I'm still going to call the pearl a gem. Because yes. It is yes. For me. Most um, definitely. So that particular um, necklace, I can actually sort of talk you through the the um mm. the, the first stage the first stage is the the threading of the the neckline yeah um and that you could do on your um silk alike you could do it on the i uh, on the um on the silk thread that you have <laughs> See, a piece like that is lovely for the decolletage oh the decolletage Dan. Look, um, I love that. As close to elegant as I've ever been, says Dan. Thank you for that, Dan. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> Gee whiz. So really, that, that is the first uh, part to love do, is, is if you're doing it for yourself, obviously you want to sort of um, do it to fit around the neckline. Of course. Now, that I would say is possibly... Sorry, I should have measured that. That's all right, me. darling. It's I would imagine that's a, about an 18. Imagine an 18 inch chain. Yeah. I would yeah. think that's 18 inches of mm. pearls. Now, when you get down um, a quarter, so in other words, you're going to attach your clasp. Yeah. And then you're going to start threading. Yeah. So you attach one half of your clasp and then you're going to start your threading. Yep. So you thread. Can you just count how many pearls I've threaded before I've one, put two, in the jump three, rings? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven. So eleven pearls yep. and then add A jump 19 ring. jump rings. Yep. I've put in. Okay. Um, and then obviously then eleven more pearls and then the rest, uh, the other part of the class. Okay. 
So those jump rings are there for um, decoration purposes, design mm -hmm. purposes, and also to drop the waterfalls from. Of course, um, yeah. With a design like this, it's always better to determine that centre drop first. Now that centre drop there has got six of the uh, small, the larger seed pearl. Yes. Six, no, seven, hasn't it? Seven of the larger seed pearl. Mm -hmm. And then the, um, it, it culminates in one of the larger. The pearls. larger ones, yeah. So the seed okay. pearls, basically, if I can sort of tidy this up a little bit, is um, if I put those there like so, you can see that there they have a simple loop yep. on each side. Now I've made those first. So if you've got seven on that middle one and then either side of that needs six, mm. so in other words, jot it down on a piece of paper, get your balance worked out. Yes. Oh. So seven um, with a simple loop either side, which yep. I'll, I'll show you in a moment, and then two sixes, mm -hmm. two fives, yep. two fours, and then I did two times threes, yes. two times twos, and two times one. Okay. It just gives that more accent to that sort of... Graduation. Uh, yes. It just gives that little bit more solidity yeah, yeah. as it meets the neckline so that mm. the pearls on the drops don't get lost within the larger pearls yeah. around the neckline, if you see what I mean. Uh -huh. So to do um, the larger seed pearls, yeah. I took... I, I was lucky enough to have some... 0.4 sterling silver wire. Look on oh, the side. Oh, wow, yes. We may well have some. Mm -hmm. So 0.4 is, um, is absolutely fine. And also pearls, just take off about three inches. Yep. Pearls, um, by the nature of being a pearl, are always drilled in accordance with the size of the pearl. Yes, yes. So the smaller you get, the smaller your drill hole's going to be. So you could always try, if you haven't got any 0.4 wire, yep. then you can always try the featherweight head pin. Okay. Okay? So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take my length of my wire, mm -hmm. and then with my flat nose pliers, I'm going to pop my wire through the flat nose pliers, just here where there is a graduation on the pliers. Mm -hmm. You can see that there is a point at which then I can get all of my links the same length so what i do is i just pop that through to where that graduation comes to a point and then i pop it out a couple of mil okay okay and then just push down on the wire downwards strengthen the wire by holding tight on that bend and then with your index finger and your thumbnail you strengthen the wire by just pulling down on it so you get a nice uh, sorry right angle so what I'm going to do now, that is about a centimetre or just under a centimetre in length. So about a centimetre or just under a centimetre on the round nose pliers, place the very end of um, that little um, turn back and then pinching it tightly in your round nose pliers, put your finger and thumb actually on the bend there to stay above yeah. it and then twisting slowly until your elbow becomes very uncomfortable. Just get round in that, that little sort of uh, beginning of a heart shape shape and then pop it back where it fits and then ease it down. Ease it down until it meets the spine, okay? And then that is the time then to slip on your pearl let that drop to the loop and then tightly hold the pearl really tightly, keeping it right on top of that loop there and then push down on the wire again, creating a 90 degree angle to the pearl. Yeah. And then again, so I can see it by eye around a centimetre or just under. Uh -huh. Remove the excess again. About the same length down the plier. Okay, pull to my left. 
because I'm right-handed, so I'm going to my left, yep. pull it round, pop it back where it fits, and then ease it around. And that then make as many of those as you've worked out, starting off with your seven, two sixes, two fives, two fours, two times the three, two times the two, and two times one. Um, so that you've then got your stash of um, simple loop either end of your um, larger seed pearl. And then I have then taken uh, my featherweight head pins and then with the larger potato pearl, I've slipped that onto the head pin. So the head pin provides me with that stopper. So now I'm going to go halfway through a wrapped loop. So I'm placing, again, about a centimetre down the plier. I'm placing that tightly right on top of the pearl and the head pin tightly uh, through the pliers. Push away, so you're pushing to a right angle to the plier. Slightly open your plier and flick your wrist around. And then bring that back through the 180 degrees over and push well down on the plier. Remove your pliers. And you've now got what I always call my question mark stage. So you've now got a point there that you can slip through the simple loop on your seed pearl. Just let gravity um, take the weight of the pearl. Pop your plier back where it fits again, sandwiching the pearl in the bend of the loop. Pop it back. Bring the excess wire from the head pin over the top of the pearl and then taking the end of the head pin just go up into a nice round loop and then if you're using sterling silver mm -hmm. uh, findings you may just as well put a little bead cap and use the whole of that uh, head pin up because the lower you get towards the pearl then you'll get a little cap it'll follow the top of the pearl, and all with that little bit of excess, just pull that in, pull that in slightly, so that excess gets buried under the coil of that bead cap. Gorgeous. And then again, um, taking another of the. And I think just well, take see, taking well. the time to do these and make sure that all the loops are the right way and, and oh, yeah, you know, work, it. it is going to make such yeah. a difference to the way it's your totally jewellery moves, it. isn't yeah. it? And the overall design, it's going to look now, fantastic. A, uh, you see, now my, the pearl has just come out of that seed pearl. That yes. I, now that is possibly quite a good thing for that to happen, not, not as a general technique, mm. but just the fact that I can now show you that the difference is in the simple loop the reason it came out is because there's this little gap here yeah yeah, so yeah. i can now open that so all is not lost because i can open that which you can't open a wrap loop i can pop it back on and then pull that back down and then make sure with my flat nose pliers that is really closed and then take your flat nose pliers and really push down on that closure and just check that because a featherweight head pin will drop through a small little gap yeah right so again we're going to repeat that with the next seed pearl so i'm going to open and then before i actually pop it the next one on i'm just going to check all of these loops are completely as closed as they can be Sometimes one will get past, but again, because the loops can be opened, all isn't lost. Pop through that loop of the previous one. And then again, you're opening and closing just like a jump ring. Again, popping your pliers onto that closure and really press down. Yeah, nice. That is quite a good tip, actually, where the wire meets the first part of that simple loop. Yeah. If you just press down in order to yeah. make sure that those loops are all firmly closed. Uh-huh. So you continue doing that 
Um, and add, as I, on my design, I've added, as I said, the seven on the first one. Uh -huh. And then you've got your, uh, if you could pass me that necklace over. Of course, darling, yeah. Minute. Thank you very much. I love that. What we've got here is we've got our uh, jump ring, which is sat there between the two pearls. As you can see, I've opened up that final seed pearl simple loop and just attached it to the jump ring. And... Then I've done two lots containing six seed pearls and yes. added the larger, which is being the larger pearl that's threaded on the to the head pin. Uh -huh. And then worked around. <coughs> as I was to say I've used nineteen altogether. If you've got um, an odd number, then you've always got a center. So you've got your center, but either side of the center, that's sort of designated by the fact that you've got an even number either side then. So if you don't want that many drops, then go down to 17, 15, 30. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But go down into odd numbers. So I you think you've done it. I, I, I think, though, that, 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 is, that works for that, for that length of necklace. It works beautifully. And I like the way that you've doubled up on quite a few of the tassels yeah, I mean, to make it, to give it that. Yeah, I mean, just doubling up on the side here gives a little bit more um, de oh, delineation, I think. Yes, OK, yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. There, it gives a little bit more interest going on here at the side before you finally go into what is meant to be quite a delicate waterfall. Yes. It's gorgeous. Um, so it's a very, it's an elegant design. It's a design that you can use in all sorts of mm. gemstones. Um, but it, it's, it's elegant, but it's not a difficult piece to do. Mm -hmm. It looks more complex than it actually is. Than it actually is, is. yeah. It's just yeah. literally nice. threading and going back to the old uh, wrapped and simple loop it, it, technique. It's so, it's so lovely. Thank you so much. And worth taking the time on, just so you get that wonderful movement within Definitely. the necklace as well. It's gorgeous. Um, speaking of gorgeous, we've got an amazing star by coming up now. Time for the Ladybird uh, Pearl Pendant. <laughs> We've got a fantastic ladybird pearl pendant for you now. This really is, this is just stunning. We were, we, we've had lots of bees recently, haven't we? And lots of people, um, um, you know, becoming very um, uh, interested in bees and what bees mean and what they kind of stand for. But ladybirds, ladybirds are absolutely gorgeous. I love a ladybird. Um, according to Dan Truman, find him on Facebook, um, the spots on ladybirds are meant to be where they've taken our bad luck so we can be lucky. Aww. So each one of those spots is so that they can absorb some of our bad luck. Mm. I like that. I like it, but it makes me feel sorry for the ladybird. Yeah. So I know. But... Yeah, but, you know, that is probably one of the nicest things that any what? animal could do for any other animal. Isn't it? Is to take away some of your bad luck. I like it. Uh, You've, we're going to give you a clock to graphics. 30-second clock to graphics. These have been on pre-order, and they've absolutely, they've absolutely um, uh, stormed into... Oh, no, hang on, where are you? There you are, there you are. I was, I was on the wrong one. Jimmy's getting it all right today. I'm, I'm the one who's messing everything up today. Um, absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? It's so, so, so beautiful. We've got loads and loads and loads of people uh, coming through for these, which is absolutely stunning. Uh, really, really happy about that. I do love a ladybird. It's gorgeous. Like it, It's kind of... I think of ladybird books. Yes, absolutely. Um, I think of childhood. Yeah. Um, I think of, you know, uh, and, and ladybirds are beautiful when they take off because their wings, as you can see here, they kind of split, don't they? And they take off. They're really beautiful uh, little beasts, aren't they? They're absolutely gorgeous. And when everything else in the garden tends to be kind of quite brown or green, it's always so lovely to see that flash of red. Do you find, um, I mean, I don't know about you, Carol, but, and I know this is a bit, sounds a bit bonkers, but whenever I find a ladybird in the house and I think, you know, gently I'm going to put it back out. Oh, yes. Around the flower bed. Yes. But I tend to talk to ladybirds. Do you? I do, yeah. Well, they, well, they're friendly, aren't they? Yeah. It's just one of those creatures you, you have a chat with. <laughs> Neri's found a really, a really interesting slide. This is where they live. In the world. Uh, everywhere. Everywhere apart from like you've got you've got that centerpiece of Africa, which I guess is is that that looks like it's Lake. Um, oh, is it Kariba or or? or 
And then, and then you've got it everywhere, apart from the Great Lakes in Northern America, but basically everywhere, apart from the kind of the very, very north and the very, very south, where there's a lot of snow or lots of water. They don't tend to live there. But apart from that, they live pretty much everywhere. Yes, it is water. It's a big lake. What is that lake called? Is it Lake Kariba? I think it's Lake... Ah, oh, I don't... doesn't matter. Oh, is it blue? I thought it was green. Oh, it's blue. <laughs> okay, so they'll probably live there as well. Uh, no, I hate water. Perhaps they go there on their holes. Well, there we go. Yes, Linda. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> Do they migrate, Lady Bird? This has got... I really... I don't know. Maybe next time you get one in your house, you can ask it and it'll... I will do. That's Neary, a good take idea. take that. Take that. No, Neary, take that slide away. That's the most rubbish slide Look. you've ever found. Take that away. Stop pointing at it with the pointy thing. Take the slide away. Thank you. Right. Just forget about the slide. Neary, burn the slide. Right. Lady birds are an important predator. Of, thank goodness, let's get back on track. Important predator of insect herbivores in, in managed and natural ecosystems throughout the world. Thus, they play a tremendous role in protecting crop and non-crop plants from the ravages of herbivores. That, that, well, I was trying to tell my daughters the other day, I think that's, I think that's one, of the, um, one of the benefits of, uh, one of the only benefits of uh, wasps. I think they're meant to kill other pests and things like that. Ladybird, uh, ladybirds are the gardener's friends, says Ms. Janet. Well, there you go. They're gorgeous. I, mean, I think they must keep, uh, kill green fly or something. I'm not entirely sure. I think sure. they do, actually. Um, yes, they do. Morning. I love ladybirds. Uh, but they do bite, do they? Oh, blimey. I've never been bitten by a ladybird. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, Neary's going to be on the internet now Googling pictures of uh, ladybird bites and things like that. <laughs> oh, when ladybirds turn bad. Uh, anyway, this one's very friendly and it won't bite you. It's beautiful. Gee whiz. Um, so it's solid sterling silver. A real connection with kind of childhood and kind of, uh, kind of uh, finding them in your garden, daisy chains, things like that. It's really, really beautiful little uh, ladybird. You've got your pin set there. Can I show you the pearl you are getting with this? Now, you would have thought we would have gone for maybe a pearl, which is maybe slightly substandard because, you know, it's been covered up by most of the lady. But that is one of the most perfect round pearls I've ever seen. It's absolutely incredible. People buying twos, threes, fours of these, which is great to see. That's one of the most perfect round pearls. Um, uh, it, it, it's incredible. Um, Oh, here we go. Collector in California. It's interesting that in the UK, you call them ladybirds, but here in the USA, you call them ladybugs. Yes, I know. Mm -hmm. I know. Yes, I've got, a, I've got an American friend who calls them ladybugs. And she calls everybody a little ladybug. Ladybirds eat green flies. There we go, Karen. So they are the gardener's friend. They get them off your roses. And yeah, there we go. Fantastic. So, okay. Another good message. Hi, the collective of ladybirds is a... Oh, I love Julie. The of ladybirds. I like that. Oh, Julie. What is there not to love? A loveliness of ladybirds. Right, Kinga, out you come. Okay, Kinga, come here, darling. We've got gorgeous Kinga here from Poland. This is gorgeous cake. King, or what is a ladybird or ladybug known as in Polish? The ladybird in Polish language is pszczoła. 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 Well done. Pszczoła. Pszczoła. Well done. I don't know. I think she might be lying. I think that might be a swear word or something. She's definitely going to get us taken off air. Pszczoła. Sounds like a vodka to me. It does. Yeah. Pszczoła. Ha. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Live long and prosper. Push yeah. Stoa. Yeah, down, <laughs> down the hat. Right, OK. Anyway, loads of people coming through for these. It's great to see. Well done. £19.99 is your deal today. Well done to everybody. What a gorgeous, gorgeous little piece. And do you know what's so sweet? Something to do with kind of childhood, something which is just so... Um, um, Utterly, utterly beautiful. And I think of, like I was saying earlier, I think of Ladybird books. I always used to love Ladybird books, you know, or, you know, the Ladybird series of books. And, you know, just absolutely love all the little fairy tales and all the illustrations. So for me, it's got that kind of memory of childhood as well. Uh, but £19.99, pence. Donna, well done to you, Kim, Maker, Martin. I'll never forget when the nine month, when my nine month old daughter was on the, uh, she must have been, no, she must have been older than that. No, she wasn't, no, she had teeth. So I think she must have been about a year. She was on the track. Trampoline, 
And I saw her tracing a little ladybird. A ladybird was crawling. She was just kind of tracing with her finger. I thought, oh, this is a beautiful moment, a connection between, you know, child and nature. And then she picked it up and ate it. <laughs> <laughs> she ate a dead wood louse the week after oh. as well. It's oh, just so lovely. A bit of protein um, then. They eat green fly. They always remind uh, me of 1960, uh, 1970s, 19-something gas... Oh, 1976, as there was an infestation in Southport when we went to visit. And yes, they do bite, says Miss Janet. Blimey. They swarm, don't they, Ladybird? Oh, gosh, we're not they? painting a very nice picture. They are beautiful, they're lovely, and this one will not bite. But I wish I could. Gee whiz. It's a good job people love these, isn't it? Oh, you like the black ones with the yellow? Oh, I've never picked one of those up. They always look slightly frightening. They're, they like may the be spots. the ones that bite, perhaps, the ones with the... Maybe the they, I don't know. The yellow spot. I don't know. 1999, Muriel Lynn's got two, Angela's got four. You buying these for prezzies, maybe? They're great for bridesmaids, really sweet for, uh, you know, teachers or childhood friends, maybe. Uh, well done to you. You've got your, um, you've got your little, yeah, yeah, of course, of course it's going to be easy for you to attach the pearl on there, Dan. No problem at all. So you've got your little pin there, which is slightly serrated. Um, if it needs reaming, if the pearl doesn't want to go on there straight away, you just need to ream that pearl there with a little pearl reamer, just very, very gently. And then apply a little bit of glue to the pin or to the hole? To the say? pin. To the pin. And then Only pop it in. a tiny amount so that it doesn't bubble up above the, the pearl itself. Yes. A little bit of E6000, one of those needle tip glues. Mmm. And leave it for 24 hours. Or a little bit of UV resin. Gorgeous. This isn't the first time a ladybird has rocked. Oh my word, a Fabergé heritage yellow diamond, yellow gold diamond and turquoise gush enamel ladybird surprise locket. Look at that. I think it's been, I think mm. it has possibly, a ladybird has possibly featured in jewelry pieces for uh -huh. decades and decades. You imagine a um, charm bracelet there's always going to be a ladybird charm. Yes. From decades ago, right up into the, the, the charms now. It is. Pandora you see them charms, charms and, all the time, don't yeah, you? Yeah, Symbol of luck. Yes. And talking about the ladybug, ladybird phenomena, I mean, I don't know about your girls, but my grandchildren, I, I, because I, it's sort of summer holidays and that, I had my two, I had the twins the other day. Oh, hilarious. And I got their lunch and they wanted to go outside, so the umbrella goes up and the sun cream goes on and they go outside. Within two or three minutes, it's, ah, 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 it's a bug, there's a bug on me. You know, but you go out there, yeah, okay, it may be a wasp or one of those sort yes, of... Yes, but if there's um, ladybirds, they pick them up, don't they? But if it's a ladybird, a you don't ever hear any, yes. any, a child go, ah, the ladybird, get it it's off like, me. What I found. They're, not, they're, they're always so joyful true. rather than yes. frightened, aren't they? They're just beautiful. They look beautiful. Zoe in Lincolnshire, well done to you, my lovely. Anita in Ayrshire, so many people coming through. Well done to everyone. Well, whatever it ignites in you, whether it's a little childhood memory, whether it's ladybird books, whether it's because you, you know, you see them as a symbol of luck, whatever it might be, or you just love insects. I think it's an insect. Is it an insect? Oh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It is an insect, isn't it? It's got six it's legs. It's not a bird, that's for sure. <laughs> Well, it's not a dog. Exactly. Oh, there we go. <laughs> so loads of multi bit as well. Is it a fish? Uh, but fantastic. Well done. 1999. Loads in baskets. Do check out when you can. Absolutely superb. Right, coming up next, um, we've got the most amazing hour with the most incredible pearls and the most amazing, amazing uh, brand new pieces. We've also got spiny oyster turquoise coming up in the 11 o'clock hour, which I cannot wait no, I'm for. I'm really looking for forward to seeing that. I don't mm. think we have ever had strands of that. I've never done. I've I've never no, done I'm strands. Not I've only ever done cabs. Yeah, exactly. which is why it's going to be so exciting. Usable strands. So excited about that. Um, yeah. So don't go anywhere. More coming up in just a couple of seconds. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Join us for the tales of Jade. This is a gemstone that has been revered for well over 4,000 years. It has been uncovered in archeological sites dating back to the Neolithic era. Every single dynasty that has ruled over China has valued this stone above gold, and us mere mortals are never meant to own it. After visiting Myanmar in 2018 and hearing about the stories from that part of the world, from that side of the border, we wanted to bring to an event where we uncover the true tales of jadeite, steeped in folklore and mystery. This event is where you collect to get to experience all the different varieties, all the different colors. Essentially, every jadeite we have ever acquired, that we have ever procured from the Far East, will be available for a limited time only and for the best and incredible deals. This is your chance to get your jadeite happily ever after. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Make sure you join us this Saturday on Jewelry Maker for Rumble in the Jungle. And we've got everything you would expect to see. So amazing deals on amber. We've got incredible animal charms, animal themed kits. We've got seed beads. We've even got a sterling silver elephant wearing a peridot. See you then on Saturday. Oh, how exciting. So thank you so much for joining us uh, today for Oyster Day. Uh, we couldn't bring you Oyster Day without bringing you things like this. And of course, we've got Dave with us today. Uh, what an exciting uh, offering we've got today. So what, what we have is what's known in the industry as kind of wish list pearls. You know, mm. we have uh, the offerings that we bring you from time to time. And then there are, there are offerings that are seldom seen on the market. Yeah, and when they arrive, you know, we can't say, okay, we're going to bring 200 of them, we're going to bring them five, six times a year. We're talking about when we get the opportunity, we seize it, we take it, and we're bringing it to you. So those of you that are here for Oyster Day that love working with all things of the ocean, I know we've got the, the spiny oyster coming up, I know we have lots of different shell, wonderful pearls. For those of you that want that point of separation, that point of difference, that something extra special, this is what we're bringing to you. Now, the, the natural colors in the pearl industry have all but disappeared. Okay, this is as a direct result of the COVID-19 pandemic. And what we saw when we kind of went to the gem shows this year was price hikes, 
you know, right up there. I mean, ridiculous prices. And the, the real problem is going to come in the next two years. Because when the COVID pandemic hit, you still had the previous harvest. Yeah. Okay, so although the prices jumped 20%, you know, 40%, you still had that harvest to rely on, you still had pearls in the market. Now we have to wait three, four years to see this material come back. And as such, anyone who's got this material, any of the pearl dealers, any of the vendors are holding it because they can't replace it. And if they are replacing it, then they're replacing it at sky high premiums. And these were practically new to the market anyway. You know, the natural, but not the dyed material, but the natural purples, the natural kind of apricots or the papayas, they really only emerged in some sort of volume in about 2018. And that was at the Hong Kong Gem Show. And, you know, people went crazy for them. We've seen how popular they've become. We've brought them to you. But we have to realign our thinking because going forward, these are the hardest to come by. You know, when we think of South Sea pearl production or Tahitian pearl production, it's been around for many, many years. It's commercialized. I mean, I've been to the Paspali pearl farm in Western Australia, which does 90% of the world's South Sea pearls. And the operation is huge. I mean, it's vast swathes of ocean that are dedicated nurseries to literally millions of, of, of clams, of oysters. And even one of the boats that they took me out in was part of a fleet. And the one boat was like $4 million. So it's like a luxury yacht. You know, and people are living on there all year, <clears throat> working with this material. So that, of course, that's been hit hard. But think about how many of those pearls are in production. These only really came to prominence in 2018 with small family-run pearl farms when we talk about the natural colors. And as such, they've been hit far harder and are much scarcer in the industry. And even with the, the kind of natural purple pearls, naturally colored purple pearls that are in the market that we are very fortunate to have for you today, even when that's going on, when they're, when they're finding purple pearls, they are extremely, extremely expensive. And this, is, this speaks to that perfectly. There's a headline here. I know you've seen it before, but I want to uh, read it to you. You know, this gentleman discovers uh, a natural purple pearl. Now, it is completely natural, but what I want you to understand is natural pearls were, used to be the most expensive commodities in the world, right? Yeah. So Cartier's Fifth Avenue store, on, uh, the mansion that once was in Fifth Avenue, was yeah, bought yeah, yeah. with a strand of pearls. It's the old course, story. yes. And that's because they were extremely expensive. Then Mickey Moto figured out how to culture pearls, mm -hmm. and natural pearl prices took a you know dive bomb. You know the the, the prices went right down, mm -hmm. and you would expect that of the natural coloured pearls in the market. But that hasn't happened because we don't have the volume. So even with the small production of purple pearls, natural purple pearls are still extremely expensive. And if we look into this article, I want you to take a look at the date. This is 2020. Okay, so this is even this is in the midst of obviously the COVID pandemic, but also yeah. the production of naturally purple pearls. <clears throat> but still, they're extremely expensive. You know, valued at... That, that pearl, you saw it next to the gentleman's finger, it was tiny. It's valued at between three and $5,000. Uh, and when these pearls are found, oh, here is wow. another one. It goes to auction. It's not huge. It looks big because they're photographing it. But that estimate is 15 to 20 grand. Just a single pearl, not a strand. And this is because there isn't enough production of the, the naturally coloured cultured pearls of purple or papaya to offset the prices for the naturals. There just isn't enough for, for consumption. There isn't enough for the market. The supply and demand is completely out of kelter. And then, like I said to you, in 2018, when they started producing these, we saw vendors like Jack Lynch, who's a gentleman that I've seen at the gem shows before. Um, his company is called Sea Hunt Pearls. They're based in San Francisco. And he acquired this incredible strand, like unparalleled strand of these naturally colored purples. And he sent it to the GIA because in all his time in the industry, he's been in the industry a lot longer than me. And unlike me, he only deals with pearls. You know, I deal with emeralds, kyanite, tourmalines. This gentleman just deals with pearls, so he knows what's going on. And when he acquired this full strand, <coughs> he sent it to the GIA and he said, these can't be natural. Like, I've acquired yes. it, but they can't be natural. And the GIA came back and they said, they are natural. We've been out to the farms. This is like 2018. Goodness me. There's a couple of pearl farms that are doing it. They're in the Hunan, uh, Hunan and Hubei provinces of China. Yeah. And they've been doing it for about three and a half to four years. They're extremely rare. And you know, Jack, Jack Lynch of Sea Hunt Pearls was very fortunate to have that strand. And they actually debuted at the Hong Kong show in 2019. And the initial harvest, there's only been one harvest, were priced at sky-high premiums, especially the perfect round pearls, well into the high thousands. And even there, this is Hong Kong, this is thousands of dollars, this is wholesale. It's a GIA. It's very hard to get the consistency of colour. Yes. You, you're very fortunate to get any colour naturally. It's amazing. Okay. 
that. But you can see that's not pure purple. There's some whites in there, which is yes, amazing. Course, some peach yeah. colors. There's some ones <coughs> with like a, a blue or gray overtone. And then you've got the lavenders through to the violets. But it's hard to, because we haven't got mass commercialized production. It's hard to produce what we have for you today. And that's why usually when you see me on your show with Carol, we have like big quantities, which is incredible, like 300. Yeah, it's yeah. going to be great. Our first offering today has less than 30. Wow. And that's a miracle. That really is a miracle. This material is maybe one of the most in-demand pearls in the world today. And there are you know, high jewelry stores in London. There's one called Yoko of London, which have a high jewelry collection. And they're bringing to the market you know, the, the same kind of naturally colored purple pearls wow. they, in their Novus collection. It is amazing. I mean, obviously, it's 18 karat gold. They are perfectly matched. You, know, you can see that consistency of color. You can see the size. I mean, I'm in love with it. It's amazing. But you'll notice it's price and application. It's price and application. I was going to say, I can't even see the price. No, no. But this is the reality in the current climate for these pearls. They've disappeared from the market. And, and you know, we're talking about high jewelry boutiques that can offer this material. We're really fortunate. And, and it's amazing that we do business the way that we do, that we, if we get a great deal you know, before COVID and we get a deal like this, we don't, yes. cha we don't change our prices to reflect what's happening in the wow. current climate. Whereas most dealers <laughs> won't sell their material because they can't replace it. We have to because we're live and we have to have a show. Yes, so we go, no, we're going to give it to our collectors and we're going to give you an incredible deal. But we have a responsibility to tell you that going forward, it's going to be very difficult for us to get you the natural colors, Gosh. especially of this consistency and these sizes. And even like a ring, again, it's a oh, completely it's different different proposition because yeah. it's 18 karat white gold, but you're talking thousands of pounds. Yeah. And it's perfect round, it's large, and they do the earrings and they can be you know, 5,000 or 8,000 pounds. But the, the, and just remember, it's like uh, with Tanzanite. You know, you'll have heard the wonderful Steve Bennett tell you who's been to the mine, whether it's from Tiffany or from Gemporia. Yeah. Tanzanite only comes from one place, right? <laughs> it only comes from one place. Exactly, yeah. And this is what we're talking about now. You've heard the GIA say these naturally colored purple pearls that are cultured only <laughs> come from Hunan and Hubei. So whether you're Yoko in London or indeed jewelry maker here, Yes. We're buying from the same yeah. place because it's the only pearl farms that can produce them. We're just bringing you them as very different propositions. Uh -huh. I did request the price on that necklace that you couldn't see the price on, and you can see it. Well, I, I noticed that you could finance it from £937 a month. Yeah. And I don't, know if, I don't, know if, I don't even know if that's interest-free, Carol. <laughs> uh, but, you know, this is, this is yeah. why, honestly, this is why I love what yes. we do because we are the, the outliers in the industry. We, I always look at the, the jewellery industry. Um, it's... It's very old. You know, you think of De Beers, over 100 years old. You think of Tiffany, been around since the, the 1800s. We think of Fabergé. We think of Van Cleef. They have these incredible histories that we cannot compete with. Okay, and it's all who you know. There's in, inverted snobbery. Sometimes if you want to even just go and gaze on that incredible jewellery. Yeah, it's very different yeah. to what we bring you. You don't feel like you're good enough. You know, you have to ring a bell to get in. I've been there. And I've, I've been around the world and seen some of the most incredible gemstones. I've been to the mines. And even I feel, you know, inferior when I walk into one of those boutiques. You know, yes. I feel like I shouldn't be here. Yes. I feel like an imposter. And sometimes they make, you know, you can be made to feel like that. Mm. And I look at the jewelry industry and they are, and I might get in trouble for this, but I look at them and I say, they're, they're dinosaurs, right? They're hundreds of years old. They have their kind of boys club and they're, they're the set pricing. We are the asteroid. We are the asteroid. We're shaking things up. We're coming along. We're doing things so differently. And that's what we're doing right now. And it's very exciting to be part of, to, mm. to be part of an incredible <laughs> place that we are here where everyone is interested in bringing you the best value. That's all it is. It, we get a great deal and we pass it on. Just enough of a margin to keep the lights on uh, and to keep bringing you these incredible deals. And this is why it's very different here at Jewel Maker than, than Gems TV, even just, and we're you know, a few feet away. This is why you guys can prosper as businesses. Mm. There are, you guys are, make your own jewelry, create your own jewelry. I know you have your own boutiques, whether you sell on the internet or you have a physical store or, or a store. Yes. We are wholesalers, essentially, and we shouldn't be. We should be retailers. But we're offering you these incredible deals. So I requested the price on that, and it was £22,500. Goodness me. And, and it's worth every penny. It absolutely is. It's, Beautiful. it's, it's yeah. amazing. Gorgeous. And we have... The, the, the same pearls. In fact, I am just going to do this. And I, know, I know this isn't even the first... Sorry, Carol. No, I know. I know but, this but isn't even the first piece we're going to bring you. We've just been looking at the recording off, off, off screen and, and that. It is just... It is I mean, this is, this is what you're going to get the chance to own right now. This but we don't have 300, we don't have 500, but it's not going to be 22 grand. And I'm just going to show you live in the studio 
If I walked into that London boutique, Yoko of London, I said, can I see yep. that pearl necklace in the window? And they opened it up. Oh my gosh. And it looked like this, right? Yep. And it comes nice. in this velvet box. And, and like you said, Carol, they said, hey, we can finance this for you. And it was 957 pounds a month. Oh my gosh. And again, you, see, you even see the same material. And I know Tom Neary's just found it from, from the GIA that studied it. You know, the, the, the piece that the Jack Lynch, um, uh, sea hunt pearls who, who when he first saw these he said they cannot thank you guys they cannot be real they can't well they can be real but they must be dyed yes because in all my it. expertise in all my years I've never seen anything like it well he sent it to the GIA and they said no these are absolutely naturally colored these are produced like this and that's it is incredible what Ollie is showing you and what we are you know, showcasing right now but even rarer oh than this gosh. proposition even rarer than this proposition is the one on that plinth next to you, Carol? Wow. Oh, 100%. This is purple flash, or we call it lilac flash, fireball pearls. Yeah. And I remember speaking to a lady um, at Tucson, and she explained to me how these are produced. Gosh. And it blew my mind. Because these, regardless, I know they come from, this is sensational. Oh. I know they come from wow. the culturing process, so they're, they're farmed and they're produced. But when you're farming pearls, I just want you to understand this, because I've, I've been to the pearl farms. They are farming for rounds. Of course. Okay, they, they are, that's how they're set up, okay? So they are set up to farm for rounds. These are accidents. And yes, this is the miracle yes. because the actual oyster that this, this particular uh, pearl grows in, I didn't know this, I'm not a pearl expert, so I speak to people that are. And she explained to me that what happens is when they, when they put this in, in the, the nucleated sac, when they put the, the nucleus in there, because it will have a nucleus inside because it is from the culturing process. Yes, yes. They'll leave it for like four years, right? Because you can see the size of these. They're like 18 mil. So they leave it. And when they take it out, usually what they're looking for is a round pearl. A round pearl that is actually, the, if you look back at those, you see it's like a golden color with, with the purple color. Yes. But they look, what they're farming for is it, <laughs> that kind of apricot color, but a big round. Yes. Okay, so if, if these are fireballs, the bit of it that is, that is not the tail, yes. so the, the, the kind of rounded side of it, yes. that's what they're hoping to find. What happens? You know, I don't know, I can't give you the percentage. You know, if it was one in 10, one in 50, one in 100, one in 1,000, I don't know. I know they're rare. Yes. Occasionally, they'll slip out of that sack, and then they will rest on the lip of the oyster, and the lip oh, of this particular wow. oyster is purple, and it absorbs the color. So you get, that's why they're not full body color purple, because it is the part of it that, that is growing, uh, and, 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 you know, the, the nacre is wrapping around it as it lies on that lip, absorbing that color. So these are yeah. purple sash or purple flash pearls mm -hmm. and again I said to you I'm not a pearl expert but there are people that just deal in pearls mm -hmm. just oh, that's all they do you know just as there are people that just deal in sapphires and one of them is an incredible incredible uh, team called Pearl Paradise I think yeah. they're husband and wife and they have this incredible blog that they do I always read it when they go to either Tucson JCK or Hong Kong yes and they let their collectors their clients know what they're looking for so there's on day one they're saying we're supposed to be looking for Tahitian loose rounds but this small lot of you know, gold and South Sea Keshis caught our eye and they talk oh, about the Japanese stunning. vendor. That's incredible. So they're giving you their itinerary. It's day one. Then they say on day two, we stopped um, to, to buy our freshwater pearl friends booth just to say hi before searching for Okoya pearls. So their itinerary was they wanted to get the, the Tahitians on the first day, the Okoyas on the second day. Mm -hmm. And usually these shows are like over the course of a weekend or three days. And they say they always make time on the last day, if they do have time, to look for what they call mm -hmm. wish list pearls. Wish list pearls. And I predominantly buy gemstones. So when I go to the gem shows with Jake and, and with Steve, we have what we need to buy. So we yeah. know we've got to buy tanzanite. We've, we've got to buy garnets. We've got to buy tourmalines. We look at what we're low on. Okay, we need to get some more Zambian emeralds. Yeah. But then we'll make time for what we call the wish list. And it's like, let's go and find something incredible. Most of the time we can't find anything, you know, because it's very hard and rare. But, and we'll talk to our incredible teams here and they'll say, they always say the same things because they, they, they think we're miracle workers. They go, can you get us Brazilian Paraba? Can you get us pink diamonds? Can you get us, you know, cashmere sapphires, yes. which we can never do. But we're always looking for those incredible finds, just as Pearl Paradise are. And they say on the last day, oh. she says, Jeremy and I get to look for fun pearls, which is usually on the last day of the show. This is when we can concentrate on looking for wish list pearls. And let me show you how, you know, That's people, stunning. yeah, it's, it's amazing. But people who are only buying pearls, it's all they buy, Pearl Paradise, let me show you what a parcel looks like. Okay, because you're, we're spoiled right now to have a strand. Yes. But that's 
what they look. That's, that's what wow. they bought. That's what they bought. And I, we can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen pearls. Fourteen pearls. None of them, none of them will match. In fact, the one in the center at the top is a very different shape to the others. And then down at the bottom, it doesn't even fit in the color parameters of the top ones. Yeah. You know, they're just occasional pearls. And not, not one of them is like what we would consider purple flash. Mm. When I went to Tucson this year, I felt like the most incredible man in the whole show. And do you know why? Because I had one of these strands. And I literally took it with me to see if I could find anyone else who could also provide these strands. So I had this strand, and I'd go to every Pearl vendor's booth, and I'd say, look, we've got this. Can you offer anything like this? And because of what's happened with the COVID pandemic, because we're seeing ridiculous prices, mm. I'll show you what happened. There's the strand at the top. Oh, wow, okay? yeah. That's the strand from Jewelry Maker at the top. And then below it, this gentleman said, that's what I can offer. Okay, so you've got the fireball shape, but it's not purple flash. It's not bicolor, and he's priced at wholesale. Wholesale, this is, you know, this is legitimately what we're talking about, was $1,980. And the only reason I'm showing you this is I want you to understand how incredible what Jewelry Maker does is. Mm -hmm. Okay, what we're doing is there's a reason Carol buys from Jewelry Maker, mm -hmm. and Elle, and myself. It's allowed me to expand my collection of things Absolutely. that I never thought. I'd never seen, <laughs> I've worked for Gems for 10 years, Till I came over to Jewelry Maker, I'd nev I never even knew what a fireball pearl was. That's the truth. Never even seen one. And I go to Hong Kong, go to Tucson, go to these gem shows. That's how rare they are. And that's how full I don't want you to ever become complacent. Whether you get involved today or not, I want you to understand what Jewelry Maker is all about. Providing you unrivaled opportunities, unparalleled access, and the very best deals in the world. And if anyone here could find me a better deal on fireball pearls, genuinely, then what I found at the, the, the trade shows, let me know because we'll buy it. Because that gentleman couldn't do it. Then I met this gentleman. No, and this is where I differ from some people. I'm gonna show you my yeah. conversations I have with people. I don't mind being transparent, nothing to hide. This is a gentleman called Salim Mansouri. He's a buyer for David Yeoman, the brand, okay? Okay. And I showed him my pearls. That was his booth that we just saw. And so I said, well, do you know anyone else in the industry that has what well, we want the purple flash, really? And he sent me that picture in WhatsApp. And by the time I'd responded, by the time I'd got Wi-Fi and got out of the show and got out of the hotel room, you can see him saying, it's already sold. But we, you know, I called him, we got talking, we met up actually that evening. And that lot that you're seeing there, and this is how it works, is $4,000 per strand if I wanted to select the ones that I wanted. Or if we took the entire lot, the price would be $2,500. Wow. And that's the lot, close up, showing you the picture. Now, not all of them are purple flash. In fact, those ones there are just golden. Yeah. And some of them are just purple. Mm -hmm. So we'd have had to select, which would have made it $4,000 a strand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'd have had to say, actually, we need to be a bit more strict to here, and we need to do this, this, this. And then you look at the opportunity. It's an opportunity I can almost guarantee, and we never like to say never, but I can almost guarantee we might, might never see it again. Now, I might see it again. I might see it at the gem shows. I might see it at Hong Kong uh, or um, Tucson. But then it might just be far too expensive. And you are looking at a miracle right now. Wow. And uh, w we are very fortunate to be offering you a full strand, which is amazing. But I would offer some sage advice. Use these sparingly. If you're going to create jewelry, which you are, I mean, if I was next door at Jampori, I'd say, isn't it a beautiful necklace? But I understand you guys create jewelry, which is amazing. Yes. Use it sparingly. One of those is a pendant or whatever you would wish to create with it. But you, that is a parcel. You know, when we get a pearl paradise and he bought 15 pearls, he's not intending to use them in a strand because they don't match. He's intending to, to obviously sell them singularly. You're just very fortunate that the way we operate here, we're going to go, look, look at this on the back of Carol's hand. Look at what we're offering you. It's a full strand. 16. 16, so you've got more. Mm. I, I wasn't even sure, I didn't <clears> even know. And, and again, I just want to show you just how the market views Fireball Pearls. If I can just have the clicker a moment, uh, Neri. Thank you. I want to take you to Bonhams, right? And just show you a Fireball wow. freshwater culture. Wow. There is no color on that. Yeah. Okay, it's beautiful. It's not, you know, and it's sold <laughs> in 2014 for $3,750. And I love showing that because that's the market deciding what it's worth. Yes, yeah. Yeah, it's not a pre-sale estimate. It's like that people outbidded each other. And they decided 
that that was worth nearly $4,000. And it's important because that was in 2014. Yeah. I'm going to show you an article from Gem Guide that we always reference, or Gem World International, whatever you want to call it, if I have it. Sorry, Tom. Could you go back to that? And it's when these appeared first on the market back in 2014. Um, you, you might need to thank you, Tom. I just need to go back and find it. But it's when they first appeared on the, the world scene and people fell in love with them. And they were, oh, okay, we don't have it. We can find it. But it's a Gem World International. In 2014, they first yeah. arrived. First time the world had seen fireball pearls. And the Gem Guide said they are the most exciting pearls in yes. the world. And now we're in 2022. And we're talking about how pearl production has been completely, completely compromised, decimated in some cases by the COVID pandemic. And we're going to be waiting years for it to resume back to its normal, normal kind of production levels. These have disappeared. These are gone. Mm. And, you know, they are accidents at best anyway. There's no, like, pearl farm that just says, hey, all we do is fireballs. We just do fireballs. They are collated over time. We're going to do a minute clock to get these in. Again, I want to let you know there's only, I said there was less than 30. There's 26. Just want to manage expectations. This is not just the perfect fireball shape. Yeah. It's the, 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 the rarest combination of colors. They're bicolor pearls. Absolutely. Purple flash or purple sash. They, are, they go by several different names. I think we call them hint of lilac or whatever. But this is a very important moment for you guys. And maybe the only moment to get this variety of pearl. 26 opportunities in the world that's how limited this is and, and in less than half a minute these will have sold out oh my gosh and just over 400 pearls through for this entire collection yeah. parcel whatever you want to call it. this yeah. is un b uh, and the, the one thing that made these so, you know, such a favorite amongst pearl connoisseurs is the way, and Ollie showcases oh. it really well when you see the daylight interacting with it. Yes. The way the light interacts with these pearls because of their dramatic shapes. Yes. Is very different to a round. Oh. It's very different to a standard brock. The light actually pools in certain places on these pearls because of their organic and beautiful texture, their shape. First collector's on, second collector's on, congratulations. Yes, so much. And again, if you want the indulgence of having just that full match strand, oh go for gosh. it. But if you are you know, interested in making jewellery, as I know you are, yes. then use these sparingly, <clears throat> you know, one at a time. Across over 15, 16 pieces of jewellery. And just what you were talking about earlier on about the gorgeous kind of golden colour and how it ombres to that beautiful purple. Uh, uh, this, I mean, this one here, I'm looking at this one here. This they're, one they're like here. they've they're, been. They're all doing absolutely, it. And absolutely. And that's it. We're very strict with our criteria here. And it's like they've been dip dyed. Yeah. You know, that's, that's what it's exactly like. It's like it they've been dip dyed. But that is, that's essentially yeah. what's happened, but by Mother Nature. Yeah. So they are cultured. But that's not what they were Stunning. intending to produce. And that is why you get this metallic kind of rainbow orient that is shimmering on the surface of... The, 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 each one of these is yes. a masterpiece. But yes. it, you know, not our masterpiece. It's a masterpiece of Mother Nature. Dorset, congratulations. You are the first to secure oh my this gosh. strand. Absolutely superb. And, and you know, fine, uh, fireball, flameball pearls are something we've spoken about for years here on yeah. Jewelry Maker. You know, Linda has, 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 has spoken about this. You know, wouldn't it be wonderful if we could get them on Jewelry Maker? And, there are, you know, these are the kind of pearls which we've always spoken about, that we've always wanted, that we've always um, uh, kind of searched for. And it's just so phenomenal. Well, is, is, but today. there you go. Isn't it amazing? You know, Linda, you've been in the industry for, for a long time. You've been working uh, with Jewelry Maker from the very start. And, and, you know, even, even at, one, at one point or another, we, even you thought we might never be able to get them, even though we were in love with them, even though... Absolutely. You know. I mean, the first time I saw something like these um, was when I went out, Carol referred to it earlier, when I went out to China to, to, to buy product for kits, and they were labelled unusual Baroque pearl, yeah. and then they became so sought after... Yeah. Mm particularly by China themselves, yes. keeping them for the domestic market, that they just get stratospheric through the roof. That's and it. you mentioned Jack Lynch at Sea, sea Hunt. I think the first time he saw one of these, his reaction was, as you said, Dave, 
it, that can't, cannot be a natural colour. Yes. There you go. I mean, yeah. I was led to believe by a pearl uh, expert at the, the gem. Market, I the green zone, when they're removed from the oyster, they're, they're even laid then in pure just sunlight. Wow. To dry, so it's, it's a complete natural process, process. Oh, wow. from start to finish. Th yeah. th 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 there you get some incredible insight uh, mm. from, from Linda, who was there before these even exploded in yes, the industry. Yes, exactly. When they were labelled as unusual, you know, unusual mm. brock pearls. And this is what happens with some of the most incredible gemstones in history, right? They okay. don't fit into normal parameters. Yes, okay? so that's it. The Malaya Garnet. The Malaya garnet, which is probably one of the most expensive, certainly the rarest garnet in the world, if it is not the most expensive, yes. was discarded in the 1960s. Because, wow. it, because it's a pyro spine, because it's a combination of lots of different garnet species, they threw it away. Yes, right? yes. And, and now it is the most sought after garnet in the world. And the same with pink diamonds, which sounds insane mm. right now. Mm -hmm. But there's a gentleman called Craig Ferguson who is now head of the Diamond Investment Fund in Ontario, Canada. Mm. And he did this incredible interview, which I've, I've shown to our collectors uh, in Gems TV before, where he said, in 1987, there was a tiny mine in Western Australia that, you know, diamond mines were just set up to find white diamonds, right? And they'd find wow. the, the rare colors, but because there wasn't enough or whatever, they'd put them to one side. And he said, and this is within living memory, it's not like, oh, John Baptiste Tavernier, and we read these diaries. I'm talking, the guy's here today, yes. head of the diamond, and he said, I was buying pink diamonds for less than the price of white diamonds because they didn't know what to do with them. And now he's got them in a safe. Oh my and, and gosh. And he's the head of the diamond investment fund because he saw the potential. Oh. You guys know what happens with pink diamonds now. The most expensive diamonds in the world. Yeah. You know, we're talking about millions of dollars per carat. And he was buying them in the late 80s for less than the price of white diamonds. Yes. And Linda had a very similar experience. You know, these pearls, they didn't know what to call them. They didn't know what they were. Yes. They weren't looking for them. They weren't trying to make them. Exactly. They were like, what do we do with these? They're curiosities. Precisely. Because they, because they can't market them because they're so rare. Yes, yes. They don't know how they even produce them. They were like, exactly we're going to just label them unusual brock pearls. And then people like Jack Lynch, influential in the industry, first time they saw them, you know, people start seeing them. And all of a sudden, the, the actual, the worst thing that can happen in the gem world, and, and Linda alluded to it there, is when the Chinese market wants something. Yes. We don't usually get it. Exactly. We're priced yeah. out. You know, and that is the reason we haven't, we, we have this brief moment with Jada, but we haven't been able to get it for many years. It's the same reason that a lot of the Brazilian tourmaline mines, people will tell you they're depleted. They're not. Chinese companies, one of them is the Miranda Group based in Hong Kong, bought the Cruzeiro Rubelite mine. They just buy them because we can't compete with their, yes. their wealth. And That's there's exactly like a billion it. people. And if, if they fall in love with something, as they have with these, the, 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 Linda saw them in China. The best material should never leave China. So I've seen them in Hong Kong, and it's so hard to prize them away because they, they look at me and they go, well, they actually sell for this much here in the, the, the local market. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, we can't compete with that. I yeah. can't, you know, you see the price at Bonhams, $3,750. We see the price at Yoko London, the 22,000 pounds or whatever mm -hmm. it is. These, and there's a strand here. Even uh, Pearl Paradise had a collection of 15, and you've got 16 in this strand. I'm gonna do a minute clock. It's, it's crazy to think that the price on your screen actually is a deal. <laughs> it's actually a deal. Yeah. And this is what I'm saying to you, even when I experienced this. Well, what did we see from Salim Mansouri, who is the buyer for David Yeoman? He said, look, if you want to pick these, it's $4,000 a strand. So the price on your screen is pretty much, you know, in line with that. And, and here we are with a 30 second clock on your screen. And I'm gonna give, this has never been seen before. It's never been on your screen before. And just that. Yeah. Just that one pearl. You know, like, like Linda said, you know, they, they were labeled as these unusual pearls and then they were yes, lay, lay out in yeah. the sunlight. You know, and you can see, and by the way, there's a lot of rejection in this process as well. 100%. You know, they don't, yes, they're not all this imagine. beautiful shape, these fireballs. Mm. In fact, if I go to Bonhams and show you the $3,700 example, right? There's what, one the, on there. The white necklace. Yeah, there's it's one on there not, that I would white. reject and I'll show it you. They're like um, flakes. Mm -hmm. There it is. There we go. Well, yeah. The, so if you, before I give you the price, can we remove the graphics in one second, Dolly? Right, look at the pearl at the very bottom and then go two to the left of that. You see that one with that? Yeah, there you go. You, the, the mouse pointed to it. Yeah. That yeah. unsightly sort of kind of, it almost looks like a growth on the side of that pearl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'd reject exactly. that. We would reject it. And, yeah. and even the two either side of the clasp 
are, aren't true fireballs. Mm -hmm. You know, the one at the bottom is a fireball, but it's kind of misshapen. It, it is. To yeah. have this beautiful, elegant, I mean, the fireball should be that meteor like shape with a yes. meteor like tail. Yes. Do you know what I'm going to do? Do you want me to give you one price right now? There's only 20. Oh, blimey. Right. Okay. Okay, I'm, get, I'm gonna do something and look, we've got, I know we've got a Look at this ones. color, look at that color going from the gold through to the That's purple. it, that's perfect. That's okay, exactly. uh, I know I don't wanna mess around, don't wanna upset anyone, but can I have one more minute clock? And the reason I'm saying this is, you usually expect from me that we go and stagger the price. Yeah. So you expect me to go half the price, we're not done, another minute clock. I am just gonna, I see you on the finance, I'm just gonna give you the one price now. But I'm letting you We've know. We've literally that. got less than 20 left, by the way. Um, but I'm letting you know now the oh next price word. you see will be the final price. So I wanted everyone to be aware because sometimes you go, well, I see what happens here, I see what happens here. We have time. I see the amount of demand on the phone lines. Yeah, it's We're all in awe yeah. of it. I mean, honestly, Carol, you've, you've just laid that on a desk. Right? Yes. And it looks still like a million dollars. It really does. So there's no special presentation here. It's just, you know, lay on the desk. Look at that, look at that, look at that. And that, that. is one huge, epic. And in 20 seconds, these will sell out. Oh I know a lot gosh. of you like to wait for the final price crash. That's when you're gonna hit a queue. We will only take confirmations on this. I'm not even gonna reference the queue. Oh. How many are in baskets? My gosh. There's Five so seconds. many in baskets. Right. Goodness me. Okay. 399. Wow. 399. And you could realistically pay that for <laughs> a single fireball. You could realistically, especially in 2022. Let me just grab that from you, Carl, because it's the last time I'm going to see it. Yes, of Thank course you. it is. Thank oh my gosh. But if, 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 if we went to China right now, and we know the productions have been hit so hard, so there is, you know, there's no pearls really coming out, and certainly not the wish list pearls. And say me, Carol, and Linda were there. And we walk, we're, we're being shown around by our wonderful vendors around their incredible pearl nurseries. And they're like, look, we've still got to wait for the next production, but we do have something, we have something unusual in the other room. And they bring out, you know, a tray, right? Or a platter, whatever you want to call it, velvet lined. Yes. And there's 16 individual pearls on there. Yes. They wouldn't yeah, be on yeah, a strand, yeah. just 16. And we pick one up and we just observed it. That feasibly, this pearl here, just one, or this pearl. Yeah, you know, yeah. with any oh, one of either them. Either or, yeah. And it was, Beautiful. it was, you know, five hundred pounds. Absolutely. I tell you right now, I'd buy it. Mm -hmm. It would be too expensive for Jane, but I'd buy it for my own collection, just to have that that curiosity, that moment, that miracle. This is what I'm holding right now. This strand is as close to a natural pearl strand as we're going to get in terms of rarity yeah, yeah, yeah. right in terms Absolutely. of in terms of demand you know when when uh, you know Cartier took a strand to the gentleman that owned the mansion on 5th avenue the most mm -hmm. beautiful real estate in new york and, and and said they couldn't strike a deal and he said right well i've got something that might get it over the line and he handed him a strand and the deal was done this is that that kind of rarity yes these yes. are f so so seldom in oh, their appearance look at on the market. That. But this is, even with slight movement, you see the dramatic color play. The That's shape. because of the shape. Oh, it's beautiful. And we've got Sandy, Meath, Maker and Gloucestershire, Pamela, Janice, we've got in house jewelry designer, we've got Linda, we've got Jenny, we've got Angela, I've got Suja, I've got Moira, I've got Margaret, I've got Jennifer, I've got Linda, I've got Nancy. The oh, seven so left in the world. Yeah. That's absolutely incredible, Dave. That no, is no, 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 no. I'll take a minute clock. Take a minute clock. Take a minute clock. I'm gonna give you one last tiny reduction on this price. One incredible deal to give to you. This is it, they're all, they're all gonna find their homes today. They're all going today. There is no way Wait. we are putting these back in the vault. Uh, we are, we, this, is what, this is what your watches are for, isn't it? This is why you tune into Jewelry Maker, isn't it? We're not, we're, not, we're not a London jewelry house that goes, that's your price, take it or leave it. I'm gonna give you right now something that I shouldn't do. And this is not planned, it's not rehearsed. No I know way. Wayne's gonna be annoyed. We could this sit is here for brand new. Five minutes. Look, another another one's yeah, gone. Yeah. We could sit here for another five minutes and they'd all sell out. Dave does not have we, I don't have a nippies, maybe I should, do but I don't like to have a nippies because I like to just you know, judge it as I am right now. Oh my gosh, there's so many in baskets. We've only got six chances remaining. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12 in baskets for the final, si oh wow. Okay, Goodness well then maybe I shouldn't do this, maybe I'm gonna get in a little bit of trouble, but it is what it is. Um, I'll take it, take 50 pounds off the price, that is your deal. Just oh straight gosh. back in, get yourself a clasp. That, you know, whatever you wanna do with that 50 oh pounds, 
we should be paying minimum, minimum four figures for something <laughs> like this. Minimum. Realistically, probably five figures. That is utterly, utterly, utterly phenomenal. Yeah. I can't believe that. That is incredible. £349 with four individual split payments of eighty-seven twenty-five. You can get this home today Honestly, for less than I'm, £100. I'm, that is amazing. I'm, this is like my goodbye to the, 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 no, the natural, no, not to work, don't worry. I mean, uh, <laughs> might be when, when, when I go in there and Wayne says, you're finished, mate. But it is like my <laughs> goodbye to, to the, the ultra rare pearls, at least for a few yeah. years. And I was speaking with uh, you know, our wonderful buyers here who, who work so closely with the pearl dealers, Caroline being one of them. And she just said to me, just want you to understand, Dave, I know you know about these pearls, but there is zero opportunity for us to bring the natural colors back within the next two years. Yeah, especially of these sizes. Yes. If we can bring you maybe dyed pearls, we can maybe bring you, you know, other varieties. And we're always exploring new options. Like I said, we're always looking for the wish list items. But what you're seeing, this is like our goodbye to these incredible moments. And we're giving you the best deals on the last day. Absolutely. Of, of, of the rarest pearls maybe we've ever offered. Oh, they are absolutely superb. Here are your baskets. So lots of well baskets. Done. Maker, Maker in Lancashire, Cumbria, Maker in Surrey, Moira, Margaret, Jennifer. Um, please, please, please do check out as soon as you can. Linda do you know what? Hampton, do you know what? Can, what? can one of you, as an exercise, as an exercise, usually we say go and get evaluation, go and get this, go and get that. Um, I want someone to put a clasp on this. I know I said use them sparingly, but I would love it if one of you was to put... Maybe 18 carat, you maybe do like an antique nice. clasp on one of yeah. your strands and go and submit it to Bonham's Auction House. Forget evaluation. Um, if, if in a moment's time, I'm going to bring up that Bonham's piece, right? And this is a Bonham's piece in 2014, which is when, when you know, they first kind of appeared on the market. Yeah. And they accepted that Bonham's did. So that was submitted to them and they said, okay, we're going to put it in our auction. <coughs> and I think we can all agree, we can all agree, myself, Carol, Linda, that we have a finer pearl necklace. One missing a clasp, right? It's just, that's the reality, cents. right? It's the same with all pearls, right? Yeah. If you're getting colour naturally, it's special. Oh. Put it in the auction house and forget evaluation. Tell me what the bidders are willing to pay for just it. And they're so outbidding yeah. each other in the room. Let the market decide, absolutely. You're so right. Well done. That is superb. But I think I believe there may still be two chances remaining, but huge congratulations. That is tremendous. There's so many people with it in their baskets. Um, that is amazing. Uh, Absolutely superb. So we have wow. one more fireball opportunity. One more fireball. And this is the Isn't papaya it? colours. Okay, again, natural colours. Yeah. Um, and it is going to be, and again, I don't have a near piece, and I'm sorry, less than 30 available. I'm going to do this as a closeout. I'm going to do this as a closeout. I said it's our goodbye today, didn't I? I said you're all, we're all going to get these wonderful pearls. And then if you want to get pearls like this going forward, then I hope you've got a ticket to Hong Kong when it reopens. I hope, yes. I hope, I hope you, you, you guys get to go to, to the shows. This is going to be special. Oh, my word. Yeah, it's a strand, isn't it? Where is it? It's not out here, I don't think. Oh, no. You've got it. Thank you, uh, Ollie. I can see the colours here. And this actually comes with a clasp, so... Um, what? Does it really? And spaces. Oh, my word! So this is a, a piece of jewellery ready to go, and a box, of course. This is the whole kit. Wow! Some of those have been kissed with the purple, right? But it's yeah. not consistent. So we're calling them papayas, but you have got some of the ultra-rare bi colours as well. All of it is, is naturally coloured. This is a complete ready to go. And it's going to make no sense in light of what you've just seen. It's going to Those make no colors. sense. Those mm colours. -hmm. Those golden colours, they remind me of the kind of golden South Sea colours that you get there. Uh, but you'd never, I mean, you, you, you could never hope to get that size, could you? From, me and Carol uh, were just fighting over it. Hey? We were just I know, I went to so read through it. Don't you were looking at that picture. He won. A wonderful uh, king of brought them out because they're around the corner um, and I think they were trying not to sell them because they know that I'm giving stuff away to uh, but we said it on TV and we're doing it and she brought them out and I walked from here in front of Carol it was a shame actually and Carol had her hand out and I just took it I wanted to be the first to see it so I apologise but go on oh my, oh my gosh I could see right. it from there I'm going to show Carol before I show you guys if that's okay I know you've seen that wonderful daylight recording but you know okay. what you expect because what you've seen from the recording and the picture yeah, we expect oh. like a golden colour absolutely right. I'm just going over it it's not going to look like great TV but look at that go on oh my gosh okay oh my goodness me those... what would you describe that as because that's not papaya to me 
I don't know. Apricot. Uh, what would, yeah, like apricot, pad paracha. Orange, paprasha. Um, Linda, I'm going to come and show you. Is that okay? I'm just going to bring these over to Linda because we're all really excited. <laughs> we're not going to get Michael's. to really see them again. But I'm glad Linda's got to see on that screen Honestly, there, like the golden colors. You, you can open those, Linda, oh, and just have a look at the color. It's just that button on the top. Oh my goodness, mate. They're just breathtaking. Aren't but I mean, that saturation of color is so far removed. Look at the color. They're kind of. They're pink, but yeah, I mean, I, uh, papaya. Okay, yeah. cool. and maybe papaya is the right description. Maybe it is the right description, but it doesn't look like the pap papayas we've bought before, which is the problem. It doesn't look like the papayas that we have bought before. That is true papaya. It's like um, it's like you've got like tangerine tones. You've got yes, really bright it. pinks. It's it's truly like tropical colours, isn't it? We're not going to get those back, uh, Linda. I'm going to have to. We're not going to get what back? <laughs> well, so you've got them, Linda. Let's have a look at them. These are look sensors. at her. Oh, so look at this. I don't believe you it. You get the box as well. But Linda's having that one. Yeah. She's having that. All right, all right, Doc, I'll give you the box. I am going to give these back to Carol, but can I? Sorry, guys. I know. Look, we're a bit. We're all over the shop this morning. And I don't even know just what it's going to look like in the light over here. But I just want to show you one pill. This is a colour I've never seen. Oh, yes. This is not papaya. Yes. I've sold papaya before. What is that? It's like a. Con no, because it's not a conch kind of colour, is it? It's like but a. But honestly, it's, uh, that camera is still not doing it justice. Coral colour, yes. Yeah. Coral It's like um, if it was coral, we call this colour angel skin. So oh. there are different kind of tones. This is like an angel skin colour. And I, I'm hoping that the lights are better on. Look at these colours on Carol's desk. I'm going to give them to Carol. Thank it's you. It's so hard to translate on the camera what we've Gee, just seen. Gee, where's that time? Yeah, these sorry, are... Carol. <laughs> oh, my... Oh, look at this. All of them are wonderful. But, I mean, this one, first of all, this has got, like, fuchsia pinks coming for it. Can you see those fuchsia colours? Yeah, it's not going to be too grand. In fact, I'm going to give you the price that I have bought it to you before. And I call it a close-up because... I'm going lower. So the price that this is sold at for them, you've got it home with it, you've worked with it, <gasps> is £500. So you can just bring £500 in, it's sold at that. We've got the last 26 today. There you go. This is a better representation of the colours. Look at that. Oranges. It's like a lotus kind of, you know what I yes! mean? Yes! The, 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 that's it. That's what a pad paracha is, right? It's based on pad the lotus. Yes, so yeah, so yeah, the yeah. The actual two colours that should make up a world-class pad paracha sapphire, orange pink and, and pink, orange, aren't they? yeah, yeah. That's what we're seeing on these pills. These, if, these are pad paracha fireballs in my book. That's what I would call them. That's what they are. Okay, that's the price we've all paid before. It's the only price that's ever been on your screens at. And for those of you that have tuned into any of the shows that I've been part of before, I don't like to just take a little bit off. So I'm going to ask for a minute clock. Okay. And I'm just going to give you one final price. This is the last price. That should be your final price. That's what we've sold more oh of gosh, than we have available today. But this is a closeout. It is our moment right now to bring you these. On this strand, by the way, you've got uh, 2, 4, 6, 8... 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20 yeah. on the strand. Look at that. Again, the, there's not many pieces of jewelry that you can just lie down on a table. Yeah. You just lie them down and they look that good. And in half a minute, these are going to be gone. I can see you all on the phone lines, but again, I only want to reference pure confirmations today. It doesn't matter if there's 17 baskets. It doesn't matter if we've got a mass three minute queue on the phone lines. If you want to own oh. those pearls, and they look like they're, it's, a, it's that classic thing that you look for in a pearl. They look like they're lit from within. It's the quality yeah. of that nacre, of those layers. It's, it's just... I, I, mean, I'm just, I keep forgetting, sorry, because I just keep looking at the pearls. But I keep forgetting. Look at that clasp. It's yes, I know. Yeah, it's a gorgeous magnetic clasp you're going to be getting here. And, of course, you've got the um, right. spaces And I love the well. fact that they've done the pink gold or the rose gold and the, yeah, the rose gold spaces. Because those are the colours that we're observing in these pearls. Yeah, And I'm going to take definitely. £100 off the price. Oh, wow. The Fantastic. only price that's ever sold out. Taking a hundred pounds off our previous wow. deal. Oh gosh, look at everyone. Loads of you there today. This is absolutely tremendous. And of course, with this gorgeous rosy kind of rose gold color, but uh, rose gold plating, but also with the color of the pearls, they're gonna suit any skin tone as well. It's sure. got that beautiful nude kind of quality to it. They are, and it is paparasha. That that's the kind of color it is. It's that lotus flower, it's that gorgeous golden uh, pink, but then into orange. And then there's then these purples oranges. as well. Then you get these interpurples, yes. kind of that rainbow orient that is yes. just, you, you get emanating across the surface of these pearls that looks like it comes from within. Yes. Yeah, this is, my God. every color you're seeing here is <gasps> Oh my word. Oh, abs, oh, Against look at that luminous. Tone. 
I think as an exercise again, Dave, it would be absolutely phenomenal to be able to to be able to do the yeah pop a clasp on it, you know, make this piece of jewelry with the clasp with the space beads, put it through an auction house and see what the market decides they want to pay or take it to be valued. These are exceptional, like truly exceptional pearls. The weight of them as well, Linda, the size, the 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 the, the, the substantial nature of them. They are enormous individual pieces, aren't they? <laughs> yes, uh, well, to learn from. To learn from, definitely. Yes, absolutely. And go from what we perceive as... The perfect pearl, pearl. Perfect yes. Pearl. Now, You're for so me, right. to be honest, and I say this right from the heart, and I've, I've thought this since the first time I saw these yes. pearls, is that's the pearl, God willing, mm. that's the pearl of the future. Oh, oh gosh, yeah. I think you're absolutely right. Uh, I, okay, so for the pearl of the future, <laughs> in a strand, with a colour I've never seen before. Can oh, I have a my God. Clock, These are going today. I've took £100 off the price that we've been before. And for those of you that already have this, I'm, I'm telling you, you're going to want to come back in. Because when we talk about the pearl of the future, yes. that has a, a direct, you know, uh, um, correlation with the price, with the value. Look at that. And, and to get this myriad of colours, of, of, of also valuable colours. Yes, you know, yes. Th that's the other thing. You know, you can get like... Uh, natural colours, you can get like browns and whatever else, but of to course. get these pinks yes. and, and, and oranges and purples, and to get the fireball, which has all but disappeared from the market, but not from the, the people's minds. It is the pearl that people want to own. I'm going to give you one final deal on this, and then we're going to move on through this, like we said, unparalleled collection of wishlist pearls. And in 10 seconds, we're going to be taking another chunk of money off this. Oh, my word. Incredible. I can't wait to see what happens. There's so many in baskets. We've had a lot of people right. joining. Neary, just take £50 pounds off. Oh. £50 pounds off, wow. and then let's just do a minute for you to own it. Because we've got to move on. We've got other incredible Loads. Uh, 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 deals to bring to you. So let's give you a minute when this price is on your screen for you to make your minds up. For those of you with it in your baskets to check it out, we aren't moving again. This is your minute clock, and this is your moment to get this collection of fireball pearls. Five in baskets for the for the final few chances. Well done, huge congratulations to you. £349 on four split payments over 87 25 An incredible deal for you today. Absolutely astonishing. Yeah, 20 pearls on this strand. Oh, 20 now. Which yeah, is and what we saw, you know, um, the, the gentleman of Pearl Paradise, Jeremy, you know, getting a collection of 15 pearls, which is so hard to do anyway. And we've just casually got 20 here on a strand with the class. So it's under 20 with, pounds a pearl. Oh, <laughs> there you go. That's, that's incredible. That, I mean, that's probably the best deal of today. Yeah. You know, regardless of anything we're seeing, you, 20 pounds a pearl, less yeah. than. Look at that. Well Look at Eight that. seconds Look for you to make light. your mind up. Well done to everybody coming through. We're giving you that clock just to give you that extra few seconds just to check out. That is Well done, guys. Price. Well done. Well done, well done, well done. Superb. Wow. Gorgeous. Now we have, is it the rainbow pearls, Nira? Oh, is this another strand? Yeah. This is, this, I've never seen, this is ridiculous. Yeah. Kinga put them next to me on the desk and, and I, saw, and I, I, and I kind face. of, I the, the kind of reaction I was kind of, <gasps> wow. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, the multitude of colours on offer here and the rainbow orient. The metallic nature yeah. to these as well is absolutely Wow, wow, wow. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. Look at those. Yeah, and they Look have that this. beautiful kind of Kashumi ripple effect as well. Which yes. Is, yeah, again, another kind of wish list pearl. We are bringing you the pearls that have disappeared from the market. That is what we're looking at. You've got the best from Tahiti here in terms of colour. You've got the best from South Sea in terms of colour and better. You've got the peacock colours. You've got the, the rainbow orient. Pistachios, purples, greens, blues, neon electric colours. How many do we have of these, Neri? He's looking. How many do we have? Okay, we've got 17. So it's going to be really, really limited. 17 opportunities. The only pearl strand like this in the building, not just in this show. I'm seeing greens, yeah. like spring I mean, greens here. Neon greens. 
Look you know, the, at those. the brightest papaya colors. I'm seeing blues, I'm seeing purples, I'm seeing yeah, this un... I mean, it's like they're, they're, they are exactly what we said, rainbow pearls. Dorset, you're already on the front lines, congratulations. That kind of wrinkle, as you say, or what did you describe Kashumi, it Kashumi, yeah, it's like a, you get this wonderful kind of ripple effect. Ripple. Yeah. Yes. It's like waves, and that is the nacre, essentially, building up on these pearls. Oh, they're stunning. One deal on this, I'm going to do it in a minute's time. There is only 17. We've seen, you know, the quantities of 29 oh, and 27 disappear. There is 17, and they are huge, by the way. They are they massive are. pearls. They're 12 to 15 mil. 12 to 15 yeah. mil in size. I love the shape of these as well. They're kind of edging towards a kind of a more rounded shape. We're going away from that. Kind and all of the colors work fireball. so well together. Yes. You yes. know, this, this kind of organic, beautiful uh, multitude of colors that we're seeing. These, Absolutely. These apricots, like we said, the bright neon greens, the purples. The, the, the rainbow orient. Everything that is on show here is something we shouldn't see. And the metallic luster yes. that we're dealing with, the metallic orient, which is kind of the brightest that you can mm. get. In 25 seconds, these will be gone. But don't you think you're seeing that more because of the, because of the unevenness? The, the ripples, yeah, the of ripple course. ripple on the surface of the pearl. So but it is, it, is, it is also down to the, the amount of nacre that is built around these pearls. Oh, there there is so much nacre, so we are getting what nacre does. Yes, you know, yes. And, and what it does is give you that orient. Look gives you, uh, and, and in this particular collection of pearls, it's unrivaled. Uh, yeah, there's no getting away from that. They are just. All right, you ready? Beautiful. 379. 379, Caroline. We've oh, got Bitter in Dorset. Brilliant. We've got Karen. We've got Teresa. Devon, Greta Manchester. Jenny, you're That's on the phone. Fantastic. There is only 17. If you want to multi buy, do it. Of course, we're going to offer the interest free split payments. But oh. that is a, a representation of what it will look like in the daylight. Because remember, you're only seeing it right now by, uh, in the studio. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look. Oh, at that's so kind, Jenny, uh, to say that. Um, really, oh. uh, really appreciate, you know, you guys um, getting in early. And the reason I say this is because I hate it when you miss out. And that's why we try to manage expectations at the start. If I have 300, I'll tell you I have 300. But when we only have quantities like this, 17, I just want to let you know. Blues. Yeah, blue. Blues. And do you know what? And, and, and you know, there are people who, you know, I, I, I love South Sea Pearls. I love them. I love the rarity. I love, you know, the, the quality of them. But, but for me, this is so much more interesting. It's got but this, character. Okay, the, the best way to look at it is the collection of pearls we have for you today is really the only freshwater pearls that topple the saltwater pearls. Yeah. Okay, on average, Tahitians, Okoyas, uh, South Seas are more expensive yeah. than your Chinese freshwater. But when you get the ultra rare mm. freshwater pearls, the mm -hmm. ones that aren't mass produced, then they will surpass yeah. those, those pearls. And we've seen it with the fireballs. You're now seeing it with these, these, these pearls. I mean, we talk about the rainbow overtones, which is in... We're talking to the Orient there, the, 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 the way the light interacts and rolls across yeah. the surface of these. But you've also got rainbow colored pearls. You know, these pearls are also naturally colored. So the silvers, the peaches, yes. the greens, the pistachios, the silver blues, just their body color alone is a multitude of rainbow colors. Yeah. And each one displays a rainbow Orient. So it is just compound rarity. That's and they are huge as well. So you're looking at 15 mil pearls in some cases that sit on the neckline like this. Wow, Very wow, special wow. collection of pearls. Incredible, huge congratulations. Down to the final six opportunities in the world. Yep. So, so special. They're just, each and every one has got that character. And, and what's so wonderful is, you know, eke them out, you know, eke them out into different pieces of jewelry, into, into dozens. Look at, the, yeah. look at the way that, like when you cast a bit of a shadow on them as well, when you have it, the colors change oh, That's again. a great way to describe it. Hmm? The, that's a great way to describe it. Lisa and West Yorkshire. Yes, they do. It look looks like, like they are wrapped in satin. in satin. Yeah, they do. Yes. They really do look like they're, they are dressed in satin. And we get the way that satin interacts with light, but times by 10. And that's what we're appreciating in all these pearls. 2, 24, 26, 28. There's 29 pearls on this strand as well. Goodness me. Oh, Sally. Um, well, your pearls are fantastic. I'm lucky to have them already, but I'm desperate for the grey blue pearls. Do you have them? Um, and, and we're. In this strand, you can see you get some yeah, wonderful yeah. blues. And we will continue to look for ultra rare pearls that's for so you. Lovely. There's your blue one. I mean, I mean, and that's as blue as it gets here. Absolutely gorgeous. Almost like a bluebell colour. Thank you so much. Fantastic. Uh, Linda, pearl. it's usually way, way beyond, beyond me, me yeah. I'll be honest. This is the, what yes. jewellery makers manage to do is make them affordable uh, for, for, for me as well, which is incredible. 
Yeah, just congratulations. incredible. Well done, huge congratulations. Lots yeah. still in basket. The first forward. strand that we showed you at the beginning of the show. Yes. Is the strand that we're about to bring to you right now. And we're gonna do it. Can we do it as a star buy? I never do a star buy. But I want to do this collection, perfect rounds. Um, and again, we, we heard from Jack Lynch, who showcased his, submitted it to the GIA. We, so we, we requested the price from Yoko of London. You right now are about to get your collection of the perfect round, large purple pearls, and we're going to do it as a star buy. These pearls are, um, may as well be the exact same pearls that we uh, were looking at in that recording at the beginning of um, the show. These are as close to near round as you're going to get. And the colour consistency you are getting here is next level. We've bought you the multicolors. We've bought you the beautiful flame balls. We've bought you lots of different sizes, shapes, quality. What you are getting here is all about consistency and literally the top, top, top pearls. Yeah, and again, it's the consistency of color that makes this so yeah. miraculous, okay? These launched to the world stage in 2018, you know, in terms of production, in terms of, you know, regular harvest. Yes. And we saw, you know, the GIA saying, you know, the prize, the, 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 the prize specimens were selling for the high thousands per strand. Then we saw the likes of uh, Jack Lynch, um, who is of Sea Hunt Pearls, taking a strand of these back then and saying there's no way these can be naturally coloured. And he was like, I've never encountered anything like it. Usually it's dyed. Yeah. I want to know what's going on here. What method are they using? He submitted to the GIA and they said, no, no, this is natural mm -hmm. from the Hunan and Hubei province just four or five pearl farms that have managed to do this right now. It's very new, very important. You can see the colors here. Colors. And then we see where these are destined to go. Okay, mm. And they're destined to go to the likes of uh, an incredible jewelry house in, in London called Yoko. And they deal almost exclusively in high jewelry. And they also deal exclusively almost in pearls. And this is what they had. The Novus Freshwater Pearl Necklace. Okay, It's an 18 karat rose gold, but it's price and application. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's incredible. Of course, there's a lot of rose gold, but again, they're round, they're large, they're purple. They must be from the same locations because they are fresh water. And then I saw what their rings were selling for, just single pearls, okay? And they're like two grand. Then we see a pair of earrings and we see uh, yeah, how expensive it is just to match them. We start understanding then, okay, matching these pearls has mm. a huge, huge added premium. We see them here with uh, two matches, wow. 8,000 pounds. So I reached out to uh, Yoko of London and I requested the price on that unbelievable necklace. And that, the, the, the price of the necklace, and it's in pounds now, it's not in dollars, and we're not talking wholesale, we're talking retail. And it was 22,500 pounds. Goodness me. So I'm just gonna let you know, our start price, you know, where we usually have uh, the, 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 the highest price that you know, we come in at, is going to be a quarter of that. That's what we're doing. Wow. Even less, sorry. £3,000. And we have, you know, the, the, the same saturation of colour. We have the, the, the perfect symmetry. Well done, Pamela. <laughs> congratulations. How, do we know exactly how many of these we have, just so everyone knows? How many opportunities? 32. Okay, 32. I think as well, something that you mentioned earlier on, Dave, is the fact that Yoko and uh, people who are using these pearls will be getting them from the same place that we are getting Absolutely. them from. Because there's literally only a couple of but, pearls. But I just want you to remember how unique we are. And what I mean exactly. by that is places like Yoko of London, and I, I deal with, for instance, Bond Street jewellers, mm. um, who have sold like single pearls, very special pearls to like Cartier, for instance, on Bond Street, dealer to dealer. And they'll sell a pearl for like 11,000 pounds, wow. a single pearl. I mean, it's obviously a, an amazing pearl. Yes. Then the pearl will be in the shop window maybe two weeks later for 40,000 pounds. That's the reality, you know, that, yeah. that is, and do you know why that is? <clears throat> because at Jewelry Maker, we don't just buy one pearl. Mm -hmm. We don't just buy one strand that's gonna sit in our shop window. 
We buy everything we can. And that's how we can do these deals. Now, I'm not saying, you know, these, these yoke of London's making huge profits. I'm saying they buy very differently. Mm -hmm. We get as much as we can to drive the price down. Yeah. Okay, that's why you're seeing an opportunity with us today that you won't see anywhere else. But I want you to understand you're dealing with the same pearls. So why would you buy from anywhere else? Yeah. Now, I don't know the size of the Yoko London pearls, but so even if they were a few mil bigger, we're going to save you tens of thousands of pounds today. It's the reality of it. Mm -hmm. That's what we have for you. The, the, the legendary, naturally colored, and I want you to understand that, pearl mm. pearls, the ones that stumped you know, some of the, the, the labs in the world. And they were like, oh, we can't believe they've found a way to do this. This is, I think, genuinely the, the most pivotal innovation in the pearl market since Mickey Moto. Mm, okay, Mickey Moto discovered out how to culture pearls. So all of a sudden, people could own pearls. Right yes. Before that, they were diving for them off the Gulf of Persia. They were diving for them in different incredible locations. And it was just uh, by chance. That's why to do a strand how many diving trips? Mm -hmm. How many years? That's why there were millions of dollars. Mm -hmm. And Mickey Moto was the first person ever that discovered how he could culture these, how he could produce these, how he could get you a strand like this and make it a little bit more affordable. But they were limited by the, 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 muscle, the muscles they used, either the oysters, the clams, whatever it may be, the, the bivalve muscles. And so they were, they were also limited by color. This innovation is formed by very specialized, small, family-run pearl farms yes. in different provinces that over the last 50 years, the last 100 years, however long it's been since Mickey Moto discovered it, that are talk we're talking about true innovation. You know, crossbreeding, different, different yes. genuses, different species to create a whole new uh, clam, a whole new oyster. And, and by doing that, they found a way to do this. I'm going to give you a minute clock, if that's okay. And I call this a star buy for a reason. You may have seen this before, because I know I've bought it to you before. And I'm going to give you the price that I launched this at, that you have it home in your collection for, which is going to be incredible. Even though this is the second outing, and usually the second outing, we don't have the same quantity. Yeah. I'm going to match the launch price. Awesome. We have 44 seconds. I've got in-house designers getting involved. Wow. Uh, I've got uh, Wiltshire, Hampshire, Dorset, Devon. How many did we have? 32. 32, 32. yeah, that's it. These really are incredible and actually everything Dave is, is, is saying is, is, is ringing so so true it, 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 it's so it's so special yeah. that we've got this opportunity a absolutely and do you know what it's one thing to like do like a, a very very generic kind of price comparison against Bonhams yeah. or, or Yoko of London or whatever it might be today the reason I've called this a star buy is because I'm going to price compare against myself mm -hmm. okay I'm going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the deal that I did for you on the 8th of June, just so you know. And on the 8th of June, I brought you these pearls at the most incredible deal of 399 Wow. Okay, 399 pounds. For anyone who didn't join us for that show, anyone, or even if you did, that was the deal we did. So we're going to bring that price in right now, 399 for this strand of naturally coloured, impossibly purple pearls. Impossibly purple, yes. And also, uh, thinking about the amount of pearls that you know, are really beautiful, really incredible, that didn't make, didn't make the grade for this, oh, for this one absolutely. strand. But by the way, I see you all coming through on the phone lines, and I know this is an incredible deal for me to say, yeah, we launched at this price, yeah. and we had a bigger quantity then, and now we have the few that are remaining, and we're going to match the price. I'm not doing that. Oh, my God. That would be a normal auction. This can be a star buy. So please have a minute clock, Ollie. I said I'm going to price compare against myself. Oh my and word. if you think I'm going to ask for a star by clock and just take 10 or 20 pounds off, you're, you're wrong, you're mistaken. I've called it a star buy. I don't do star buys. That's not me. I don't do the, the, those things. I'm doing it today because I want you to understand in the truest sense that we are going to do a closeout deal on the only strand of this size and this color in the building. 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38. There's 39 pearls on this strand. 39. Absolutely incredible. Symmetrical, perfectly round, naturally coloured purple pearls. 
These are like uh, wow, you know, as high grade as you can get. You don't see any pits. You don't see uh, uh, any, oh, any, any uh, place where the, the, there is no color. It's a consistent body color on the pearls and a rainbow orient. And as you say, that's years worth of innovation. When we talk about things like beautiful Edison pearls, it's innovation, mm -hmm. and that's why they're so beautiful and so sought after and so and so and so and so coveted. You what know, you're getting here is of that same quality. Right, I'm going to take a chunk off this price now. It will be your final deal for the last 32. I shouldn't do this, but if, if I don't do it, then no one can because it was my price that, that I brought to you. So it has to be my decision to say, for today, for the closeout, we said we're saying goodbye to these incredible yeah. wishlist pearls. Take 100 pounds off the price. Oh! So just wow. so you know, that's the kind of thing that's that we low. do when we do a star buy. <laughs> just so if you ever see me ask that for a star low. buy sting, that's the reason why. So you'll know now in future if I do that. Yes, Neri, that's what he said. Yeah, 100 pounds. He's literally, is that what he said? Yeah. So, oh my goodness me, that is absolutely, it. I was not expecting that. 299 pounds for you today, four split payments of 74.75. Absolutely in, at 399, they were superb. At 299, it is unbelievable. They are flying. That is incredible. I get, get it now that. because even if that there's five amazing. or six left, the discussion will probably go something like this. I, I will say to the team, <laughs> look, well wow. done, Linda, you've just bought two. Wow. Uh, the, the discussion will go with the team. Yeah. If we have any left, say if we have five left, which it doesn't look like they will do, no. I'm going to ask our team to put a clasp on them and then take them on, onto Jump oh, to offer up. Sure. And it's not, it's not, I won't charge anymore, still charge the same price plus the glass, <laughs> but our collectors next door don't see purple pearls like this. Oh. They don't see this size, they don't see this quality. This You're so fortunate at Jewelry Maker yeah. to have, you have some of the, the, you probably have the best buyers across the group, right? This dedicated team that go out in search of, you know, just pearls or just some, you know, something else or just something else. And, and in that way, we have specialists that are out there trying to secure deals like this that really truly understand the market. Dave, you're not going to want to know this. Um, well, £7.70 a pearl. Okay. <laughs> and, and let's, let's oh. remind us of 2022. We've got it wrong. I mean, it's amazing. That's why we're so busy. It is incredible. But oh. can you imagine walking into Yoko of London and, you know, being brave enough to, to request the price in the actual gallery? Say, excuse me, the the wonderful naturally colored purple fresh water yes, pearls. Yes. What is the price? And they say, oh, thank you for asking. So the price is 22 and a half thousand pounds. I go, oh, can I multi-buy? <laughs> can I get two of those? Can I, I mean, multi -buy? But that's what we're offering you today. You can do that. It's not capped. You do whatever you want to do, but we buy very differently to everyone else. Same pearls, but we buy as much as we can. That's the question we ask. That is amazing. That is absolutely incredible. And it's just incredible when, you know, you've got Dave literally outdoing himself, um, uh, price comparing it to himself. But, I mean, if you want to price compare it to the Yoko piece, absolutely, you know, yeah. you know, go for it. But what you have here is something, is something unbelievable. You think it's, um, we, I'm just so grateful that you know, you know what you're getting. You yeah. know and, and, and look, Hong, aware of The it. Hong Kong Gem Show, which is really where the, the pearls are really, really kind yeah. of bought and sold hasn't taken place this year and it probably won't do. So in September, we're going out to Bangkok Gem Show. Oh, okay. A lot of the pearl vendors will be there. And I want to I'm going to take you, you know, with my phone, with the cameraman, to the booths and show you, you know, how Fireball Pearls are sold as single entities. I'm going to show you the, 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 the new price, the new market price for pearls like that, naturally colored purple strands. Uh, and you'll see them. And you'll know that you have them in your collection and you got them from Jewelry Maker mm. for £74.75 on an interest-free split payment. It's, it's, it's incredible. Inter or, or you can get the uh, Yoko piece for oh, you know what? My, where's my phone? Month. Yeah, £975 a month. But if they... Let's, let's do something really OK, cool. so uh, Suzanne, John, Olga, Carol Maker, uh, there's so many people with us in their baskets. What are you doing the math for, uh, Dave? Oh, yeah, I just wanted to find out how many months it was. So it was, was £937. Take, pounds. But I wanted to put our split payment in. Even if you could go into Yoko and say, that's fine, £22,500, but can I just pay £74, pounds, 75 Okay, pounds so how many years? It's 300 months. <laughs> 300 months. So let's divide that by 12. Oh. 25 years. 25 years. And that split, and that split payment, if, <laughs> even if they were kind enough to say, 
I'll tell you what we'll do. We can't, we can't do anything about the price, but we can match them on the same terms as their split pay. Interest-free split payments, £75 I worked it out. A quarter of a decade. Um, it's a mortgage. <laughs> it's it? a mortgage. No, it's what Ali's just yeah, it's, it's Can I take a mortgage out on that, please? Yeah, no problem. Um, that's what we've just done. Congratulations. Well done. I have one final deal to bring to have you. Have you? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, it's, it's, again, a full necklace, but in a oh, very different yeah. proposition. So Beautiful. it's not a strand. And this is why when you get a strand like this, if you want to think of it as a strand, that's fine, but think of it as an opportunity because you can just take one of the pearls from that strand, of which there were 39, did you say, pearls on that strand? Oh, gosh, I can't remember. Yes. You did, you said 39. You can just take one of them and create a beautiful oh piece of jewelry like this because they are obviously drilled all the way through. My last deal with you. How many of these do I have, Neri? Wow. Wow. That is, that is lovely. Yeah. That is an absolute beauty. I've got 186 of these, and this is very what? different. Yeah, I'm, get, I'm giving you first refusal at, at a jewelry maker, and then I am allowed, actually, to take the rest on to Gems to be because it is a finished piece of jewelry. Yeah. So it's, I don't have to, you know, it's very hard to take a lot of the things we offer here on jewelry maker next door. Yes. Because it's not a finished piece of jewelry. Yes. This is a finished piece of jewelry. Yeah. This is a gift. So I'm going to, it's 186. Do you know what I'm going to do? Star buy. Another star yeah. buy? And now you before. know, now you know what that means. <laughs> so now there's 186. I expect to see all 186 of you on the phone lines. You know what we're going to do on this. It's going to be remarkable. It's going to be the best deal of the show, of course. And you're going to get it in your collection. If you want to, if you want to, you, maybe you bought the strand, but maybe you want to gift something like this to someone in your life, your niece, granddaughter, daughter, whatever it may be. Even if it's for Christmas, this is what I will say. Even if you're thinking ahead for Christmas, I'm never that organized. I'm going on holiday on Wednesday. I haven't even packed but, or, or anything. But I've, I haven't even got any clothes. But <laughs> Just go if, if you are you organized are. and you're thinking, do you know what? That would make a really nice Christmas gift. This is the best time to get it because between now and Christmas, the opportunity, the likelihood of seeing naturally colored bubble bars is zero. So we're going to do a star buy. When we come back, I'm going to give you an incredible deal. Okay, 186, we're gonna get the graphics in straight away. So it's a finished piece of jewelry. It's a finished piece of jewelry, obviously solid sterling silver. Um, it is your, your incredible naturally colored purple pearl. We're not deviating from that. It's what we've been talking about all morning. These, these pearls you know, really kind of hit the market with some momentum in 2018. And here we are in 2022 and they've practically disappeared. And we've wow. just had the most unbelievable showcase and I wanted to finish off by giving you a gift like this. This is um, a, a finished necklace set onto sterling silver. You've got your white topaz bezel set here. It, it's gorgeous. There's six grams of sterling silver yeah. in this piece. That is a big, big, big gram weight. Miri, can I just take the clicker a That's second? It's huge. Thank you, mate. Gram weight that there you're you go. This is here. even even this year, even with, and the reason these are commanding significant premiums this year. Yeah is because there is no production of the natural pearls. For the culture pearls, there's no production. So the natural pearls have shot up in price because mm -hmm. where's the alternative? So this arrives at Bonhams. Rare purple pearl found on a dinner plate. <laughs> it's not even it's drilled. Insane. And uh, this is 2021. Spherical pearl discovered by a diner while enjoying a plate of clams. How fortunate is that? Mm. And on June 16th last year, it's pre-sale estimate which is usually low to encourage bidding. Usually set it low to okay. encourage interest. You know, yes. if you see a house auction, you know, it's usually a, a price you think, oh my God, I'm gonna, you know, that, that's cheap. Yes. It's because they want to get people interested and then they outbid each other and it exceeds what they really want to get. So 15 to $20,000 is the pre-sale estimate. Wow. But multi-buyers already. We have a naturally yes, colored brilliant. purple pearl on this strand. It is cultured, but it is naturally colored purple. And, you know, like we said, six grams of silver oh, with a clasp, dude. with the bezel set, a uh, wonderful marambaya topaz as well. Can I just say as well, we, there, there is no way that we're putting a quantity of 186 on screen without, have, without fully intending for every single one of these to go today. This oh. isn't something, oh, you know, 50 have gone, oh, well, never mind, let's and, move and on. You, you know, is, we've well, got a... Get that price right. Carol, you've, you've been part of 
you know, some of the biggest quantity auctions in jewelry making history. Yeah. And you know, to move a quantity, the price has to be low. That's the reality. Like, it's all to do with You can price. twist it any yeah. way you want, but to get 186 It's got to be the right phone, price. There's a reason I called a star buy. We're going to do something crazy right now for all of you. Love it. It just pays to be on the phone lines early. So I'm going to take a minute clock. And in this minute, I would love to see 186 of you on the phone lines. Oh my I'd absolutely God, love to that. see you all there, primed, ready, whether it's in your basket, whether you've got the app, whether you're on the phone, in a queue. This is going to be the moment now. 50 seconds is, you, know, you have to get this into your collection. Wonderful, natural colors. Janet, Maker, Stunning. Maker in North Yorkshire, Zoe in Lincolnshire, Caroline, you're looking to buy six of these. Absolutely. I'm going to reward you. Jenny, you bought two in Dorset. Susan in Hertfordshire, you're on the phone lines. I love everything about this. I love the, the quality of the chain, that beautiful sterling silver chain, which gives you those wonderful flat sides. It's almost like it's been diamond cut, so it gives you a wonderful luster. The way the pearl's been set with that gorgeous eyelet either side, and you've got that beautiful loop either side. You've got the beautiful extender chain as well with the little, here we are, with the little... Um, um, uh, tag on the end as well, which is absolutely gorgeous. All 925 sterling silver. And then set about a third of the way okay. up the necklace. You've got these two beautiful yeah. Marambaya. If, if, um, we had, if we had 60 gorgeous. of these or 50 of these, yes, the price would be 49.99. Would be what? 49.99. As like, as like a yeah, as a goodbye deal, as an incredible deal. No just way. Just to thank you for being joining us this morning. If we had 50 or 60, we go 49.99, so let's do that. Oh my gosh. And then let me remind you I've got 186. <laughs> let me remind you that I've got 186. So we'll get a 49.99. Like, like Carol said, we, we don't want to just sell 50 or 60. No. Right? But 50 or 60 are going to sell right now at this price. But the, I've got 186. The quality of this pearl you oh, are getting it's ridiculous. Hit. The silver alone for 49, the chain alone yeah. for 49.99 is absolutely tremendous. I can't believe Okay, I'll take a minute amazing. clock. And then now we're going to get serious. My final deal, and then I'll be leaving you. Uh, and I know you have some wonderful things to, yeah. to, 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 to bring to everybody. I've got 56 seconds to get rid of 186. How do I do that? Oh how do I do that? Well, I know, I know already how I'm going to do that. It's just whether you are going to take advantage right oh, now. Whether God. you're going to be called another, uh, number 187 is the question right now. Because that deal on your screens, it's actually unparalleled. No one's doing that. No one's doing naturally colored purple pearls um, at this size in finished jewelry for these prices. I mean, we saw one in a ring earlier for 2003. Exactly. Just a round, just a round naturally colored purple pearl. And do you know what I love? I love the design of this. I think it's commercial. I think it would appeal to, you know, appeal to all ages, myself, Linda. But that's the know. wonderful thing about pearls in general. Yes. I think pearls are timeless. Yeah. And, and they can become, they can go from classic to contemporary. Yes, just, absolutely. Just, just with uh, the change of neckline. Exactly. Just with yeah, who's yeah, yeah. wearing it. Definitely. They are stately. They are yeah, timeless. They are incredible. This is why pearls in the West are passed down through generations. Ready? $29.99. Oh my gosh. 29.99. Told you it's right. incredible. Right, go for it. I called it a star buy. It's 186. <laughs> that's all we have. We can't go and remake this. I told you these oh, pearl wow. prices for naturally colored purple pearls are through the roof right now. That is so amazing. So to recommission this, to recreate this, we might be far closer to three figures right now. I've got director Ollie who's buying five of these. Why but not? for honestly, for Christmas gifts, these are absolutely perfect. Oh, yeah. Birthday presents, absolutely superb. And I'm looking at this now thinking, do you know what? I want one of these. My mum would absolutely love this. Linda, do you know what I mean? It's, it's got that commercial vibe to it, hasn't it? It's not... I mean, I think you can be inspired with those gorgeous fireball pearls that we've had earlier. I think yes. Yes, definitely. There's something similar because you've got you through drill. Yes. Um, but that's a classic pearl necklace with a hint of contemporary. Yes, isn't, isn't it? it? Mm -hmm. Isn't it just, it's just gorgeous and really appreciating the pearl, it's its entirety, it's individual character, it's gorgeous. There are so many people, that, so many people. And, and also, I just will warn you, I know 186 sounds like a lot. So you might feel like it's safe in your basket. When there's a deal like this on your screen, yes. this is what happens. And you might come to find that when you go to check out that basket, it's been taken, which can happen and does happen exactly. all the time. Yeah, so if there's someone on the phone lines or there's, that's saying, look, I want this, 
and, and yours hasn't been checked out, then yeah. the, the contact center can and will take it out of a basket. So just warning you, because I know 186 seems like a big quantity, and it usually is, but when the deal's this good, yes, exactly. and you've got people multiplying to the tunes of six and sevens and threes and twos, mm -hmm. then it's really actually not 186 opportunities. Yeah. It's less than 100. Yeah, just incredible. Well done to everybody. 29.99 for you today with your 30-day money-back guarantee. Um, 0800 644 Well done to absolutely everyone. Do not leave this in your basket because it will go absolutely superb for less than 30 pounds well done chris has just taken two sunny uh, sorry sonny's just taken three west sussex has got two gloucestershire's got two absolutely fantastic well done everybody absolutely so many baskets check out as quickly as you can twos threes fours fives going absolutely amazing well done. Well done. what and a deal what an incredible deal i know linda still has some wonderful things yes. to share with you it's amazing actually linda to, to get that insight it's from you idea. being at the moment that we first, as, as, a, as a company, first seeing Fireball Pearls, and that was incredible uh, for me, and I'm sure for you guys at home. I am back with you on Sunday for the finale of what we are calling the Tales of Jade, and of course, oh, we, yes, we are bringing right. you the rarest of the Jade Eyes. Not, I'm not talking about price, not the most valuable. We know Imperial Green is the most valuable, but indeed the rarest, and that is Black Omphocyte Type A Jade Eye that we'll be sharing with you on Sunday. And I've got this piece here. Oh that, my honestly, gosh. Dove Grey Jade Eye. It's incredible. I've never seen anything like it. Um, obviously, we don't have the same quantities we've had throughout the week. Um, you can imagine when you're talking about the rarest, yes. it's very hard to go, hey guys, can we get 500 of those? <laughs> you're like, no. Um, so that is your opportunity. Just want to remind you the last time Taipei, like natural black jade eye, was actually came out of the ground in the market, was 2018. It's the last time it came out of the ground. They Goodness haven't found it me. since. So to have a collection like that and have a carrot weight like that, it's going to be really important. I can't wait to get to talk to you about it on Sunday. So we look forward to seeing you then. Thank you. Thank you, Carol. See you in a sec. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Join us for the Tales of Jade. This is a gemstone that has been revered for well over 4,000 years. It has been uncovered in archaeological sites dating back to the Neolithic era. Every single dynasty that has ruled over China has valued this stone above gold, and us mere mortals are never meant to own it. After visiting Myanmar in 2018 and hearing about the stories from that part of the world, from that side of the border, we wanted to bring to an event where we uncover the true tales of jadeite, steeped in folklore and mystery. This event is where you collect to get to experience all the different varieties, all the different colors. Essentially, every jadeite we have ever acquired, that we have ever procured from the Far East, will be available for a limited time only and for the best and incredible deals. This is your chance to get your jadeite happily ever after. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
sure you join us this Saturday on Jewelry Maker for Rumble in the Jungle. And we've got everything you would expect to see. So amazing deals on amber. We've got incredible animal charms, animal themed kits. We've got seed beads. We've even got a sterling silver elephant wearing a peridot. See you then on Saturday. Do you know what? I, I, and, and, and just echoing something that um, was just said in the gallery, that, that was absolutely amazing and we loved the pearls and it was great to see Dave and everything. It was absolutely fantastic. But I did keep looking over at these and thinking, oh my gosh, I can't wait to do these. I can't wait to do these. Oh, I love this gem. And Linda, you were just saying how much you love this gem and Ollie was saying how much he loves this gem. It is uh, for me, it is positivity. It's just everything I look for in a gem. It's balanced, it's beautiful, it's vibrant, it's unique. It's, uh, it's, it's different worlds colliding. It is, I, I think, one of the most exciting gemstones we've launched in the last three years. We launched this in the height of the COVID-19 pandemic. I remember it like it was yesterday. And um, at that time, it was, it was, you know, life was very, very different to how it is now. It was kind of, life lacked kind of color. It lacked variety. It lacked warmth. It lacked... Uh, the future. The future. <laughs> knowing what the future was going to be, it lacked friendships. It was, you know, mental, mental health was just all, all over the place. It, it was not a good time. So to have this was like, we were all kind of, wow, this is just so cool. It's just superb. It's got so much going for it. It's got so much incredible color. And um, the colors you are getting here and what you're getting here as a gem is something so special. And I tell you something, it is getting more and more and more recognition. This is spiny oyster turquoise. And what it is, is a fusion of two gemstones. Your incredible turquoise, which you can see with all of these beautiful turquoisey colors. And then the most incredible oranges, whites, grays, blacks. And that is the shell of the spiny oyster. Now, uh, what, what the, the end result is something which I think is a beautiful balance of warmth and coolness. It's got the most wonderful um, uh, tones going through it. Um, but we've never, but I have never done strands before. I, I, I was lucky enough to launch this gemstone and I launched it in these cabochon sizes and cabochon shapes and it was wonderful. But I remember thinking at the time, do you know what? I absolutely love these cabs. What I'd really like to see though is is to give everybody who is a beader access as well. And I would absolutely love to be able to bring in strands to air. And um, so these were the kind of original pieces and believe you and I, they are gonna, they, they are gonna go very, they are gonna all sell out today. The beauty is of course, every single one of these is unique. Every single one of these tells a different story. You'll see images in some of them. You'll see patinations, which are, um, which will make you think of something. And um, some of them will have burgundies in as well. And we'll, um, and we'll see a, a photograph of the spiny oyster shell in a minute. And you'll understand where all those incredible colors come from, but it is, it is one of those gems, uh, sorry, it's one of those um, incredible shells that is, um, it's got lots of colors within it, much <coughs> like with the pearls that we've just seen. Um, now, when I first launched this gem, uh, I, I, was, I was taken to one of my uh, kind of, we've all got those kind of um, uh, places on earth that we feel a, a real pull and a real draw to. And I remember from the earliest age, I was, I was, I was very, very lucky um, 
to go to um, uh, to go to the Arizona desert and to go to the Grand Canyon and to see and to see these incredible vistas. And it got me thinking: these colours are everywhere in uh, Native American uh, um, artwork, Native American uh, rugs and blankets, Native American um, uh, jewellery. And it just got me thinking, these are the exact colours that are used everywhere. And if you actually look at images of the Arizona deserts, if you look at images of, 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 of this part of the world, these are the colours. You can see them there. The reds, the oranges, the yellows, the, the, the beautiful um, uh, turquoises. And those colours there are no mistake. There's a reason why those colours are used together. Yes, they're in nature. And yes, you're getting them to an absolute uh, T in this incredible selection of strands and cabochons today. But I just wanted to kind of talk about very quickly about the symbology of the colour. And then we're going to start to bring you these strands because we are running out of time. So... Uh, in your Native American artwork and in, and in the, things like the Pendleton rugs that you can get, which I'm a huge fan of, I think they're absolutely beautiful. The white is a symbol of mourning. So that's when you get white in these artwork, in these, in these beautiful pieces of art and rugs, etc., etc. The yellows and oranges are dusk. And that's the beautiful, um, and that's the beautiful kind of sunset, those kind of colors that you see in the Arizona desert. The black is a symbol of night. Um, uh, and then, of course, you've got blue, which is um, synonymous with dawn. So you've got all of these gorgeous colours, which, uh, without even thinking about it, this is just what it means to me, as in, as in, this is what it just reminds me of. But you've got here the most incredible, I see, fusion of morning, dusk, night, dawn, all together. It's that fusion of... Of, 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 all of, those, um, of all of those times of day and how the light changes throughout the day, all of it in a gemstone. Now, I want to show you a photograph of the spiny oyster. It's a rather beautiful oyster, actually. Um, and you can see very, very easily um, uh, why it's called the spiny oyster. It's because it's got lots of spines on it. The spiny oyster, by the way, and this is something which Linda mentioned earlier on. Um, at, we're on a, a little break, actually, um, but it is definitely worth mentioning. The spiny oyster shell is a byproduct of the oyster that's in it. Um, the oyster is, is, is harvested and then eaten. Um, but the shell itself uh, without spiny oyster turquoise would just, would just be discarded. So um, it, is, it, is, uh, uh, an, a, it is a byproduct of, of, of that industry. I'd like to mention as well that um, there, are, there are records, there are document, uh, documents um, uh, which, which talk about the spiny oyster shell. And because of its beauty and, and, and I don't know, it, it, it's, 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 its incredible shape, um, it was used um, in, in certain rituals and it, and it, and it, was, a, no, it, it, it was deemed as a sacred, a sacred shell. That's just a little kind of side note. Um, I adore this gem and I know you've been looking forward to this showcase <coughs> absolutely well, you, uh, it reminds me of uh, I think you and I together um when you launched the Laguna Agate oh yes it's it's with Gemma sort of as close as we've ever got oh my to, gosh to that again but it's got more more visual performance it's got more color um and it's got more um design I couldn't, I couldn't agree more, Linda. When we launched Laguna... Oh, look at that strand. It's epic. When we launched Laguna Lace Agate, which we haven't had back since. We've had one strand back since, and I think it was only because it came back into stock. Um, it, was, it literally just left all of us completely dumbfounded. 16 chances, that's it. Carolyn, Dorothy, Alison, Susan and Brian have taken two. Alison, Gloria, Valentina. It, it, is, it is absolutely superb. This is, the, we have done strands before. This is the first time I've ever done strands. This is the first time that Linda's ever done strands. They are absolutely incredible. Now, um, we are going to be giving you the most amazing price point today. Do not, do not miss out on this. Honestly, this is a gem which has had such a profound impact on me. And it's clearly had such a profound impact on you as well, our, our incredible viewership. In the cabochon sizes, maybe you've already got some of the strands, but honestly, that is just all of the good things in life, isn't it? It's balance, it's warmth, it's cool. It reminds you of the sky, it reminds you of the sun, it reminds you of, it reminds us all of, of, of the day as an entirety. From, from dawn to mornings, 
to, uh, to dusk to nightfall. It's got everything in it that, that, that I want from a gemstone. It connects me to the earth and it, and it, and it, and it, and it just inspires me. You will find this inspiring. Okay, we've got 50 in baskets. I've got five left. Here's your price. It's astonishing and it's flying. Two left, 39.99. Oh my gosh, I want this so badly. I really want this strand. So, and, and do you know what? Totally unisex, I would wear this. My husband would love a bracelet made out of mm. this as well. It's absolutely beautiful. A fusion of turquoise and the spiny oyster shell. That is, that is, I mean, I look at that and I instantly think, oh, that's, that's summer, that's sunshine. But actually that is 365 days a year, isn't it? Absolutely. It's, it's so synony synonymous of um, the climate conditions that it's the spiny oyster and the turquoise is found, isn't it? It's got all of those terrain colours. Yes, that's it. The sandy tones in there. You've got the kind of the, uh, you've got kind of sandy tones, red, st red kind of colours, um, colours of kind of bright white, kind of almost granite in there. You've got everything to your kind of almost Cotswold stone, uh, sandy colours. Look at this. They've completely sold out. Next strand, slight, ever so slightly smaller. Okay, these are these are absolutely flight. Yeah, these are the biggest rounds we've got. Look at the intensity of colour you're getting there. It's just superb, isn't it? Absolutely amazing. And you're seeing more and more and more of it on uh, on the internet. I, I went on to Etsy um, this morning. I think this might be from the American Etsy site because it is a a gem which is really really popular over in the states. Here in the UK, it's it, it, it's definitely becoming more popular. But look at this individual strands. I mean, these are uh, significantly larger, but. Look at this, £98.53. pence. So you can tell it's sold in the US. Well, it's going to be coming from the States. Significantly larger in size, but just look at that price point, £98.53. I mean, I don't think that's a bad price point at all. I'd love to get them in this kind of size. Suzanne, you've got two. Angela's got two. Valentina, Nicolette, well done to you. OK, we've got a minute's clock, and then we're going to just get the price point down. How many, do, how, how many of this do we have? 30. Oh, man alive. 30 chances available. Absolutely flying. Go, 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 go. This is just superb. Every one is different. Some of them will have more oranges. Others, like these two here, that, that's got more of a pinky colour going through it. And if you do look at lots of it, I mean, I've just shown you one image, but if you do look at other images of the spiny oyster turquoise, uh, sorry, spiny oyster shell, you'll see it's not just orange. You've got like um, uh, burgundies in there and whites in there. You can you can kind of make them out on the on the image of the shop, but yeah, you kind of get you, getting the idea there. Here we go. Angela's taken four now. Well done to you, my lovely. Fifteen seconds. Price point's going to be going down. There's loads of you there in the in the uh, uh, with this in the baskets. Well done. Absolutely gorgeous. Just love it. I mean, if you make yourself a piece of jewellery from from this beautiful gemstone, that's your capsule holiday piece, isn't it? Absolutely. You don't need your to take holiday. anything yes. else. It'll go. You know, from breakfast to to dinner, won't it? Yes, and with absolutely. whatever you wear, to me, it shrieks holiday. Oh. Well, yeah, I mean, it, it does, doesn't it? It's yours. Thirty four ninety nine. Beverly Gale, uh, Donna, Alison, Maker, Linda, Suzanne's got two. Jane in uh, Cumbria, well done to you. Janet, Helen, Valentina, Amanda's got two. Nicolette, well done to you. Maker, June, Wendy, Barbara, Christine, Maker, uh, Jay, Beryl, well done to you. Christine, Alison, oh, well done. Loads of people checking out. £34.99. I'll just hold it out as well. Look, you've got here three and a half to five mil in size. Every one is different. Every one tells a different story. Look, there's whites, greys. Let, let me just remind you of those colours kind of in, in, in I mean, in, in kind of, I mean, you don't have to say it's um, to do with Native American culture, but that, that, that's what the colours mean in their culture is the white is morning. Oh, sorry, blue is dawn. White is the morning. Uh, you've got yellow and orange, which is dusk, and you've got black, which is nightfall, which is, it, it's just, it's, it, it, you can't, you can't bring a stone like this to air without referencing no, landscapes, it's, vistas, it's, it's just different terrain. Another one of these gemstone 
types that has been revered for decades, if yes. not centuries, through different, different civilizations. Absolutely. Absolutely. You're absolutely right. Uh, I bought these last time they came to air. The quality is, I assume that says amazing. Uh, but yeah, it is. It is absolutely incredible. I'm seeing it for the first time. I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm seeing these strands for the first time. I've never bought you strands of spiny oyster turquoise. All I've ever bought you are the cabbages, which I loved. But honestly, strands... And we've got big shapes, big sizes. Look at all of these. We still haven't played any of these yet. All of these. We're going to put them all. I'll tell you what, stuff it. We'll put them all on pre-order because we are running out of time this hour. We're going to put them all on pre-order. They've gone very, very well so far. So we'll put them all. Oh, blimey. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Sorry, gang. Put them all on pre-order because um, they are all going to go today. They are just superb. I love them. So it's a fusion of turquoise and, um, sp and spiny, uh, spiny, the spiny oyster shell. So nice to see these two together. Much like when you get the Copper Mojave um, uh, Turquoise, Copper Mojave Amethyst, Copper Mojave Peridot. Same kind of fusion, same kind of technique. I prefer this. I just love the colours. Right, this next one. Fair warning. Big quantity of this. Big go on, Neary. Yes! How many do we have? Oh! <gasps> Just over 100 of these. Right. Can I just say, if you've never experienced this gem before, get it. Just do it. There are certain gemstones out there and and it's a matter of, you know, yeah, it's a matter of opinion. It's a matter of, yeah, well, you know, oh, I like this gemstone. Well, I don't like that gemstone. I prefer this gemstone. Well, my favourite gemstone is this. Can I just say, I cannot think of a single person on planet Earth who will not want this gem. Imagine Every one, single um, person I can think of would love sorry, this. Sorry, Carol. Um, it would make it. a fantastic memory wire bracelet, wouldn't it? Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Absolutely. But as Linda said earlier on, the, the, the kind of excitement and enthusiasm about things like the Laguna Lay Saga. We've never seen anything like it before on Jewelry Maker, which is why it went so quickly. And it's never come back into stock. It's never kind of, oh, you know, I've got it home and then I've sent it back. I've never seen strands before. I've never bought, you know, this is incredible. And it's yours today, $24.99. Try it out today. Just get it, go, go. And if there's any left, I'm having them all. I'm having them all. I'd love to see wedding jewellery made out of this as well. You know, who says, you know, it has to be pearls for wedding jewellery? I'd love to see wedding jewellery because it's, it's, it's optimistic. It's beautiful. It's colourful. It's warm. It's cool. It's bright. It's refined. It's interesting, um, but it's not too wacky. It's got loads of, it's got lots to look at, lots of interest, lots of inspiration, but it's also... Uh, but it's also a gemstone, which is really, I feel that connection to the earth and where it's from. I really genuinely do. And when you see it set into jewellery, and I'm not talking about kind of, uh, you know, uh, kind of, you know, just the kind of rustic beaded pieces, which you might make with this. I'm talking about high end jewellery, you know, set into yellow gold, set into, you know, white gold, set with um, uh, diamonds. You know, you've got a gemstone of real quality that people are going to want to set with you know, they're precious metals. It's gorgeous. $24.99. Try it out. Get it home. I can almost guarantee you will not send this back. It's one of those gems that I think everybody is going to feel a connection with. Loads of people there. Well done. Loads in baskets, but absolutely superb. Well done to everybody. Go, 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 go. Well done, everybody. Yvonne, Linda, Valentina, Patricia, Allison, Susan, Beryl, John, Claire. Absolutely so many people. Um, Hundreds of people on the phone lines there. Well done. We do have a queue on the phone lines. Make her Christine and Sterling show your call should be answered any second now. Uh, well done to you, Nicolette. Well done to you, Peter and Suffolk. Just come through. Mary and the Rondas just come through. More bidders on the phone. Oh wow. But, okay, bidder in the West Midlands. Your call should be answered any second. Jay's now through. Glennis, your call should be answered any second in Cumbria. We do have big queues on the phone lines. Okay. Christine's still waiting in the queue. I know you're waiting. We know you're waiting. There's still genuine chances left. That's how big the queues are at the minute. Christine's still in that queue. If you can join us on our website, jewelrymaker.com, or if you can um, download our app and watch us on the go, please, please, please do. Well done, everybody. Absolutely superb. Check out your baskets, everyone. $24.99 for you today. Just <laughs> incredible. Well done, everybody. 0800 644 655. Well done. More people coming through. Just brilliant. Well done at 24.99. Okay, moving on. Moving on just purely because of time. There's still chances left. Woo! 
Marquise? No. Yes! <gasps> right. Wait till you see the quality. So this is where it really starts to come into its own. Because up until now, I bought you beautiful rounds. Rounds are great. But if you really want surface area, this is... These, I should say. Look at this. 30 available. Look at that. <gasps> it's so much to look at, isn't I it? Know. Do you know. I know. I'm literally looking stay. at... They are so seriously cool. Stay. This would be a fantastic gemstone to make as your signature gemstone, wouldn't it? So if you collect yeah. this and then pop it on, say, the, you know, at the very back of a strand of pearls or something, one of the, the small ones, and then every time whoever's wearing that looks at it, they'll remember you completely and utterly. And if they need another piece of jewellery, they come back. Signatures can be collectible. Can you imagine yeah. that, having a gem like this, which is your insignia? This is, you're known for this gem. I mean, goodness me. You know, you've got Mikimoto known for their pearls. You've got Tiffany's known for their diamonds. Give me the spiny, spiny oyster turquoise any day of the week, love. Incredible. And of course, so easy to set uh, with your bezel strip, with your gallery wire. You know, you've got so many different ways in which you can set this. It's just gorgeous. $24.99. Loads of people there. Beverly, Susan's got two. Nicolette, Helen, Maker. Hi, Carol. I bought two strands of spiny oyster. They are so lovely. I fell in love with this stone. Bought one more today. Do you know what? Marie, I, I, Maria, I totally understand where you're coming from. It's one of those gems, you get it, and then you just, you just find it, you just want more. Because each gemstone, each, each stone is different. Each, each piece is different. It's just gorgeous. Yeah, imagine setting it like this in this incredible piece here. It's so simple, so beautiful, letting that gem do all the talking. But um, I think that's available on our sister channel uh, over on, over on uh, gems. But, well, dare know. I say it, I think our, our version's nicer stones than that. I, well, yes. yeah, I, well, I, yeah. It's more physical, isn't it? It is, and it and it's bigger sizes. There's a lot of oh gosh, look at yeah, look at that. Two chances left. Well done, everyone. Okay, now that's going to sell out. Next strand that we're going to bring you. Which one is it, Neri? Yeah, a kite. Yes, an upside down kite. Got it. Oh, right. You're getting some interesting ones here. You're getting some whites in here. Oh, my word. That's so cool. That's so cool. I want my bathroom done in here, kind of tiled yeah. in these. They're yeah. so cool. Look at that. So don't forget, you know, we're talking about kind of, you know, and this is only what it reminds me of. But the first thing I thought when I remember when I launched this stone, you know, in the height of the pandemic, when the world lacked any kind of colour, when the world lacked any kind of oh, joy, um, it, it reminded me of those beautiful vistas of, you know, the Arizona desert cowboys. You know, it, it, that, that's what it reminded me of. And in your Native American artwork and uh, uh, rug work and, uh, and, uh, and, and, and in jewellery, these colours are very significant. So you've got blue, which is dawn, white, which is morning. Yellow, which is dusk, yellow and orange, which is dusk, and black, which is night. And it's got all of that in here. Some of them actually look like, you know, the turquoise almost look like river estuaries running towards great sandstone, um, uh, great sandstone uh, kind of um, plinths, don't they? It's just gorgeous. Beautiful. Well done. Okay. Really lovely shape here. Quite a contemporary shape, isn't it? But again, even more of that beautiful surface area on show to give you that, because um, you want surface area with this. You want that big canvas look, don't you? That big canvas. Gorgeous, just running out of time. Here we go, price point. Well done, well done, well done. Go, 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 go. All the way down, my lovelies. Absolutely superb. $24.99, amazing, gorgeous. Oh my word, these are absolutely flying out the door. Again, so popular. Don't forget, we put all of these on pre-order, so we might not be able to play every single time, but we put them all on pre-order for you today. Get as many of them as you can. And of course, the great thing is, Linda, if you want to buy two or three of these, each one of the strands is going to be unique. Absolutely unique. Can you imagine pulling those together, that top drill there at the point? You can pull them together into a flower shape. Oh! And then you can have that, set that as through a lariat star necklace. It would look really nice. I love that idea. What a great idea. Or even you stitched onto that. a belt or something, or stitched onto your jeans. Yes! Oh! For that real cowboy look. Yeah. Yes! Or onto your Stetson. 
Onto your, whatever it's called, a 10 gallon hat or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called, something gallon hat. Anyway, well done. 20, <coughs> excuse me, 24.99 for you today. Well done. Uh, Neary, what are we going to do next, lovely? Do you know which one we're going to do next? Here we go. So, next strand. I think it's these. Puffy hearts. They're not hearts. I don't like it, the fact that we call things hearts when they're not hearts. They're drops. It's this one. It's a drop. It's a fat drop. Ooh! Seven on the strand. That is seriously cool. Always something to look at uh, here. Yeah, I think you're absolutely right, Ollie. Yeah, uh, blue and orange are opposites on the colour wheel, which is why they go so well together. But you've just got that... You've got that... White, sorry, blue, which is dawn. White, which is morning. Yellow, which is your, uh, yellow and orange, which is your dusk. And then black, which is night. Those are the colors which are brought together in this stone. Those are the colors. Those are the feelings. And for me, I can always feel the sunshine on my face when I look at this. It's just, it's just gorgeous. And we launched this at a time when, when life was rubbish for so many people you know the height of the COVID-19 pandemic it's so so joyous to see something like this it was just so it was just gorgeous and Shell mother of pearl jewelry Shell jewelry it is making a huge comeback bohemian jewelry um and of course your um your gorgeous kind of beach driftwoody piece they are you know, as, as, we, as we finally start caring for our oceans and um, take more of an interest in, our, in, in you know, the oceans that surround us, it, it, you know, beach jewelry is making a huge, huge, huge comeback. Um, coral as well. And, and we can't bring you coral uh, on jewelry unless it's fossilised. We can't bring you coral because it's totally unethical. We can't, we can't, we can't kind of, you can't go and dredge coral reefs. Goodness me, no way. Um, you know, it has to be fossilised coral, which tends not to be corally colour. It tends to be uh, bleached white by the sun. So, you know, this is kind of almost one of those, you know, the, the best thing, you know, the, the best next thing. Uh, sorry, the next best thing, sorry. Um, here we go. Price, well, you're getting slightly more on this strand here. Okay. Look how it reminds me almost of um, impressionist paintings. Oh, Paul Gauguin it? out in the South Seas and Van Gogh and all that. Van Gogh, Van Gogh, whoever you, however you what want. What is it? it? Who was the artist? Was it Klimt who did that? Gustav Klimt. Who did the yes. kiss? Yes. And it's the lady. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of yeah, all those down. colours. And it's, the, it's these colours, isn't it? It's the it, 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 it's the it's the honey colours. In fact, that centre one is very Klimt. It is, isn't it? Yeah. I wonder whether you can find that, Neary. I don't know. Sorry, Neary's got his work cut out at the minute. Um, is it August? August? Gustav. Gustav Klimt, The Kiss. Gustav Klimt. It is a beautiful piece of art, but it's got these honey colours in. I don't know. We'll see whether we can find it. Or it might be something completely different that he finds. Who knows? <laughs> uh, don't just... Yeah, uh, no, 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 no. That piece of art there. Yeah, that one. That's what. That's it. The kiss. It's beautiful, isn't it? I think that's my favourite piece of artwork. I'm really drawn well, to it. Well, it's just made up of so many pieces. It's mm -hmm. almost like a mosaic itself, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, here it is. Oh, Neary, you're just an absolute hero. Here we go. Yes, there we go. It, it, it's just so gorgeous. It's, it's just a beautiful kind of, yes. Oh, it's sold out. Well done. Can you imagine? Um, Gosh, she's beautiful. Gustav Klimt it's... could have well been inspired by that gem, couldn't he? Because they, yes. they did used to paint in these um, places Absolutely. where the oyster, spiny oyster sort of um, grows, as it were, mm. um, down in these warm waters and these beautiful places with a beautiful light. Yes. Yes, absolutely. Wait, which is the next one, Libby? Trapezoids, diamonds or kind of off shape? Yes, off shape, but uh, yeah, kind of S shapes, are we calling them? Or I don't know. Uh, you're getting five on the strands here. You'll get around about that um, amount. Oh, they're just. Uh, do you know, my. my um, I, and I've done this, I, I remember years ago doing this, getting little tiny pieces of tissue paper, tiny little fragments, and just gluing them onto, uh, you know, gluing them together and, and making these beautiful little mosaics. But that one there is almost completely orange. It's just so gorgeous. Sorry about the dye on my hand, by the way. I was tie dyeing with my kids yesterday. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous colours there. Turquoises, honey colours, oranges. I love it. We've got the most amazing hour coming up next, by the way, because we've got so much beautiful texture, so much gorgeous shell coming up. Twenty four ninety nine. Well done. These are flying, and it's so. I'm so 
pleased that you love these as much as we do. Well done. Look at those names. Well done to everybody. 0800 644 Go, 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 go. Well done, everybody. Absolutely incredible uh, for you today. Well done. I suppose you could say it's kind of got those elements. You've got the earth, the air, the fire, the water, haven't you? You've got kind of, kind of got all of the kind of main element kind of colours in there as well, haven't you? Yeah, I think that's um, why it's inspired the Native Americans because of that sort of I don't doubt it for touch. a minute. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. I don't doubt that for in a minute. Uh, for a minute. Well done, everybody. Twenty four ninety nine. So many people coming through to get this. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Lots and lots and lots of people adding this order. Well done. Two more strands. I think it must be this strand. Oh, wow. Oh, like diamond shapes. I reckon this is my favorite strand so far. Yeah, it's the same strand. So the central one has got like this almost kind of snow-topped mountain look to it. Look. <laughs> You've got almost like this snow-topped mountain look, which is gorgeous. But it actually isn't that one that I'm, I'm most drawn to. This one here, look at that. Uh, that's almost like hair, like a swirl of orange going through. Oh, my goodness me. They are got Yeah, now, something um, uh, um, uh, Linda mentioned earlier on is putting the... It was with this strand. Putting them all kind of point to point mm -hmm. and creating a lovely floral look. You could do exactly the same yeah, with these. You can these. create what, what is now known as... Um, I mean, this is a great gemstone for gallery jewellery. Yes, you know, you'll see this sort of thing in, in sure. pottery galleries, uh, oh. ceramic ga galleries and art galleries. You know, mm. they always have a gift shop and this is the sort of jewellery, this is the sort of stone that they tend to, to use if they can get it because it, it's so artistic. Yes, definitely. Definitely. You could put the point of all of these together and it would create kind of almost mm. like a semicircle. That would be a gorgeous pendant in the middle of a in the middle of a necklace. Do you know what, though? Uh, 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 Linda's so right, you know, about these kind of, you know, this is the kind of thing you see in uh, in pottery galleries, you know, in, in art galleries. This is this is a proper it's, it's a piece of art and it's a fusion of your turquoise mm -hmm. and your spiny oyster as well. It's just absolutely incredible. Well done. Go, 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 go. Well done to absolutely... Everybody. You're loving these uh, deals today. Well done. Have you got those names, Neary Nunu? Thanks, Doc. Oh, Susan, Maker on the Isle of Wight's got two. Lancashire, Valerie, Eileen, Amanda's got two. Linda, June, Kim, Angela, in-house designer, Anne. Uh, Hayley, Maker, uh, Maker, why don't you, Pam, why don't you, Pat? Um, I have to say as well, uh, with pearls, well, mm. with pearls or turquoise. Well, definitely, kind of because of the, of the spiny oyster shell, mm. um, you get that pearlescence from the shell. Of course yeah. you do. Of course you do. So, of course, it's going to go with pearls. And, of course, it's going to go with turquoise because you get turquoise in here as well. It's going to go beautifully with the next hour. Well done, everyone. Lots of people checking out. Anthony, well done to you in beautiful Pembrokeshire. Maker in Newport as well. Oh, my word. Neary, you are loving everything in the next hour. He's literally doing the best PowerPoint presentation I've ever seen in my entire life. Twenty-four ninety-nine. Last strand. Final strand. Have you put the captions on pre-order? Just in case people want those as well. We'll see whether we can. Uh, so if you do want the cabs, we're not going to have time to play them today. But one-off deal. Look at these. Oh, now these are your coral colours. Look, can you? Oh, yes. Look at that. So cool. You know when you look at a, um, the side of a, I don't know, the side of a, a cliff or something like that, and you can see the layers of rock, sedimentary rock, different uh, metamorphic rocks, stuff like that. No, oh, Neary, don't start taking the mickey. Oh, yeah, I always look at the sides of cliffs. <laughs> He's nice, isn't he? You know what I mean, don't you? I know exactly what you mean. Thanks, Linda. Yeah, absolutely. And if you watch um, programmes on TV like Gem Hunters yes. and, you know, the Australian Opal um, Hunters and that, that's exactly what they do. And they see this glint of something in that host rock. Yes. And um, that's almost it, isn't it? There's the turquoise hiding in exactly. that host rock. How, hang on, 1999. Wow. There you go. Amazing. Well done, everybody. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm so glad you enjoyed it as much as we have. It's just beautiful. We love. 
the spiny oyster turquoise. We were literally doing cartwheels this morning. The fact that we had strands of this. Never before have I ever bought you strands. It's just wonderful to make it so accessible for absolutely every jewelry maker out there. It's just gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Go, 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 go. Well done. Under 20 quid uh, for you today, making it the ultimate accessible uh, strand for you today. Well done. Now, coming up in the next hour, we have got a gorgeous masterclass. We've got shells coming out of our ears shells coming out of our shell likes it's going to be the most amazing hour we've got gorgeous kits they're all very very big they're brilliantly priced it's all about texture it's all about fashion and my word i can't wait i can't wait to see your reaction to all of these shall we see you in a couple of minutes <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Join us for the tales of Jade. This is a gemstone that has been revered for well over 4,000 years. It has been uncovered in archaeological sites dating back to the Neolithic era. Every single dynasty that has ruled over China has valued this stone above gold, and us mere mortals are never meant to own it. After visiting Myanmar in 2018 and hearing about the stories from that part of the world, from that side of the border, we wanted to bring to an event where we uncover the true tales of jadeite, steeped in folklore and mystery. This event is where you collect so you get to experience all the different varieties, all the different colors. Essentially, every jadeite we have ever acquired, that we have ever procured from the Far East, will be available for a limited time only and for the best and incredible deals. This is your chance to get your jadeite happily ever after. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. you join us this Saturday on Jewelry Maker for Rumble in the Jungle and we've got everything you would expect to see so amazing deals on amber we've got incredible animal charms animal themed kits we've got seed beads we've even got a sterling silver elephant wearing a peridot see you then on Saturday did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker.
Nuts. All hazelnut. Brazil nut. Hazelnut. Walnut. Eat it. Um, kits are on pre... Kits are on pre-order. Very unprofessional. Kits are on pre-order, and I tell you what, they are going low. They are going low. There is so much in this hour to get excited about. And oh, Linda. I think it is the weather. It, 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 it's a bit of everything. But what I love about the pieces that you've made, the texture is absolutely gorgeous. So you've got pieces like this, which are smooth and really kind of high end and demure. But then you've got pieces which look like kind of fishing Mad. net. Yeah, um, crazy. This is like it's fishing sort of net. Happy, I love it. It's what I call happy jewellery. Mm. I mean, that actually is the basis of, of something that you could do with this kit. It's crochet, which I'll quickly go through. Um, but then you could jump ring oh. gems and that through that crochet chain. Yeah. This kind of jewellery is absolutely everywhere. And wherever you look, whether it's on uh, the internet, whether it's in, in newspapers, it is absolutely everywhere. This is just like a little, a little montage of different articles mentioning this. Jewels of the Sea, why everyone's wearing shell jewellery again. This is from uh, Bustle. Uh, it says, uh, this beachy 90s jewellery trend is making a comeback this summer. At the bottom, we're still obsessed with shell jewellery and we're buying all of these. You know, this is... These are the kind of headlines that you're seeing here. Um, the next slide. <laughs> Neary wanted to put this slide. And I have to say, it is a great slide. But who knew Ariel was such an icon? <laughs> um, shell jewellery was one of last summer's biggest trends. And whilst many thought it would be a fad, the trend is definitely here to stay. It started off on the catwalk with major players on Instagram and it's now everywhere. And it really genuinely is. It's something which isn't... It doesn't... It, it, it's definitely not going away, but... Um, this is from the Metro. Um, Ocean-inspired 90s jewellery is back for season uh, uh, sp uh, spring, summer 22. Here are the pieces to shell out on. Oh, yeah. Now, um, this is a lovely pair of earrings sold uh, by Mercedes Salza. Rose Shell Tropics 190 earrings. Um, does it say how much? Oh, yes, by £52. Um, I've got that shell here. I have that very shell right here oh my gosh i love it um to the right you've got a lovely uh bracelet to the side um gorgeous that is coming in at 90 pounds for that beautiful shell uh bracelet there i mean you can find prices uh, which range massively um uh for for your shell uh pieces um we've got um yeah. So if you look, yeah. So if you look at this uh, this slide here, this t basically talks to you about who is using shell in their collection. So you've got Prada, and then you've got, and then it talks about influencers. So if you're interested in kind of social uh, um, uh, media influencers, it talks about all of these different uh, influencers who are using shell, who are wearing shell. It's one of those things because it's so natural as well. It's such a beautiful natural material. It's something which. Um, you, you, it gives you that connection to where it's from, obviously to the ocean, but it's a thing, it, you know, looking at those individual shells there, they are things of beauty. Now that necklace that Linda's made is beautiful. Look at this piece here. Look at this slide, sorry, look at this slide here. No price. Paris, Paris, shell gold plated hoop, Harvey Nichols earring, Walden, Berlin. Um, it doesn't say what the price is. I doubt very much it's going to be the price point of our kits today. Otherwise, they'd be screaming and shouting about the price point. Um, the next one here is a, I mean, this is just a silver enamel shell, uh, 62 quid. Um, and there was a lovely, uh, uh, was it a ring with all the sapphires in? Just shows you what you can do with it. Yeah, a lovely uh, ring here. That's a gorgeous piece of jewellery. It's over £2,000. It does have loads of sapphires in, but you can see the base of it is a gorgeous a gorgeous um, uh, shell. We've got so much coming up. These are going low. Okay. 
This is your first strand. Oh my gosh, you are getting countless mm, amounts of these beautiful, beautiful shell uh, ovals in this kit. The most incredible strand. Look at that, the sound that they make, the feel of them, they're gorgeous. You're getting gorgeous shell Heshi beads as well. I love a Heshi. They are just gorgeous, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Give you that wonderful size, that beautiful shirt. I love this nude kind of palette that you get here as well. I think they've worked particularly well, of course, with the pearls that we bought you earlier on with Dave. You then get this gorgeous pear pendant. Look at this. Oh, it's almost like a Marbe pearl, isn't it? Gorgeous. You can see the little pearl formation in this kind of the inside of the mollusk shell. That's, that's so, so, so clever. And then you get a load of this waxed uh, Brazilian cord. Um, which is wonderful for knotting, great for doing your crochet with, as uh, Linda said as well. It's an absolutely gorgeous kit. Love it, love it. Love it. So much you can do with this. The texture, the quality, the movement. It's absolutely um, fitting with, with the theme today as well. It's just gorgeous. Now, price point for this. Do you fancy just like a, a just a, like a, yeah, try it out kind of price point? Yeah? Look at this for a start price. Here we go, 29 pounds, 99 pence. That's a try it out price, okay? We've already got people coming through, it's great to see. Lovely material to wear, super lightweight, obviously wonderful to wear on your holidays. And if you wanted to wear it, you know, obviously in the sea, of course you can do, because of course it's, it's it, you know, that's exactly where it's from. Well done. Now look at this, I love this piece that uh, Linda's made here. Doesn't, it looks so high end, doesn't it? Love mixing it with those spacer beads. It's just gorgeous the way those Heshi beads are just kind of poking out, really, really lovely. $29.99, not your deal today. Let's get that price point all the way down for you today. Go, 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 go. Susan, Nicolette, Anne, well done to you. Pam, Valentina, Maker, well done to you as well. Oh, yes, yeah, see, absolutely gorgeous. Also, Shell is wonderful for interior design projects as well, not just for jewelry. So if you want something hanging in the garden or inside, look, I love the way you've kind of pinwheeled those gorgeous shells uh, to make them into flowers, almost like butterflies, actually. Here's your, here's your deal today, all the way down, $14.99, yes, amazing. Love that, love that, love that. That necklace that Michael's showing you there looks like fishing net net yeah. with kind of a haul of shell, yeah, I mean, doesn't it? I tried to um, be, again, inspired. I try loads of things for inspiration when I see whatever's in a kit. And obviously with shell, you think seashore. Mm. So you have to conjure up pictures of the seashore and, and then it, it, it'll work every time and basically it's just finding out the techniques then of how to put that piece together incredible yeah yeah absolutely right getting that technique to kind of uh, to kind of get that feel you can almost hear the ocean can't you it's just gorgeous love it well done loads and loads of people coming through to get these well done everybody 0800 <laughs> six triple four six double five what an incredible opportunity for you today well done go 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 absolutely superb oh look at those ear oh they're so lovely they're just gorgeous aren't they well done at just at just 14 pounds 99 pence well done everybody go 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 an amazing deal absolutely superb <laughs> It looks like a little fishy a lobster pot. I think yeah, it does, doesn't it? Like a little, like a little pot, lobster, pot. Down, lobster pot. Isn't that gorgeous? <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> go, 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 go. Well done, everybody. Just superb. Absolutely gorgeous. $14.99. Well done, everybody. Okay. Well done. There's more people still coming through. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Um, Linda, love your designs. You've inspired, uh, inspired to try working oh, with Oh, thank you. That's thank nice. you so much. I appreciate that very much. Thank you. There um, we go. Again, I can't sort of, when I first got the kits, I had to get inspiration of how to mm. turn shells into jewellery and I know it's you know it's been around on trend forever it's one of those trends that always shoots right to the top of the jewellery making trend Definitely. when it gets spring summer um, whenever you go on holiday you'll see um, the little uh, sort of seasidey shops absolutely crammed with shell jewellery mm. I mean these are all uh, these shells have all been 
um, collecting with ecology first and foremost. Of course, in absolutely. That's a really valid point. Yes, definitely. Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Right. Okay. This next kit is so big and so phenomenal. We're going to make it into a star buy. Here we go, everyone. <laughs> oh, do you know what Neary just said to me? He said, it's oyster day. He said, why didn't you dress up as an oyster today? Can you imagine that? Uh, you dressed up as an oyster. As a clam. Um... So it could be like the clam shell, and then I could just be inside it. Yeah, and I could be a mussel. Um... I have done the clam a before, scallop, haven't I, yeah. live on air? Isn't there a dance? Yes. There you go. It's a, it's a Pilates move, the clam. Mm -hmm. There we go. Let, let, oh, there's a message. Yeah, it's gone off. Well, just put it back on, love. <gasps> Linda, your jewellery should be in a gallery. Your gift to create unique jewellery is endless, oh, says Amanda. Oh, thanks, Amanda. Have you paid Thank Amanda? You. Have you sent her a cheque? Not yet, but it's on its way. <laughs> <laughs> right, this kit is gorgeous. It is huge. Uh, this is awesome. Look at uh, Just look at it. Huge. Well, this really has a lot of, um, oh, a lot of components and a lot of interest. For crafters, don't forget that you're not necessarily just, not, and I, don't, I say just very lightly, a jewellery maker. You are a crafter, essentially. Yes. So consequently... I mean, I have a cousin who does um, a lot of pottery and she sells her pottery at craft fairs all over the country. And she, um, she uses shells a lot within her pottery. They're just, it's just incredible. I've, I, I've, I've seen as well, I, what I love is um, when you get people who make, um, who like hot glue gun these onto picture frames. Exactly. And things like that. Exactly. They're so lovely. Yeah, there's a lot that you can do with it. Beautiful, look at that. With a shell. Look at this. Yeah, and it, yeah, put them in your bathroom with your soaps or in a little dish or something like that. They're gorgeous. They are phenomenal if you... <coughs> you excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. Um, They're all drilled as well. Yes, they've got a drill hole in them. Every one of them has. Yeah, look. So uh, you've also got some little bobby pins there. Yes. Which essentially, um, if I just take one of these off, you can sort of demonstrate how... That would hang. Oh! So if that goes, if that goes into the hair like that. <gasps> see if that goes wow. into the hair. We should. I think you're better at doing the demo bit than me. Here we go. Here we go, everyone. And then, <gasps> it, and if you imagine, oh. if you imagine a um, oh. French plat, a By side, the roots. a side plat around. or something. You know, you yeah. know the French plat. On the side, and then you drop them in graduation. Oh, lovely the idea, flat. yes. Um, Love that idea. So. Oh, they're so sweet. So you've got the knotted as well. You've got the gorgeous knotted. You've got this enormous orange shell as well, which is just gorgeous. And there it is. It's just all absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Look at these are gorgeous. Oh, just gorgeous. All completely natural. I love it. Oh. It's just gorgeous. All of them have got drill holes in, so don't worry, you're not going to have to worry about putting drill holes in. You know, they've all got little drill holes in, because that would be my main kind of thing, thinking, how oh, am I going to get a drill hole in that? Absolutely. Uh, but they've all got little drill holes in, which is wonderful. Well done. Twenty nine ninety nine. And made it. Look at this. Oh, that one's really knobbly and beautiful. I love what you've done here, by the way. I think that's just that's just gorgeous. Made a lovely pendant with this. It just works so well, don't they? Yeah. I mean, this one basically, I've just taken the wire through the drill hole. Yeah. And then um, just done a very random so twisting around um, the wire. And then popped a jump ring into the, the top of the wire just near the hole and then just put a gold chain on it. Um, so you can also go around the shell because the thing I like about shells is it's got so much texture within its surface. Um, and also there's so many styrations on it. Even the little tiny ones have got styrations. Yeah. So you can drag a metallic 
marker over yes. it. Yes. Or um, gold leaf. If you gold leaf something, the, the shell like that, the gold leaf would sink into those styrofoam. Yeah, how lovely. Like so this is fourteen ninety nine. Look at those earrings you're going to be getting there. Those earrings are how much were they? Sorry, 50, 50, 50 odd pounds. Um, and you're going to be getting, you're going to be getting you know that incredible size. It's just it's just incredible, um, beautiful quality. Some people use them as little um, as little um, uh, what do you call it? Um, little dishes. That one in soap and salt and pepper. Yeah, salt and pepper is a brilliant idea. I mean that one. If if I could draw and I can't. But I would use some acrylic paints and draw their tree of life in it. Or oh, try I, do a, I think with resin, certainly with epoxy resin and UV resin, you could put a seashore design in there. I love that idea. That's gorgeous. Oh, uh, what? We're not done. Oh, gosh. Okay, so we've got the knot it. You've got all of these shells. And of course, you've got the bobby pins as well. How many shells? Oh, gee, it's two, six, eight, ten. 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 50. Oh, there's about 60. <laughs> the studio, these would be fab for a beach wedding and table place settings. Yeah, says Amanda. Yes. I say, just shouting. sort of, we're a jewelry maker channel. I, I know I realise that, but. Think outside the box. It's a tenner. It's wow. a tenner. Who cares what you do with them? It's ten pounds. That's absolutely amazing. Yeah. You go to a beach shop where they sell beaches. <laughs> do you mean a shop by the beach, by the seaside, a seaside shop? Absolutely amazing. Also, I know of so many people. <laughs> I know of so many people who make little... Who make little who make little animals out of these look like yeah. this? So they get well, these yeah, are the feet and, and you use a, a and slightly flowers one on the top. as well because they're like flower petals like that. And then and, and and then you put two little eyes on it or something like that. Or <laughs> Michael's looking at me as if to say, "What is wrong with you?" You could even put some of your pearls in there, couldn't you? Totally gorgeous. <laughs> put two little googly eyes on it, make it into a little creature. No. <laughs> See what I mean? I'm like, sorry, I sorry. I, the box. I wasn't thinking that far out. All oh, right. That, that's a great idea. <laughs> Why not? Love those earrings. <laughs> Everything looks amazing with googly eyes on. Uh, I think occasionally putting googly eyes on things like uh, pieces of fruit or anything in, a, anything in a lunchbox that you give to your kids. Uh, I should have done that today, actually. My I gave both my kids an apple this morning in their lunchbox, along with other stuff. I should just put some googly eyes on the apple. <laughs> Give it a personality. <laughs> Probably wouldn't eat it. Probably no. call it call it something Cruelty. and want to keep it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, gorgeous. Do you know? Nine ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Absolutely fantastic. Go go go. Well done. Absolutely superb. Now. <laughs> Here we go. Don't say we don't bring you a whole range of things on Jewelry Maker. Okay, which one are we doing first with the butterflies on? <gasps> Can't find the matching serviettes. I've obviously left those at home. This is something I did prior to getting the kit. So basically, it's decoupage. What is this? Right, so um, with the shells, the little... Um, Little dishes, really, trinket dishes. As you've just said, they make fantastic little salt and pepper dishes for dinner They're parties. They're gorgeous. Um, and it's simply a matter um, of... What do you do? Well, if you take the plain shell over there, the plain one over this there. This one. So basically, all you do, this is the next kit, is you paint the inside of that shell with a white PVA. Yeah. With a, um, say... Two parts PVA, one part water. Yes. Okay, or if you've got anything like this, a product name, if you've got anything like Mod Podge or a uh, decoupage sealant, you just yes. paint the inside and then you separate your serviette. serviette because they serviettes come in ply, they call them ply, two ply, three ply. Yeah. If it's a two ply, it'll have two layers, or yeah. three ply, it'll have three layers. So I've layers. got one with pineapples on. Yes, so you basically do. you take the back layers, so you're just left with the top layer. Yes. Okay, and then you place that on the glue within the um, shell. 
Yes. Yes, and then you uh, cut around the perimeter. Yes. Obviously, but a quicker way of cutting around the perimeter is just slightly dampen the perimeter oh. with the fingertip of and water, you can kind of tear and it. then it'll tear and it'll get you. Yes. Glued. And then the same sealant that you've used to glue it into the shell, just put a coat of that on top. What's and this for? You can do the back. The, oh the gosh, so leaf. it's like gold leaf. Oh my gosh, it's so it's exactly sorry, the same the process. Sorry, I'll show you. Hang on, just be patient. Here we go. This is the leaf. So you could yes, actually so use that leaf on the larger shells see it? or on the little shells in the jewelry I'm kits. sorry, Linda. I was kind of half kind of going, what on earth have we got? Oh, look, it's got little feet. <laughs> oh, Linda, I love this. I've really fallen in love. I love this. I, that's amazing. Oh. Ollie and his bowl. I've fallen in love with this particular um, crafting. It's so perfect. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. They'd be really expensive. You know, I, I, mm -hmm. I've got a local, um, which this big one. Um, I've got a, um, a, 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 like an interior design shop called Bonds near where I live. And it's brilliant. But my work, these would sell for an absolute fortune. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I'm sorry, Linda. I had no idea what this. I thought, why have we got a load of napkins? And what, what's going on? I totally get it. This is a gorgeous shell. Oh, yeah, it's a scallop shell, isn't it? It's yeah. It's, isn't it beautiful? Mm. Um, uh, this is awesome. Look at that leaf as well. Isn't that just gorgeous? Isn't that beautiful? I and mean, it's the same process with the leaf. Just a, a very you know, a uh, moderate layer of adhesive and then just touch the leaf That's onto. It's just gorgeous. Look at all um, the time I've got some on my hands now. It, it, do, do be prepared for gold leaf will travel. Yes, oh yes, in, any in kind any. of draft. Yeah. Yeah. Um, a book of gold leaf and the rest of the kit for that price. I know, it's amazing. Seven ninety nine. Um, That is incredible. Yeah, gold leaf is not something, you know, oh gosh, it's on my arm. Oh, it's everywhere. It's a, oh no, it's on the you desk. You see my kitchen oh. floor. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, fine, fair enough. Linda, these are these are gorgeous. I love this. Absolutely flying out the door. I love this. Oh. Do you know what? I I'm I'm literally. I just want to um, I want a gold leaf. I want to I want to make these. I love these. Make great Christmas presents, yeah, won't yeah. they? Don't you yeah. think? I mean, you can make them um, specifically for the room in the house you want one. So in the bedroom, you can have those little trinket dishes. Yes, for earrings, I mean, rings. For earrings, and, yeah, things like that. Then you always know where they are. Or you can make them specific to... Um, I've got one here, actually. Great, probably be, great gift for, like, um, a, a bride or a bridesmaid or something. His and hers. Yeah, that's... Wedding favours. That's the scallop dish. Oh, gosh, that's... Gorgeous! She's got all sorts in there. And that would be for like, um, with a little bit of glitter glue. Look at this! On the top. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. But they do what make... What else have you got in that bag? <laughs> it's a magic bag. It's amazing, Linda. That's just a... Okay, final kit. Uh, it's this one here. This has already got a most beautiful shell. It's an abalone shell. Isn't it? Oh, look at this. <gasps> I mean, both sides of it are absolutely... That's I mean, those are the little exquisite. breathing that holes. To do with something, the how old, something to do with how old it is, I'm pretty sure, I think. It probably like is. You're probably right. Going, like yeah, all the air chains, tree. like a nautilus. Yeah. Look, Look at the inside, the inside of it. Oh! Maybe best not to use the gold leaf whilst the fan is on. Yes, I know. <laughs> definitely. I know. Yeah. Yeah, that definitely. Is, I might not do anything to that, but yeah, that is gorgeous. Okay, seven ninety nine. I That is bonkers. That might just be worth doing the, the other side, perhaps. I mean, that is equally as beautiful, the other side. But if I was sort of really stumped for choice on which side to decorate, I'd do the flip side. Yes, yes, yes. I think mm. you're absolutely... Oh, but look at that. It's, it's almost a shame, isn't it? Mm. It's beautiful. Oh, these kind of, like, wisps going... Oh. It is beautiful, isn't it? I love that. That is absolutely superb. Well done, everybody. That is just superb. Go, 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 go. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, right, uh, what are you going to demo for us, lovely? Oh, look at that gold leaf. I love it. Just gorgeous. Well, with going back to the jewellery, um, if I, because uh, I mentioned crochet, I did demo this the other week, so I apologise if um, you've seen this recently from me, but that particular necklace there is from the kit that's obviously got the gold Mm. Uh, lurex in which can be a standalone necklace it can be as long or as short as you want it to be or you can attach 
gemstones or any beads, pearls, whatever, or even the shells via jump rings. Mm -hmm. um, the one I used with the silver, I mixed, it was like a double whammy. I've put the oval shells to it and also I've put some um, plated chain. So the crochet is just creating a chain, basically, mm. and then go from there. So um, to begin, the way I've always crocheted, there is, um, there is a, a new way of starting off called a magic circle, which I haven't quite worked that one out yet. I keep, and it keeps coming apart, so I'm ditching that for now. <laughs> so all I do is do an over finger knot. So I'm bringing that end through, and don't pull it all the way through. You've just got to get that inner loop and then pull onto the crochet. Okay. So that's, your, that's your stitch. Most of uh, times with crochet, the benefit I find with crochet against knitting is knitting, I get a little bit confused because I've got hum you know, a mega amount of stitches on my needle, but basically I'm only ever really dealing with one main stitch on my crochet hook and the rest of it is just going to be pulled through. Yeah. So to start off um, a crochet chain, just knot it on, as I've just shown you, and then it's take your crochet hook with a point, sorry, with that sort of little hook underneath, have that hook facing you, catch, turn the crochet hook to the side, catching the thread and pull through. This is called a chain stitch. So if you see any crochet patterns and it says start off with 53 chain, it's 53 of this. So I'm holding, as you can see, I'm holding the excess between my middle finger and thumb. And then I, with my index finger, I'm creating that line in order to go underneath, yeah. turn the crochet hook to the side, catch that loop and pull it through. Again, pull it through and just keep doing that until you have the designated amount. Yeah. Now, obviously, um, I'll just carry on a little while. So Go under, it, catch, and through. Under, catch it, and come through. Don't have your tension overly tight. You'll have a job, particularly with the Lurex thread, of pulling it through the stitch on, on the hook. Yeah. So don't have your tension overly tight because you do need it to be able to stretch and slip through. Yeah. So just keep doing that for as long as you need. Um, if it's a neckline piece, you could have it as a long necklace or as in the case of the gold mm. one, um, a five or six strand. In that particular one, all the strands I did the same length. Um, with the the silver Lurex design, I just did it probably an inch, I think it was only an inch longer. I did two strands of crochet, uh, one being about an inch longer than the other. It's just to create some um, sort of not overly structured. It's supposed to, as Carol very prolifically put it, a bit like a fishing net design, you know, when you see them hanging out across the sides of boats and things. So you just continue doing until you've got... Now, effectively... If oh, it's you, lovely. You've got that. You've got a, a chain. So you have got links there made from, um, from your thread. And when you finish that off, just take uh, a pair of scissors and then about three or four inches um, from the uh, crochet hook, yeah. just simply... Cut that off, then take this residue over the hook again, bring it through, and then take your hook off and simply pull. And that will not unravel, I promise you. Mm -hmm. Okay? What I didn't say was when you start the crochet, give yourself uh, at least the same amount of residue on the beginning part of the, uh, the strand as well. About between three and four inches is good because at this point in time, under normal jewellery making uh, circumstances at home, I wouldn't have thought what sort of a clasp I'm going to put onto that. So yeah. that gives me a bit of opportunity to knot it on um, or to create um, a coil to, to then jump ring that onto a clasp. Yeah. So give yourself the opportunity of, um, 
of that rather than cutting it short and then you're sort of limiting the chances of what you want to do to put a clasp on. So you just do numerous um, strands, as many as you want. And then I've taken these gorgeous ovals and a normal head pin. I mean, if you have a variety of head pins, this is a T head pin. It's got the little flat mm. uh, stopper on. But if you've got the little bobble ones, if you've got the ones with the, um, the larger, um, like this one here, larger so if you've got a variety oh, okay. of yeah. head pins mm -hmm. then mix don't particularly uh, use all the same one it just creates more interest if you just put them into like a head pin soup yes, yes and just use them so all you have to do is pop the head pin through the hole so that the end is acting as a stopper on the shell itself yeah. and then holding the shell at the back resting it on your index finger is just bringing it the head pin upright so it stands upright and then again going back to my favorite uh, loop scenario is taking your flat nose pliers right on top of that shell oval and getting the head pin as close as you can and then just pushing it into a 90 degree angle chopping off a residue at about a centimeter yeah and then again as i showed you earlier is just making a simple loop and edging that round so that the loop actually kisses the top of the shell. So you just need to make, you could do this with any of the shells in the kits because they've all got holes in them. Yes, of um, course you can, yeah. And then you can go straight for it because these are simple loops, you can go straight for it and attach the loop directly onto a link of your crochet. So open the link, pop it through a loop of the crochet and then close it again, putting my pliers back on that closure to compress it. Or you can open a jump ring. So literally open a jump ring towards you and then you can slip it on to the simple loop that you've made. This will create more of a... It's probably a good idea, actually, to do um, straight on through the, your simple loop onto the crochet uh, chain and then occasionally putting one on with a jump ring because then you create another level of interest. So that drops See. down. There's another level of interest there. It's texture, isn't it? That's yeah. what it is. Yeah, and the more you get on there... Uh, the more random you are with it, you can yes, just do it better. all sort of central or all the way up. It's entirely up to you. Um, and then uh, put your clasp on. You can tie. This is, uh, it's got like a waxed finish, so mm. it, will, it will knot beautifully. So you could just knot that onto a jump ring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sort of take Definitely. Around and pop it through. Because it's got this waxed finish, then it will hold the knot brilliantly. So just tie that on and then you can pop your clasp onto that either end. Um, and then just sort of create another length and decorate it with the shell or whatever you want to decorate it with in exactly the same place on the fresh strand so that it all, um, it all tumbles over one another. Yes, I like that. Um, and you've got your different lengths. You can lengthen them either via the jump rings or using um, eye pins mm. to sort of create more and more drops um, but just just experiment this is this is the thing about any craft any creative crafting is um, so lovely having a you know an attempt at, at uh, a picture that you've got in mind or look for some inspiration and that and then uh, creating it in your in the best way you know how absolutely say i am such a big uh, believer in um just trying to create something outside of the norm because let's face it if you go to a craft fair and you see um jewelry craft stands and that you know you want to be a little bit different mm. you want to stand out from the crowd a little bit so you'll be surprised how people will sort of home in on you because it looks different looks a bit more interesting mm. and that is you know a way to draw them in but um 
You can also, as I did with the little bracelet, that macrame, the little bracelet, where I've just simply used... The Heshies. The, yeah. Mm. Used the, um, the Heshi shell beads yeah. um, and the silver... Cord. Cord. Yeah. To do your usual so nice. um, macrame. And I've just added a few of the um, size 8... It really elevates the look of it, though, doesn't it? It's nice. Yeah, it's quite a it's quite a boho friendship bracelet, yes. isn't it? Look, isn't it isn't just? It? Yeah. yeah, yeah, gorgeous. Um, it's it's right. not just about the way that it looks; it's about the way that it feels, the way it sounds as well, because that jewelry is going to yeah. sound beautiful. It's a very tactile um, medium as well. It shells. It absolutely yeah. is, especially when you start mixing it up with you know, your seed beads, your spacer mm -hmm. beads, your precious metal, and then, of course, your gorgeous cord as well. It's just beautiful. Um, right, with presumably these... Presumably, these are for this? These... Well, it can be with the jewellery as well, on the on any of the shells, whether they're tiny ones or okay. whether they are um, the so larger ones. The Posca pens are amazing, so you can use them to decorate your shells. On all the shells, they'll all have little anon anonymous, anomalies. Anomalies. That's a word you can't say easy when you've had a drink. Um, but they'll all have little um, sort of spots within the shell. Yes, little absolutely. Ups and downs. And almost, almost all the time, you'll get your stripes. Yes, um, following course. the shape of the shell and the edges of the shells as well look fantastic when you simply just touch the shell you're not painting on it as such you're just touching those little um sort of yeah the yeah, ridges, ridges undulations the, that's it undulations in the shell just touching it with the side of a metallic marker. So you're getting eight of these markers. They're all sparkly, so they're, so they're going to give you the sparkle. Uh, so sparkly uh, purple, blue, green, etc., etc., etc. They are absolutely gorgeous. I've used these, um, the same brand, with um, uh, chalk-based, and they're absolutely superb. They are brilliant. Oh, these have got quite a fine tip on them as well, so you could get that mm -hmm. lovely detail on them should exactly. you want to do that. Exactly, um, which is what I was saying about, you know, that larger... Um, the larger shell. Yes. Um, you know, that orange shell that, that we showed. Of course, the yes, yes, yes. But you can use these to paint a scene in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, you were saying that. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, which is just gorgeous. Um, yeah, so you're going to be getting, and, and they do last a long time. They, you don't, and, and, as, and as Linda says, you need to use just literally the tiniest amount of these. They're £19.99. pence. Absolutely brilliant. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, I've got to show you some of the things we've got coming up tomorrow as well, which is going to be really exciting. But before we do that, uh, we're going to do a start by, did you say, lovely? We're going to go straight into it. Oh, is it all of it? Oh, gosh, it's all of it. Wow. Got it. Sorry. Got it. Got all of it. Hang on. No, they're genuine pearls. You don't get genuine pearls of this, do you? What? Oh my gosh, yeah, you get genuine. Oh wow, three strands of genuine freshwater cultured pearls, a load of shell, and then you're going to be getting the gorgeous, massive um, shell kind of uh, um, spirals as well, which are absolutely gorgeous. All of that today. Um, you know, this is something which Linda's mentioned a few times today about mixing, mixing up the same gemstone to create that uh, statement jewellery and how effective it can be. That works so beautifully, uh, doesn't it? Whether you're using uh, genuine freshwater cultured pearls alongside your shell or even your shell pearl or, you know, whatever it might be. Um, so lovely to mix it up and make that big statement piece. Valentina, Andrea, Jamati, well done to you, my lovely makers coming through. Well done. Okay. Launched at this price here. Here we go, my lovelies. Oh, lovely, lovely texture. Great recording. $39.99, that's where we launched Maker in Newport. Well done to you, Andrew in Nottinghamshire. Well done to you. $39.99, not your deal. Nicolette, well done to you as well, my lovely. Maker in County Antrim as well. Absolutely fantastic. Here we go. $39.99. Come on, come on, Neary. Come on, Neary. We are going to go low. Three strands of genuine fresh water culture pearls and then all of the rest. Yeah, amazing. Ready? Lynn, Rita, Anna. Are you sure you want to do this, Neri? Are you sure you're going to do this? Oh, gosh. We are taking this way, 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 way below what it would cost us to source this now. Here's an opportunity. 
Your deal today, £19.99. Wow. Oh, my word. That is amazing. Seven strands. Can I just say, if the deal was £19.99 for these three... Mm -hmm. If £19.99 was a price point for these three strands of pearls, that would be absolutely amazing, wouldn't it? Absolutely incredible. Yeah? Incredible. Amazing. But it's not just that. You're getting another one, two, three, four strands as well. Literally doubling the size, of, over doubling the size of this bundle. Maria, Mary, Mar uh, another Marie coming through. Uh, well done to you, my lovely. Um, Pam, Merseyside, uh, Caroline, Worcestershire, Joyce, Marilyn, Beatrice. Well, that, that, is, that is way below cost price on us. I mean, it, we the, just literally um, cannot. These shells here, the oh, both the gorgeous. of those. Mm. Well, obviously they drill hold because they're on a strand. Mm. But if you put your thread through the drill holes with about four or five of them mm. and then pull them together, you get like a rose because you can see, oh. you can see how that would form. Yes. The like well, they do pearl. look. These two here kind of tessellate, mm. tessellate like that. You're together so right. Like a, like a rose. You're, you're so right. Mm -hmm. They really do, don't they? Uh, they're gorgeous. Well done. Oh, look, yeah, look, these ones are doing it as well. Look, literally just kind of tessellating mm -hmm. together like that. They work really beautifully, don't they? Beatrice, Mer oh, well done, everyone. Absolutely fantastic. Nineteen ninety nine for all seven strands that you're going to be getting here. That's absolutely incredible, isn't it? Well done, Sandra, uh, Maker in Dumfries. Well done to you, Maker in Hertfordshire, Claire in Lincoln, Sandra. Well done to you, Chris, Elaine, Jacqueline. Well done to you. Go, 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 go. £19.99. Well done for three strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls and then another four strands of shell. That's absolutely brilliant. Well done. Go, 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 go. Well done. Now, we did bring you as your early bird special um, today your two lots of... Silk alike. So this is uh, an amazing threading material. You get 60 meters on each spool. We're going to do the black um, one first. We're going to replay the black one first, which is um, an amazing material. Basically like a silk that you would do your pearl knotting with. However, <laughs> it's like silk, but it's not silk. It's vegan friendly. It's man-made, uh, which is great because it means you can, um, if you want to seal it, you absolutely can do. It's described as the best quality American-made beading cord. Uh, synthetic fibers are stronger as they're made of three strands of long fiber, not just two. It won't stretch, which a lot of silk does, or stain, and it will resist fraying and shredding, which, of course, is what happens to silk sometimes, and ideal for stringing pearls and beads. Not to mention, is you get 60 metres of it on one, on one spool, but so you can make those metres and metres and metres if you want to make those really big long line pieces. Um, it's gorgeous. It's got a bit of a waxed, kind of a, kind of a waxed uh, finish on it, so... The finish that you will get on this is absolutely wonderful. It's, uh, you can literally cut, cut the end off there and use it as a needle. Uh, whereas with the silk that we bring you, uh, you do tend to need to use um, the needle which is loaded onto the cord, uh, so, sorry, onto the silk already. But this is gonna be much, much easier to use. Um, and it's nice to give people the option. So if you are doing a bridal commission, say, look, I can make you that pearl necklace with genuine natural silk and it's this price, or I can do it with silk alike and you know, the price point obviously comes down. It's just great to be able to have 60 metres, as you said, to that practice. Black one second. Of course, you can, darling. Let's just see whether. But as you were saying, to be able to practice your pearl mm. knotting with. Well, this would be absolutely. It's a gift. I, I'm just going to chop that little end yeah, off. Go you for always it. get that, no matter what sort of uh, cord you have, uh, fabric type of cord. That's so good. Um, but look, you, and then if you just drag your nail down there, um, or even, even just pop on. Um, yes, use your, use your um, flat nose, flat -nose pliers, pliers just to flatten that wax a little bit. So that's You're going to get so much more chance. Let me just pop that off again there because I, yeah. I messed that up. It's with, amazing, uh, the isn't it? Look of at it. That. But, but if you just press that, like, you, well, I always do that on wildfire as well because that's waxed. Yes. Press that down. You've got far more chance now of getting that flat exactly. cord through the eye of the needle. Exactly. That's um, exactly it. You can always put the tiniest amount of glue mm. on that first inch as well. Well, we had somebody to, a, a message in saying really yeah. carefully they use a lighter and they and they melt the end of it, but not so it balls up, but just really gently melt yeah. it and then they form it with their hands in, into a needle. Yeah, it's absolutely. It's so, so easy. Absolutely. Um, so that was six ninety nine. The white one is here, um, exactly the same, but just in white. Six ninety nine as well. Absolutely flying. Well done. Uh, what is the thickness of the size two? It's point three far. No. Point, point three two, I think it is. Point three two. We'll double check, but I think it's point three two millimeters in thickness. One point, 
Yeah, 0.35 millimetres. Uh, there we go, 0.35 I mean, millimeters. this is ideal thread for um, shells, particularly like shells like Mother of Pearl, um, because it's got that little bit of texture to it with yes, the wax finish. Yes, nice. It's absolutely ideal. Um, and, it, and it will also give you, um, when you do your pearl knotting with this, it will give you this kind of effect of your pearl knotted piece, i.e. that swag, that drape, that kind of fluidity that you want to get with your pearl, um, uh, with your knotted pearl pieces. But absolutely gorgeous. £6.99, well done to you. Go, 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 go. Now, I must just show you what we've got coming up tomorrow. Tomorrow is Rumble in the Jungle. Uh, your... This is gorgeous. Your early bird special is this beautiful leaf bracelet set into sterling silver. That's gorgeous. Look at this. I Absolutely gorgeous. Is it, aren't, aren't they lovely, beautiful fern shapes that you're going to be getting here? They're just gorgeous. So that's going to be your beautiful um, uh, uh, early bird special. Uh, you've also got the chance to get these gorgeous elephant beads, which I love. Look. Oh, they're gorgeous. Isn't he lovely? There's your drill hole going through the centre there, so through the front. Oh, there we go, aren't they gorgeous? But this is the piece I really love. Linda, I think you're going to love this too. It's a bracelet. I love this. Oh, yeah. Isn't that adorable? It's like a parent and child or a guardian and a, and a, and a, and a little one. It's just, it's just gorgeous. And that's going to be coming up tomorrow. I'm definitely going to be getting some of these. I love them. They're so pretty, aren't they? They're just, and it's all sterling silver, which is great. So that's going to be coming your way tomorrow and rumble in the jungle day. That's going to be gorgeous. When are you next with us, lovely Linda? Um, the 18th. There we go. Which is next Thursday, I think. That's with me. Yay! So the 18th, lovely Linda's back with you. Um, I'm back with you on Sunday. We've got the most amazing, amazing, amazing show, which is going to be incredible. Uh, you've got Blue John coming up tomorrow. Brand new Blue John. Blue John pendulums, I Ooh. think I heard somebody say as well, which is going to be very exciting. Well, you've got fastest finger first on that because I know I was on the launch of Blue John recently. It was amazing, wasn't it? And it just it? went out the door in a heartbeat, didn't it? Oh, yeah, most definitely. Mm -hmm. And you've got uh, Azataza with you tomorrow as well, which is going to be loads of fun. So you've got Alison uh, your, uh, as your guest designer tomorrow which is going to be absolutely brilliant we've got Susie on Sunday so it's going to be a jam-packed uh, full weekend but do make sure you join us uh, for Rumble in the Jungle it's going to be the most incredible show and we've got Tales of Jade coming up on Sunday as well uh, which is going to be amazing with that beautiful dove grey jade as well which is which we're really excited about I love all these stunning silver pieces loving this little bracelet which is coming up tomorrow he's so lovely he's always oh, upside down there we go Beautiful little elephant bracelet, like a mother and child. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? So, yeah, that's all going to be coming up tomorrow. Do make sure that you join us. Thank you very much for joining us for OIS today. That was absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much, Linda. Thank what you, a Carol. great show. We'll see you the other side of this for a fantastic afternoon with David, the team on Hobbymaker. <laughs>